Hi guys. It's Friday. Let's start the train, Yay. Booba. Oh, sorry. Good. Good mic cover. Good mic cover. Yeah. Woo. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome in to the fabled end of Heaven Sword stream. Wear hair gone. Cut it off, mate. Cut it off in it. In a meeting right now, but booba. Jesus. Yo. Yo. Hello, hello. I'm fresh. I'm ready for Stormblood, baby. Dr. Marks. Bahi. Nah, 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 nah. Focus on here. Focus on me, okay? You're a poopy head. F-R-I-A. When we spell it out, you're a poopy head. Bahi? What the hell? What the goddamn hell? Looks like Summer Russ. I decided. We'll dress up for the special stream, but I can't do shirt, bow tie, and suspenders again, right? So I'll go for the game show host look. Step right up to Stormblood. Crutch cam. This will be a good uh, chest cam, yeah. Yeah. Too excited for the storm that is Stormblood? Look, it's blood red, okay? I got my red tiger shirt going on. Good night out at the trailer park. Yeah! <laughs> I'm not wearing the maid outfit. That would break the immersion, you know? We're not, it's not like we're killing a, a raid boss or anything. Heaven's uh, Ward. Oh. I feel like now we need to shuffle it. Uh, uh, now we need to shuffle into this. Yeah, there we go. Guys, today is going to be a good day. Stop leveling up the hype train. Okay, I haven't done anything yet. We haven't even finished Heaven's... Pardon me. We haven't even... Fin we haven't even finished Heaven's Sword yet, okay? You can save it for later. All right? No, no early hype trains to store me. Look, that means I'll, I'll be later getting into the content. Although I do have about 45 minutes to kill. So I'm going to come to the guild for a bit. We're going to go to OC. Um, Probably just go to Ravana again. Why not, right? Yay! I think this is my overall favorite song. It's just so chill, man. It's so chill. Too late. It's already level two. All right, well, we're going to leave it at two, okay? Guys, hi. I hope everyone's having a good Friday. WC Direwolf, thank you for re-subbing 49 minutes before the start of the You hate trains, so here's money directly into your wallet. Who was that? Anonymous? Who was that? I'm in two minds about it because you're still spending money, but I will give you credit. You did not level up the height trade at all. <laughs> cool. Who is anonymous? Who is? <sighs> I see you. I'm watching you anonymous. I, I see you. I see you. Okay. Oh, we were supposed to level it up. No, no. We we're supposed to keep it down till later. All right. Well, I mean, no. And there it is, 15 minutes know? and 29 seconds, and How I've got a tiny know? dick already. Alice, stop cheering, okay? Stop riling them up, all right? Bossenbergen, how could you? Oh my God, you're at 977, baby. We're closing in, we're closing in. Boston, thank you for the 10 gift subs to Purple, to Not Funny 69 That is quite funny, actually. To Don't Ping Me, it would be so funny if you ping them. To Squishicus, to Dopaminergic, to Crasta, to Prickolo, to Unam, to Selenari, to Thorgash. Boston Bergen? How do they know? <laughs> thank you for the 10 gift subs. Appreciate you. Tiny pee pee train. Yay! Closing on in. Real real close. Real close. What's up, Nathaniel, man? Lost the streak. Look, it's all good. Sora? Look what you did. Surfing beard? Look Hello what you games. also did. Let's pump today. Let's go. Yeah, boy. All right. This is the calm before the storm, okay? 
He didn't ask us to stop leveling the high train. I'm pretty sure that's exactly what I asked you to do. To, to not do. To do, I asked you to stop leveling it. I asked you not to level it. Tongue, Russ, just Russ. Who is that? Storm with, the, with, with blood, perhaps. Yeah, exactly. Storm with blood? Today, guys, we might get to see the trailer for the first time. Streaking for Stormblood. That's a 90 streak, Nathaniel, man. Look. Sometimes streaks got to come to an end. Sometimes it's a bug on Twitch's end. Sometimes people got shit to do. And that's fine. That's completely respectable. All right. Now you just got to build the streak. Now the best thing is about it. You get to build the streak again. You know, you get to build it back up. Anonymous gift the thing. Give it a gift sub to offline underscore sad before the stream. Don't know who that was. Anonymous, I got my eye on you. Also anonymous, potentially a different anonymous, potentially the same anonymous. Thank you for the $30 as well. Appreciate that you didn't level up the train, okay? Good job. Good job. Also, thank you. Also, don't know who you are, but I do appreciate the support. Thank you. Tongue, thank you for the gift sub to 278 underscore. 278 underscore. Okay. Okay. What What does that mean? <laughs> Wait, was that directed at someone 278 in the chat? Or was that just a random sub to 278? 278. What does that mean? Also, Dr. Marks, thank you for the gift sub to... Uh, sorry, no. Actually, thank you for the resub for eight months. Thank you very much. Let's start the train. Yay! Fahi, thank you for the eight months as well. Welcome back. Tongue, thank you for the gift sub to Estinian Wormblood XIV. Yo. Estinian Wormblood XIV. Feels good, man. Welcome in. Welcome in. They actually have a Dawn Trail plate as well. Boston, thank you for the 10 of subs. Sora, thank you for the two gifts of subs to uh, Jim Jiminy and Zamir's. Uh, also, Surfing Beard, thank you for the 10 months resub. Tongue, thank you for the gift sub to Russ Just Russ. All right, are we good, guys? Are we all good? What's going on, Pyrogloves? What's going on, Wakalama? Shall I do the Alus? I think it's about that time. Level five, I went downstairs to get a Pepsi. What happened? Some people just can't even keep it in their pants for 10 minutes. Can they, guys? No, it was my 278th gift sub. Oh, that makes sense. That makes sense. I missed you too, Solitaire. Are there any non-subs here? What's up, Thomas OB? Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back. How are we doing, man? Uh, right. Let me do the Alus. Let me do the Alus, okay? How are we doing today? Elixir Mari, Dragon Frezza, Tombury Kev, Hell Evap. We have a Devil Bird, Bumble Beaver, Alice Wreath, Cianidi. Who is that? Dignity. Sora. Why Thank you for the gift sub to Thomas Ob. Okay, all right. We can let that one go through. That's a that's a direct snipe for non ads. No ads today. I'm gonna. Oh, by the way, I'm gonna really try and keep the ads like scheduled where there's no content, you know what I mean? So we're going to try and be on top of it. Let me know before there's going to be big cutscenes and stuff so I can make sure there's going to be no ads. I can turn off alerts and things. That should be all good. Hi, Loon. Hi, Solitaire. Thank you for that. Welcome back in, Thomas OB. How are we doing, man? What's going on? Uh, Cianidi, what's going on? Vossenbergen, Rafadam, Cafe Spindle, Dr. Marks 87. We have Mean Cupcake, Mutant for Hire. We have Opus Man 99 and Rivflow and Tunkneev and Dula Peep and Genesee J and Hurricane Red. Genesee, I remember your YouTube comment. I remember your YouTube comment saying about how one day you'd like to make it to an event. Well, today, today we're going on OC. For that exact precise reason, like Vera and I also said, OC means that you guys from NA can actually come on over. If there's a, I don't know what the actual plan is. Don't tell me. Don't tell me anything. But if it's anything like the end of a Realm Reborn, you know, there's going to be some kind of um, s spot, I suppose. So um, yeah, you're gonna you can bring your bring your characters over and stuff, right? Exactly, Veronai. Exactly. Um, what is going on, Hurricane Red? Hello, Nerve, Boveman. What's going on? Uh, uh, I said hi to Fahi, I think. What's on up, Renona1? Welcome back. Hello, Malbar. All right, guys. I think I think it was sending off. This song is also... It is. It is. All right. We're good. Ask us to leave America temporarily. Temporarily. Okay. Is a cat go allowed to meet Russ's aura? Of course, Wonini. Of course. Of course. Of course. Of course. Of course. All right. Guys, also, by Trange, I respect you kept it to a minimum. I respect you kept it to a minimum. Okay. Hell yeah. Boston, 
I got my eye on you. I got my eye on you. Thank you, everybody, for the gift subs and the resubs. Appreciate you all. Appreciate you all. All right. Um, right. Dr. Marks, hello. How are we doing? What's up? Uh, let's see. Hold on. Hold, 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 hold. Rocky Ham. Welcome in. In a meeting. Hopefully, she'll be done soon. Azuri, hello, hello, what's going on? Woanini, welcome in. What's going on at Veranai? Hello, Cheese Commander. What's up? What's up? What's up? We have Symphonian Rhapsody, Para Gloves, Mintia Star Song, Kotomi. We have um Hold Zavolo. Rousey. I'm I'm Russi or Russ or Russell, if you want to be extremely formal with me. I haven't I haven't had anyone call me my uh, actual name in a very long time. I think my parents maybe call it call me it sometimes. But yeah, I changed my name in uni. I changed it at like when I was like 18. Mino Shin, what's going on? Hello, what's up Cryfos? Uh Alice Wreath, we have uh, uh Nathaniel Man. We have Surfing Beard in here. We have uh Hold Wako Lama. Thomas O B. All right, sure. We'll just let it shuffle through this. We're gonna jump in the game real quick. I'm not gonna stay on full cam too much. I just want to do the alus, right? So, if chuck an alu in the chat if you didn't already, all right, and I will read your name out. If I don't, you can give you can call me a bad streamerman, all right, all right, because uh, I'm almost done. I'm actually catching back up on the chat here. Okay, we have Loon, we have Solitaire, we have Zreek. Hello, Zreek. How are we doing, man? Uh, I'm scrolling, I'm scrolling, I'm scrolling fast now, guys. Tombury Kev, hello, what's up, Nesciente? Hello, Takunin. You're all good, you're all good. Takunin, hopefully, uh, it's going to be a decently long stream, I think, today, because we got a lot to get through. we got patch and a bit, I guess. Uh, you know, and celebrations, cutscenes, uh, whatever happens, whatever happens, right? Germantis, what's going on, Suspect Putis? Hello, hello, hello. All right. I think I said hi to everyone that I've seen. Talula as well. Hello, hello, hello. Didn't I lose in chat? Stop looking at me, Mino. I'll never stop looking at you. All right. Right. Let me move this on over here. Let's get into the game. All right. We're not going to start the actual MSQ until... Um, until uh, like an hour into the stream or so. But I'm going to go... I'm going to get over to OC. I'm going to swing by the guild super quick. Super quick. We might check five plates. And then we're going to head to the quest giver and uh, be ready, right? So that we can get, get into position. What's going on, Stormcrow? Hello, hello, hello. Let me open up the game real quick. How are you all doing today? Anyway, guys, how was the live letter? I didn't watch it myself because I want to avoid spoilies. Um... I had Preacher's chat open a little bit so I could just see if people were pogging out or not, you know? Um, but it seemed like there was a lot of people pogging out at a lot of stuff. So that sounds pretty good. That sounds pretty good. What was the focus of the live letter today? Was it systems? Was it like small things or what? Hi, Cozy Rosie. Hi, Freelancer. How are we doing? How are we doing? MSQ. Oh, God. Uh... All right. We'll just meet that. We'll just meet that. Woo! Okay, sweet as. Whew. Yeah, what was the uh, thing? Dawn Tale content and system updates. That sounds like a good one then, yeah? I assume it's still going on for a little bit, which is like, I was sat here like stalling the start of the stream intentionally, intentionally delaying the start of the stream today, guys. I know you're going to say liar or whatever. What's up, Cami Winters? Hi. Um, but I was just sat behind my desk waiting because I was like, surely like it'll it'll end or at least it'll slow down or something. Sure, sure, sure. Any watch the trailer? Uh, I did not. I, I'm saving the trailer. I'm saving the trailer. Uh, right. Start. We've got to transfer over to OC. Okay. I'm going to make a little pin message about no spoilers. I'm going to say that we're on Oceana. Um... Let's go in here. Oh, wait, no. We don't even need to log in, do we? Uh, visit another data center. I think I saw... Uh... Hi, Colleen. How's it going? How's it going? How are we doing on Friday? Did I see Fenrir in the starting soon screen? Hi, Fenrir. If you're lurking, hello, hello. Right. Um, Materia. We're going to go to... 
We'll go to Ravana like usual so people don't get confused. Because I go to Ravana quite often. If I just say on OC, people might just instinctively go Ravana. So we'll do that. And I'm going to make a little pin message. And uh, let me see here. OC now? Yeah, I think so, right? It just makes sense to go there as early as possible. So we'll just do a small... We'll go to Limsa. Small little guild outing on OC. So I can see everyone's characters and stuff. And then we will... Um... And then we'll head on over to... I'm not sure which quest I got up to, to be honest. So we'll get there. Yeah. Wait, Oceana, what's happening? What? Yeah, we're going to go to Oceana because it's the like end of expansion, right? And uh, people might want to come show up somewhere in game or something. I don't know. Um, but in case that's a thing, we'll go to OC. Like, I don't really mind doing MSQ with a like, slight bit more ping, you know what I mean? Right, let me do a little message because then people can bring their NA characters and their mains and stuff. And some people on the like Heaven Sword YouTube video and things were like, oh, yeah, sucks that I couldn't come to this thing, you know. Um, so, yeah, just doing it on OC because we can, you know what I mean? Currently showing that we get a separate item slot for fashion accessories. Oh, yeah, like um, like glasses and stuff. Great freelancer. Yeah, I heard about that. I'm not sure how or when. I'm at work. You're all good, Sora. If you're working, you're working. This stream's gonna go on a bit, so there's still, you know, chance that people can come come out and stuff. NA gets to meet Russ in game. Yay! Exactly, exactly. Yeah, Cammy, you can come along. Right, Ravana, let me do a little pin message. Uh doing MSQ on OC servers. Ravana. Come. Uh, feel free to come over as usual. Please, no spoilers in chat. No fun facts or foreshadowing. Just if he asks questions, just shrewsh. Or stare. All right. Does that work? Nice. Pin message until the end of stream. All right, sweet. You think people read? No, but there might be like a 5% people like five percent of people might read it so you know we'll see we'll see it might be a few a couple more than if i didn't put a pin message you know what i meant fun fact russ is cute you can do like you can do meme fun facts just nothing about story or anything like that that's the the main point is i'm trying not to get anyone like who makes me think a certain way about a certain thing which will like give something away or trigger my brain into thinking something, you know what I mean? Can we blah? You can blah. Yes, you can shrewd, you can stare, or you can blah. Yep. Fun fact, the story of Heaven Sword is mid. I mean, we've come to that conclusion before, you know? All right, let's jump in here. Ooh, gritty. Grid gang. God, I love Gridania. Cammy! We arrived at the same time. Oh, were you waiting for me? Oh, dude, and I get to be my aura today. Get to be my aura today for the end of the Heaven Sword. Feels good, man. Fun fact. Blah. Fun fact. We might be cooking today. We might be cooking today. Yeah, I hope so. I, I'm I'm hoping there's going to be a lot of cool shit going on. Riv Flow has arrived. You know what? I'm going to stand here for a second. I'm going to see you all like coming on, on in. Yippee. Thank you, Cammy. Right, let me use up this. Does anyone want some sweet cream milk or step milk? Wait, what the hell is step milk? Yeah. Hi, Aria. Oof. She's kind of cute. That's a cute cat girl. Come, Mr. Tallyman. Tally me banana. Summoner deserved better. Oof. Gigantify an emote. What the hell is this? Wow! <laughs> What the hell is that? <laughs> Hi, Wonini. Oh, that's you? Awesome. Hello, hello. 
straight over from the Japanese servers, I guess, right? Which server is this? Gungir. Gungnir. Elemental, yeah. New Twitch bit thing. Oh, okay. All right, then. That That's a thing now. That's a thing. Thank you, Khalid. Uh, help Step Milk. I'm stuck. <laughs> oh, shit. I didn't know. How did I not see you guys all over there? Did you guys just come over from uh from the guild or were you guys sitting there the whole time? Can't enlarge Porg Champ. Oh man. Yeah, I guess it's only like actual Twitch alerts, right? We've been hanging. Oh shit, how did I not see you guys? Oh, it's cool seeing everyone just like arrive in, you know? Apparently if you're on mobile, you can't do it. That sucks. That sucks. Do you watch at work? Oh, that's a big hog champ. <laughs> Hog champ! I love my lesson. I'm not waiting in a guild again. Yeah, yeah. Harry, that's very smart. That's very smart. Look at these cuties. Bucket Aurelis. Oh, wait. This is an actual... A Ravana main. Yeah, I got a shiny hammer. What of it? Huh? Jesus. Hi, howdy nerdy. How's it going? Add alert. There is an ad starting soon. How did you know that? Wait, how did you actually know that? Oh, because on phone or? J Ross Hog Champ. It's a tier two emote, I think. Yeah. Some people subbed up to tier two just for the Hog Champ. <laughs> that was a fucking meme. <laughs> Thank you. What's up, also known as Echi? Alu, alu, alu. How are we doing? How are we doing? Sora. Oh, that's what you mean. That kind of add alert. That kind of add alert. Hog Champ. Dude, quite a lot of you guys have it. Tier threes and twos. Yeah, a non-sub. A non-sub. I see, I see. Also known as Echi. Now you get no ads today. Perfect for an end of expansion. Who is that? Is that Rudav? Rudav? Are you in the chat? Huh? <laughs> is that you? Yo, Fedro, what's up? Who is this? Uh, who made this account? Account created 11th of June. It's now the 14th. No, I'm me. Oh. Uh, wait, they also have an, a sub as well. Right. Um, thank you to the new followers. I'm not breaking my vow, guys. Okay? I'm not breaking my goddamn vow. All right, you will not get me. You, it's not even. It's in the name, but you will not even get me. Okay, what is this? Oh, I already have this one. Wait, how do you do this one? Thank you, uh, Beretta. Who, wait, where is Beretta? Ah, there. Hello. Uh, I already have it, so you can pass it on to somebody else if you want. Uncouth, congratulations. How do you do it? High five. Oh, sweet. I got it. I got it. I have it already. High five me. Let's do it. Oh, Bumble's still wearing the outfit. Thank God the eye track is not on because my eyes went somewhere. Yeah. My eyes did go somewhere. Russ, ungettable. Uh, yeah. All right. Thank you for the follow to um, uh, Sky Bitty got him. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they got gifted sub the, the other day, right? Sky Bitty got them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ski, actually. Yeah, I think it's a uh, mini Itty Bitty's uh, alt, maybe. Yeah. Oh, uh, oops. <laughs> Dude, I'm like, <laughs> there we go. I said I have it already three times. <laughs> there we go. All right, let's do it. We got. We can get this synced up. I believe, Beretta. I believe. I'm using in-game chat, but I keep pressing like Alt up to do my last message because I was trying to do the high five again, right? Uh, and I accidentally just kept saying, "I have it. I have it." You like the shirt? Today I decided to dress up a little bit because it's a special day. You know, this was a uh, this was a medium amount of dressing up. Nothing. 
I didn't, basically, I did want to dress up kind of the same as like last time when I put on the like shirt, the suspenders, the bow tie and stuff. Come on, we got this. We got this. I'm hawking you. Oh, so close. Oh, so close. <laughs> it's the ping, guys. It's the ping, man. I believe. Oh, shit. Yeah, we'll take that one. We'll take that one. Beretta. Hell yeah. We made it. We made it. Who is this, by the way? Uh, yeah, I wanted to dress up. You know, I didn't want to reuse my outfit from last time with the shirt, the suspenders, and the tie. So I was like, what else can I get that's like a little bit different to what I would usually wear? You know, but... Uh, but isn't reusing uh, the same thing, or is like a, just like kind of interesting, right? So then we went for the, we landed on the the leopard. Well, what is this? Red tiger camo, the red tiger game show host shirt, which I actually unironically own, because uh, my wardrobe is just full of random shit that I've just picked up and been like, yeah, that's kind of cool. Oh, that's you, Rafadim. Ah, I see. All right, made costume with cat ears. That's not really fitting for this stream, I don't think. You know. That, that was a cosplay. You know, I don't just like... Like, if I was going to do a cosplay, I would, I would cosplay as, uh, you know, everyone's favorite hot chocolate machine. You know what I mean? Uh, looks like a Tiger King shirt. Yeah, a little bit, I suppose. A little bit. I like the shirt because it makes it look like uh, Guy Fieri got 20 years younger. Now I just need to get my hair highlighted again. You know what I mean? And then we should be golden, Voss. For that look, it would be perfect. When's cat ear headphones? Uh, You know, we'll see. Holy shit, there's a lot of you guys now. Damn. Damn. Maxwell Solis is an actual native Ravana enjoyer. Real sprout, guys. No plate on the level 52 Lala. Plateless. We need to get Maxwell Solis a plate, you know? We're stealing your server. <laughs> the good thing is, yeah, we should actually have. Wait, why is there a gold? Uh, he has already. Alice, maybe you want to level red mage. Maxwell Solace is just standing here spamming question marks. Hi, Maxwell. OC belongs to Russ. Hmm. I'm not a part of this. Yes, you are, devil. Yes, you are. Somebody give the Lala the emotes. All right. <clears throat> you, Beretta. That uncouth congratulations you were going to trade me. We must trade it to Maxwell. Maxwell needs the high five. We must, we must send it. Let me just check they can trade. They can. They're not free trial. I'm going to give them some pets. Oh, shit. They want them. A gift from EU. A gift from EU, guys. The tiny rat. I gave them some, I gave them some gifts. Honestly, they're kind of from Kotomi. Now I've got some, uh, my rat. <laughs> yeah. Well, I've got one left, Kotomi, okay? I've got one more tiny rat. I gave, I gave some, uh, some of the other stuff away. You know what? I'm going to also give them some Realm Reborn Red. I've still got your rat. I just gave one away because it needed a better home. I had too many rats in my pocket, you know? Maybe I should give them some champagne. Ah, oh, shit. They're already trading, I think. Hell yeah. Come on, let them learn the emote. Regifting, how low can he get? Oh, what do you want me to do with it? Keep it in my bag forever? Jesus. Flavor Town cooking stream when? We should do a we should do a cooking stream soon. We should do one. I do want to take you guys down to Flavor Town once again. I wish there was some way that I could Oh, here we go. Nice. Nice. 
Yeah, I, I, I do wish there was some way you could somehow try the food, you know? Not that I would poison you. That would not be the intention, at least, you know? I, I think my food's pretty tasty. I've heard so. Minion up to... Oh, that was the minion. All right, we need we need the high five emote now. Yeah, I think she's learning the uh, the the minions, guys. I want to give us some uh, some champagne. I'll give ten ten champagnes. Come on, surely. Today is a celebration. Wait, they didn't want it. No. I just want them to be able to uh, pop the cork with me, you know? Giving the child alcohol? Lalafels are not children, guys. It's not hard to understand. Akito, hi! How are we doing? Hello, Veronai. What's going on? Try again. Oh, okay. Pike of the Demon. Oh, thank you. I might even have this one, actually. This is Zervan. Uh... Actually, I don't know if I do. Uh, here we go. Give them 10 champagnes. There we go. Now we can pop bottles together. Yippee! Come on. The Lala fell animation for it is so good. Yeah, it's duty free and it's non-alcoholic just in case you don't want to drink it, you know. Well, we're not drinking any of it. There we go. Yippee! This is a real sprout here, guys. This is a straight up real OC sprout who's up. And it's like, what is it? Like midnight? What, what time is it there, Kotomi? Like 1 a.m. maybe? Something like that. 2 a.m.? Popping your cork with the Lala in grid. This is peak 14. Yeah, the Lala sprout. Even more important, you know. Right. Um, let me go. I'm going to go start standing by the quest giver in a second. Uh, classic. Harassing a random Lala player. It's not harassment. Look, they're whispering me. They're DMing me like, hello, thank you. And then they're like, try the trade again. You know, I think this is just a straight out random person. Who depends? Yeah, I suppose. But most people live on the on the East Coast, right? On OC. And I think they have the t same time zone. You were too nice. Oh. I am... Not even the tip of the iceberg. For how nice people are in this game. Just never level cap, and you'll never have to deal with anyone who's not nice, guys. That's the secret. Never level cap. You know? What's going on, Zephyr? Hello, how are we doing? How are we doing? The Pike's my favorite level 60. Let me check it out. Let me check it out. <coughs> Oops, that's the wrong thing. Pike of the Demon. Try on. I might even have this. Okay. Yeah, I think Fenrir may have made... Uh, no, Fenrir made me the axe. Let's see. Try on. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Do I not have... I must have some of the other ones. Maiden Metal, Horde, Horde Axe. What's this one? This is kind of cool, actually. Wait, is this the Warrior of Darkness? No, it's not. Hive Spear, Pike of the Demon, Hive Battle Axe. I Allegan Battle Axe. What's this one? Oh. Oh, I have it mogged. I have it mogged to Moglin's. Moglin's weapon. I steal Shakram's. What am I going to wear today? Thank you for your generosity. You're welcome. Oops. Ah. Aww. They they seem like genuinely uh kind of kind of surprised. <sighs> Your la la fell is cute. There you go. Well, whatever you want. I'm thinking I'm gonna go with um. <sighs> I don't know. Doing MSQ in this might not be appropriate. You know. <laughs> Maybe we go for something like. 
I mean, we could go like this. Because we are still kind of in like Koathas and stuff, right? It is still Heavensward. Or we could go with... We can go in the Dragoon set and take the helm off, maybe, as well. Classic Dragoon gear. Yeah, that's that's a possibility as well with the Gaybold, perhaps. Maybe I go in the Dragoon set, right? Or if Darkness uses AR Relic variants. Oh, okay, okay. Put them in the dresser. Oh, eventually I will. Eventually I will. More formal. Wait. Maxwell is one of you guys. Wait, Maxwell's telling me... Maxwell's telling me to go more formal. Scatter. Who is it? <laughs> I've been juked, man. I've been juked. Scatter! Who is it? Yeah. Wait, no, because it's a real... Look, it's a real OC character, and it's not Cotton. Who else plays on OC here? Takunin. Juked out of minions. Damn it, man. Okay. Let me let me put this on here. Right, and then I'm gonna... Then I'm gonna do this, right? Cast Glamour. My Gaybolg. This is the set. This could be it, you know. And then we remove Helm. Then we're truly dragooning. Are you guys from USA? Wait, no, they're not. Wait, they're not in the stream. Uh, some EU and some USA. Yeah. We... Alright, um, they may just be asking you to go more formal without knowing. That's quite possible. I mean, they asked if, if we're from USA, right? Look at the cute Lala guys. I mean, they're in an FC called FC, you know? And they still have no plates, so I can't even check. Wait, maybe I can. Filthy casuals. Filthy casuals. Sometimes filthy, always casual, social FC who do a bit of everything. New friends welcome. Is it in Shiro? Ah, oh, cute, cute. Hmm. You and OC, you you and yours can trade if they travel to OC. Yes, Meshere. Correct, correct. As long as we are all like, as long as you can see the character in game, you can trade. I believe. Yep. Wait. Okay. 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 Now I'm convinced it's not someone in the chat. They were like, uh, okay. They said, are you guys from U from USA, right? I said, we're just a streamer and their chat. Going to finish some story stuff. We came to OC so people can bring the characters. And they're like, you mean live stream? It, now I'm convinced it's not one of you guys. I don't know. That could be the ultimate juke though. Am I getting juked out of more minions in Champagne? Who knows? For real, for real. Oh, fuck. Devil, see, you don't help, man. You don't help. Still bait? It could be. It, okay, I'm gonna be the. I'm gonna. I'm gonna believe in the true natural sprout here, and that is not bait. Okay, no baiting. I'm just really good at hiding it. Are you telling me this is you, suspect? I'm confused. I'm a master at baiting. Just master of baiting. I'm the cat lady on the right. Bumble Blue? This cat lady? Kuro Hinokami? Yo, oh, you're kind of cute, though. Hold up a sec. Yo. Don't trust chat. Yeah, now I'm... Now I, I don't know who to trust. Anything to trust these days, you know? Uh... Right, uh, I don't know if it's one of you guys or not. I can't tell anymore. Hold. What do you mean you don't like sand? Uh -huh. She kind of cute, though. She real cute. After today, yep. Oh, no. 
Don't be sad. <laughs> it's coarse. It, okay. Sand. This is what I, I love the beach. I love the sun. I like going in the sea. I like lying down. I like uh, how soft it is. I like how warm the sand gets when you... Uh... I just got drive by word. I like how warm warm it gets when you like when it's been out in the sun all day, if that makes sense. And then you go lie on it and you're like, ah, it's like be it's like getting warm from all directions, you know what I mean? But I hate leaving the beach. You know when you've been in the sea and you just got sand everywhere and you can't get it off? And then it gets in the car. And then your entire car is ruined. Yeah. You here with the NA character? Oh hell yeah. Real scob hours. This is all this sand talk. What is scobing, guys? Just don't leave the beach. Well, sometimes you got to go home, you know. You got to go home. Look at the cute little Moogle wings, by the way. Is this a Moogle outfit? That is hella cute. I must say that is quite a cute outfit. I only just I only just saw the wings and I saw the little bobble on top. The little what's it called? A pom. Scob is rather. Is rather scope is rather than does. <laughs> okay, what does scope? Sumitra Soul. It's another native. Hey, look. They're kind of cute. Right, should we go to the quest giver, guys? I want to start in like seven minutes. I want to start in like seven minutes. I need to say hello to everyone. We have Rudav on main. Roman. The old Roman. King Bean. King Bean. Sakuya. We have Alexis. We have Mintia. On the main as well. Feels good. Feels good. Talula. Lydia. I hope Maxwell. One of you guys should tell Maxwell. Oh. We can't really bring Maxwell to Heaven Sword Zones, I guess, because they're only 52. Damn it. I was like, we should bring them to the celebration, you know? Rivflow. Kuro. Elheim. Hello, hello. I am Eric DeBorrell. Is this one of you guys? She kind of cute. I will not flinch from my duty. Honestly. That's very noble, madam. She's so tall. What the hell? Bruh. What the hell? Dude, what? H am I just really short? She is so tall. Okay, is a fe is a femazen taller or a uh, femro? Lizards are shorties. I think I went min. I didn't go min height. I went like a shortish lizard though as well, right? You're short by femro standards. Yeah, it looks like it. Like if I stand next to uh, Lady Elham here. Yeah, I'm definitely uh, on the short side. Look, I decided to go with my s sort of self insert in that sense. They're standing on a ledge. Oh, that is also true, actually. Okay. She, she is still real tall, though. She's still real, real tall. Classic Scaly. How does that make me a Scaly? I just play as Ephemera, you know? Larius. Have right, we got Larius, Lalaway, Lena, Aria, Hardboy. Who's Hardboy? Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Okay. Whoa. <laughs> Hard boy, huh? Heart of the party. Jesus. Hachi machi. That's just how it be sometimes. Embla. Dude, it's nice to see... It's nice to see both EU and NAs over here. Burn out the bad. That's Lala Fell energy, Embla. Veronai main. How do NB... Uh, hit people, kill their marks. They slash them. Oh, non-binary? What's hit people? Oh, like hit... Oh! Right, I get you. Like assassins. They slash them. I got you. I got you. I got you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cute bun girl plus. Hand over the dash. Or they else. I will not hand nothing over. 
Wait. Oh. This is Alice Main. Nice. Nice. I was about to say, did you change back? But this is just Main. Now you can have both. Now you can have the Femra and the Femazen. That was ripped from Mad TV. How could someone steal a joke? How could someone say a joke on the internet that they heard somewhere else? That is crazy. That is absolutely crazy. Cirilla, you look cute. Who's this? Set. Kind of mean looking. I like the I like the golden hair though. Looks good. Nice. Golden hair with the golden hoodie. Nice. Not playing Monk. SMH. I think Monk is cool. I need to pick it up at some point. <sighs> Stream left. Blah, 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 blah. Who cares? <laughs> True. We're getting it done today. We're getting it done today. We're getting it done today. It doesn't matter with the prediction anymore because it all ends today. It's over, baby. What's up, Frizo man? Fritzo man. I'm set. I'm new. What is this? Hi, Fritzo man. Today, you have arrived. What is your main? What is your level of your main? Is this is this your main job? Fifty two. Because. Vossenbergen, thank you for the gift sub to Fritzo, man. Now you're stuck here, by the way. Okay. Firstly, welcome in. Secondly, you smell good and you have been sniffed. Thirdly, welcome to the Rapscallions. You're now ad-free viewing one of the uh, members of the club. One of the members of the club now, officially. Yeah. Today, I've come over to Oceana. You might wonder why there's so many people here and they're all voyagers. Because they've come from, uh, we've come from EU and NA and Japan servers to take over Ravana, your server here in Oceana, right? And the reason is because we can data center travel and everyone can like meet. We're using this as a meetup spot basically because there's, uh, there's like cross region travel, but it only goes one way at the moment. So we're kind of like invading uh, because I'm going to be finishing some. Pretty heavy MSQ stuff today. Um, the end of Heaven Sword patches and things like that. So the actual real end of the Heaven Sword MSQ, we're going to be getting done today on stream. So a lot of people wanted to come and show up in game and stuff, uh, which is really really cool. So that's why we're here. Why wow, everyone's looking at level 68? Have you not seen my unparalleled swag? Look at me. All right, rate my aura. 10 out of 10, right? 10 out of 10. She's so pretty. The British are invading again. <laughs> look at the eyes. Especially look at the eyes. Look at those eyes. Oh my god, look at those eyes, man. 1.0 out of 10. What? No, 1.0 out of 1.0. Percentage-wise, they're the same. Okay. British. 9.9. .9. Fine. I will agree with 9.9 .9 because, honestly, it's actually not possible to get 10. You can't have a 10 out of 10. The perfection is not possible. Perfection is impossible, okay? That's why I'll always say every, I'll always say that the chat looks cute and you guys are a 9.99 out of 10, you know, in terms of uh cuteness, good smelling and uh and uh hot. Yeah, 9.9 .9. cuz perfection is not reachable, guys, okay? Real Voss. Very shifty. Very shifty, huh? We have NA Amy Sunlight. Drone Sniper. What's brown and sticky? A stick. <laughs> I took my shirt off for chat. Whoa. What do we think, guys? Alright, I rate that. I rate that. Yeah. He looks pretty good. Nice. You got some collapse. You got some binocular Stan. We got some people looking. Oh my goodness. There you go. Got a big hat axe as well now. Jesus Christ. 10 out of 10 should mean perfection. Just complete satisfaction. You know what? I, 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 okay. I hear you, Sanctus. I, I can agree with that. Yeah. It's still, it's still, uh, it's still, uh, what's it called? 
subjective. So yeah, complete satisfaction. Okay, I'll give you a 10 out of 10. I mean, I'll give you a 10 out of 10 for that comment, but I can also get on board with that. Five days in and looking this good. You five days into the game? Damn! You've only been playing five days? I've been playing 10 months. And I'm only level 68. <laughs> I may go a slight li little bit slower. Yes. Well, look, I'm enjoying the journey. Let's put it that way. I'm doing everything in the game possible at level range without, like, going through the story. You know what? He's a staller. No, I'm not stalling. To be fair, you talk a lot. Been in the stream five minutes. I do talk a lot. Also, I play a lot and we get a lot done. However, it's not all just story. You know, I see the story as like 20% of the game, you know. So I'm getting, I'm also doing the other 80. You got a few hundred K. I got a couple mil. I got a couple mil. Eatcha. I'm cuter than you are. She is kind of cute. Too bad, mate. Let's be real. 2030 is Dawn Trail. <sighs> it's not, guys. I reckon 2025. No. 2025 or 2026, guys. There's no way it's later than 26. There's, there ain't no way. There absolutely ain't no way, you know? Someone clip this and send this to him. <laughs> Don't just stand there. Give me your hands. Oh, God. I'm ball Bingo. Hello. I smoke my stogie. How are we doing, man? Thank you for the 32 like months. You. <laughs> like you. <laughs> Thank you for the 32 months, man. How are we doing today? How are we doing? Come back out now. I mean, it's not going to be later than 2026. There just ain't no way. There's not enough content to keep me going till 2026 before even starting Dawn Trail, right, guys? 105 Ultimates, the 1409, Stormbringer before Dawn, Stormblood before Dawn Trail. That is true. All of these so far have been true. I haven't unlocked Ultimates, so I can't not deliver on that. You know what I mean? Enjoy following him on, on OC. Thank you, Fritz. Welcome in the stream. If you feel, if, uh, feel free to stay around, of course. Also, if it's not really your vibe, then I get that. I get that. Skipped. Look, I'm not skipping people. Uh, I'm not checking every single play. Also, Volps, I don't think I've seen you yet. Okay. All right. Okay. Have I? Have I? Tongue looks great today. Tongue, you look fantastic today. You have? What? You're lying to me. Blind? What? What the fuck? Jesus. Hi. What the hell? You're a lizard now. Yo. Plus one lizard, baby. Plus one. Woo. I hate it too. We lost a good cat boy, man. We lost a good cat boy. I might have invaded Ravana. Wait, bingo. Which character is yours? Bingo. I've never seen you in game. Wait. Binjo Banjo. <laughs> Yo. I've not seen you yet. Yeah, I guess you play NA, right? Hands check. Wait, let me just check Volp's plate. Yo, okay, I'll give. I'll tell you this. You made a good lizard. Wife demanded or a wife. I mean, look, you got to do what you got to do to please the wife. You know, you know what I'm saying? Dead. Based. Yeah. Caught. Cool. There he is. We got him. Binjo Banjo. Who is Booba Break? Who is this? Booba break? Honestly, that's a good kind of break. Binjo Banjo. Oh, Ellison. All right. Okay. Okay. You look good, man. You look good. I, you know what? I don't have those wings, but I do have these. I do have these ones. I can also dote you. 
The Boo Breaker Cometh. <laughs> the, the name. Booba Break. Dude, people have some unhinged names, man. It's cool seeing everyone's characters. Friends. Canna, Miss, One of Flizz. Oh, Freelancer. Mish, Dink, Kaz, Cal, Jay, Shrew, Rin, Rin, Dion. Dion, huh? Yo, what a cute, what a cute aura guy. Nice, nice. Court trolling, bro. Court trolling. There's the, there's the outfit, man. Dion enjoyers. Dion enjoys. Right, I can't open every plate. Very mochi. Nice to see the main coming out to play. Very good, very good. Yo, whoa. <clears throat> oh, <sighs> there we go. Nice. There we go. I'm here now, Mino. Nice. All right. I would love to check all your characters' plates all day long. However, guys, we got a lot to do today. All right. We have got a patch and a bit to do, plus trailer reactions and whatever shenanigans happen. Okay, many cutscenes and things. Yeah, six quests in a movie. Exactly. Six quests in a movie. We're patch 3.5. Yeah, we gotta we gotta we're we're finishing Heaven Sword today. We got a lot of uh, a lot to do. A lot to do, a lot to do. Especially if I'm chatting and stalling and, and what whatnot, right? Wait. Wait, Maxwell's level 80. Wait, hold up. Hold on. Alright, who is this? They also have the maid costume. And it's the right shade of pink. I've been I've been juked. I've been juked. Hmm. Someone's been scamming me. Caught! Yeah. I asked for grind MSQ, so I'm ready for Elden Ring release by Dawn Trail. I, I, I'm loving the game so far, bingo. Yep, 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 yep. Yeah, it's all good. Go do your MSQ, man. Go do the MSQ for sure, for sure. It's me. Wait, there's no way, devil. There ain't no way. There ain't no way. All right, let's, uh, let's go to... What is this? It says question mark, question mark. Okay. Guys. I will see you around the world, I'm sure. Feel free to stick around here. Feel free to, um, you know, pop up in the scenery. Do what you want. Just don't be too, like, in... Uh, don't be standing on top of me on mounts and shit. I think we won't have that problem today. Um, thanks, Seth. You're all good, man. All right. Um... We're going to go to Mordona. We're going to go to Mordona. Okay. From here on out, there may be some Heaven Sword MSQ spoilers. So if you don't want to get spoiled, obviously, uh, you know what to do. You know, look away. Just listen to the stream instead of watch or uh, potentially tune out. Up to you guys. But I'm going to be doing some MSQ. Starting here with Alice and Yugiri. All right. Now, what happened last time? Uh, we just We just started the patch. I don't even know exactly uh, what we're on our mission to do at this, this very second, so I'm sure we're just about to get filled in now. Uh, and then we're gonna, we've got, we got, I don't know. I think, uh, honestly, I can't remember what happened at the end of what? What was the last quest I did, guys? Because I remember we were like gonna start something, and then we didn't really get very many places. I think we're gonna like help Ida and Papa Limo uh, do something. Oh yeah, yeah, the wall of yes, that's it, Belsar's wall. Exactly. We're gonna we're stopping um the Griffin's attack. Yep. Yeah. All right. Even now, I'm astounded by how closely Mistress Alice resembles Master Alphano. <laughs> their very mannerisms are alike. From a distance, I should be hard pressed to tell one from the other until they open their mouths. Of course. Yeah. Then it's real easy to to tell the difference, you know. All right, here we go. Griffin, Griffin on the wall. Alice seems eager to discuss the council's decision with the other scions. Well, as much as I enjoy the bustle of the toll, I think it's time we headed inside. My brother and the others will not be long. Let's do it. We're going in. Alice is based 100%. I'm, I'm a big enjoyer of Alice so far. Right, I'm going into the rising stones, guys. Wish me luck. I really hope nothing crazy is going to happen yet. 
Dude, I'm like, I'm really unsure how to, how to, how to think about this. I'm not really sure, like, like what's gonna go on, you know? Like, is it gonna be a happy time, a sad time? Before it was like a, it's like a big juke, you know? Is uh, we got, we got absolutely juked into a, a special occasion, which I totally thought was gonna go amazingly. Right. <clears throat> ah, you return from the council. But what of Alphano? Did some other matter require his attention? Here he comes. Mine apologies, friends. I trust we've not kept you waiting over long. Greetings, everyone. Oh, Kryle. How's Nargo doing? She will be all right, won't she? I don't see why not. She is sleeping at the moment. Tataru's keeping an eye on her. So we'll know soon enough if there's any chance... Any change in her condition. Oh yeah, we got the new cat girl, Nargo. Her wounds are healing well. With sufficient rest, I'm certain she will make a full recovery. Thank goodness for that. Yeah, yeah. Now, mayhap you would share with us the council's decision. Right. Each of the nations, Ishgard included, has committed to prove it, providing military support to Gridania. The Eorzean Alliance will soon have a significant force in the Black Shroud, ready to respond to any Imperial act of aggression. Right, that's it. Amor we went to... Right, we went to Gridania. We had a meeting with Kani Senna. We had a meeting with the Admiral. Raban was there. He didn't say that much this time. And Amoric was like, Hey, if I'm going to be in the Alliance, I'm going to goddamn give you some soldiers. What's going on, Cage? You know, I almost wish the council would stop messing around and give the griffin what he wants. I wouldn't like to be the imperial caught between the resistance and the alliance. Huh. That's interesting, Ida. Ida, you cannot seriously... One does not lightly go to war with the Galean Empire. Quite. To, to open hostilities without due consideration would be to invite disaster. If only there was some way to reach the Griffin, some means to convince him to abandon this reckless course. Hmm. Wait, Ida's definitely a uh, sleeper agent or something like that. It may not be entirely unfeasible. Just unlock flying, yeah. There is a network of tunnels beneath Belsar's wall. Secret passages dug by the resistance to provide a way out of Alamigo which may equally serve as a way in. Precisely. If all are in agreement, I would be the one to undertake the necessary negotiations. I am familiar with the route, and the resistance is familiar with me. Well, that is true. About as familiar as they are with me, you mean. Say what you want. I'm coming too. I have some experience in the practice of infiltration. If you would have me, my services are at your disposal. As a mine, it's been far too long since I shared a shadow with his, with a with a shinobi, and I do not intend to waste the opportunity. This sound like a dungeon run. Four is quite sufficient for an infiltration mission. Greater numbers will serve to increase the risk of detection. Kryl and I will direct our energies elsewhere. What of you, Leviers? I'm also coming. <laughs> <clears throat> I will return to the East Shroud and stand watch over the border. Should matters take a turn for the worse, it would seem wise to be on hand. Might I prevail upon you uh, oh, upon you to accompany Russ? Gridania will be safer for your presence. And, while it may not seem the most thrilling duty, dear sister, might I ask that you remain at the Rising Stones to pass on messages and so on. Oh, she's the new Minfilia. Don't put, don't make Alice a Minfilia. No, no. To hold the fort, you mean? Very well. I suppose the task must fall to someone. Oh man, nah. You can't Minfilia her. She's so based. She's so epic. Safe travels, all of you. Damn it. Stupid Alfie. Stupid goddamn Alfie, man. Alfie and his freaking retainers. I wanted to say, looking good, my dude. Thank you, also known as Echi. Um, four is a good number. Four is a good number. Right. Alfie. 
If you have any unfinished business in the toll, pray attend to it now. I would depart for Hawthorne Hut without delay. The nearby watchtower also suffered, also offers an unobstructed view of Belsar's wall, and I should be interested to speak to the Alliance's commanders who have installed themselves at its top. Hmm. All right. Philia is based in Epic. No, Alice. I said she is based in Epic, and I was talking about this one here. I suspect Tataru would have little trouble facilitating communication between our forces under normal circumstances. But I concede she has her hands fu full nursing that resistance fighter back to health. No matter, my turn in the field will come. Oh, it better. Tataru and Kral look at that resistance fighter to more to a more private chambers than she might recuperate in peace. The poor girl was in quite a state. Uh, I wonder what's going to become of her. Then. Is it either being sus... All I'm saying is it wouldn't be the worst thing if we ended up joining the Griffin fighting against the Empire. I mean, it's going to happen sooner or later, isn't it? Hmm, I'm I'm kind of kind of intrigued to see what's going on here. I may perhaps have exaggerated my standing between the resistance a little, but I'm confident that I have a reasonable chance of putting a stop to this madness before even this, before events spiral out of control. Yes, fair to middling at the very least. All right, let's uh let's head out here. I don't want to talk to everyone all the time, but we've got a lot we got a lot to do. We got a lot to do. Hi, Jimmy. How's it going? You sent Minfilia away? Alright, look. It's not my fault. She sucked. You know what I mean? You know, you know what I mean? She got herself in that situation. She really did. Are we going down to... Where's Hawthorne Hut? Oh, it's back in the shroud. Okay, Hawthorne Hut. Tongue! Thank you for the gift sub to Alice Levia. Appreciate that. Alice, if you're here, make sure you say hi to, in chat, all right? Because you were kind of epic. All right, Alfie. Cutscene time. Oh, dude. That, this is the worst graphical part of the game, in my opinion. It's the uh, shadows, in specifically in the forest. Like, specifically in the Black Shroud, you know what I mean? Say hello to my husband. I dragged him here. Hi, husband. Is that you? Hey, it's Greg. Hi, Greg. Welcome. <laughs> you have been dragged here. And also... Hello. Good thing shadows are getting updated. Yeah, exactly. This is my, like, one... Like, when people complained about the graphics of the game, I was like, the only time I can agree with it is in the forest. And as, as well, like you said, like that's getting, that's getting fixed anyway, right? Oh, that's a lot of sniffers, guys. Good job, good job. Ah, Russ, you can There you are. Come. Uh, Amara Swa's spire awaits. The Alliance officers on the platform should be able to apprise us of any developments at the wall. Dude, this is where we first came when we were doing the Sylph stuff. Oh, I remember. I remember this exact Aetherite. I had like an hour-long rant about WoW here on like day six of me streaming this game. Uh, it was during the Subathon. First time he came. No, the first time I came here, at least, you know. Ah, right, here's the lads. Fancy meeting the two of oh <clears throat> fancy meeting the two of you here. We are about to set forth. Indeed, I was about to say, twelve watch over you, but I doubt you have need of divine protection, even if you are venturing into the enemy territory. I mean we've got two shinobis. Pretty decent monk and a fairly useless mage, but we'll see, right? Don't worry, Alphino. We'll have the griffin by the scruff of the necks before you know it. Thanks, Fenrir. You're pretty cool, too. Do you make up your mind, Ida? Neri, a moment ago, you seemed ready to shake the griffin by the hand rather than the neck. So which is it to be? It would be best to decide before we enter into negotiations. Trust me, Papalimo. I'll shake whatever needs shaking. Huh? Ida, what the heck? Jesus. Ida's just ready. She's just like, all right, if duty calls, man, out in the field, you know what to do. Gonna hit a, hit a decade to Dawn Trail. I'm not that slow, okay? All right. Either getting heated? Yo, she's heating things up for sure. The talking part, I'll leave to you. Oh my god. 
But she's mine. She's mine. <laughs> Say less. Ayo. Mm, I think I feel a headache coming on. Let's be on our way, shall we? Off you go. Before she changes her mind again. Quick. Papa Limo is her pimp. I don't know. I think she's got free, free mind. Ah, some things never change. Well then. Shall we make for the spire? Our alliance friends will doubtless have news for us. Let's do it. Is Amrit going to be up there? My boy? Speak with Alphano near the Hawthorne hut. Let's go. I got my chair. Not the only head that's going to ache. Whoa. Jesus. Yeah, dude, remember when I had to run up this and I couldn't fly? Now it's on the ground level anyway. Unlucky. <laughs> Welcome, warrior of light. I assume you're here to speak with our commanding officers. You'll find them on the observation platform. Pray proceed. Let's do it. Up we go. Ah, uh, pan up, fade to black. Oof. Beautiful. Beautiful. <gasps> Pippin! Greetings, my friends! <laughs> That's not how he talks. <laughs> Greetings, my friends. It is good to see you both well. Oh, Hilda's here too. Oh, this is amazing. I was hoping you might turn up. I've dragged half the watch here, see? And the sight of you might help remind him why they bothered. If memory served, I've not seen many of you since the day of the Grand Melee. Having borne the brunt of your blows, may I say what an honour it is to stand at your side. <laughs> My Pippin voice was not on point there, but I think I fixed it. It is heartening indeed to see the realm's most stalwart defenders thus gathered in a common cause. Speaking of which, what news from the wall? Dude, I can't do my Alfie voice today. I've been really trying. Always been quiet. Oh. The wall is going off, dude. They can't be that far in already. Report. What? Seven hells. Fighting has broken out atop the wall. A full scale assault. So, the griffin has made his move. Someone has. Hmm. And what's that supposed to mean? The attackers. They're wearing grand company colors. Huh. Impossible. We gave no such order. What the hell's going on? We've been infiltrated. Of course, the wall was never the Griffin's target. It was bait. Ain't no way! Oh, man. Who could have seen this coming? Who could have seen this coming? I'm pretty sure I said this last stream. I'm pretty sure I said this last stream. I said, wow, they're sending every army to the wall, huh? Yeah. It was bait. We have been goaded into deep deploying our enemies nearby, thus lending weight to this deception. Yep. At least, look, Alfie is a little... For how smart he supposedly is, he's a little bit slow. Bait used to be believable, yeah. Amogus. Pre-watch. Not even pre-watched. It was just obvious. If those uniforms were convincing enough to deceive my scouts, the Empire would surely think we've launched an offensive. This could mean war. Yeah. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. So now the Garleans are going to come at us. The Imperial is going to come crush us underfoot. And the Griffin's going to take uh, Old Dar or something. Even so, this may be no more than a dis diversion. With the armies of the Alliance occupying the Empire's attention, it would be comparatively easy for the Griffin's supporters to slip into Alamigo. Oh, Alamigo, sorry. He could then incite a rebellion amongst the populace, which the Imperial Reserves would be hard-pressed to contain. Eorzea, meanwhile, would be plunged into chaos. That's not very good. 
Bait chum hook, baby. That's just how it goes. Is that easy, man? Russ, we must make for the wall at once. Well, now we just sent our shinobi team in as well, right? What? Just the two of you? Our companions embarked on a mission to sway the griffin from his course and are likely halfway to his command post by now. They will emerge in the midst of a raging battle and I do not mean to abandon them to their fate. Oh, we're going on a rescue mission now. It will be dangerous, aye. But the confusion may work to our advantage. If we are careful to avoid the skirmishing, it may yet be possible to reach the griffin. And if we can do that... Lady Hilda, might I ask that you have an airship ready to bear the scions to safety? Let's go. We do like Hilda and Pippin. Ha! I, know, I don't know who this Lady Hilda is, Marshal, but you can count on me. We must prepare for Imperial reprisals. May the navigator guide us through the storm. Let's do this. Rescue mission, myself and Alfie. The two most trusted for the job. I'll get behind that. Hmm. Okay, I don't really see it. I don't really see... Like, I. okay, I, I got that that was a bait. I don't really see, like, where this is go going now, actually. So it's a bit of a shrewd moment. There's the griffin. Or the fake one. Yeah, the thing is, there could be two, right? Like, it could send one. They could send the fake one somewhere and the real one somewhere else. Forward, comrades! The time has come to drive the Empire from Alamigo and force action upon those who have turned their backs to, suffer, to our suffering for so long. Let this victory be the first step in the liberation of our homeland. Alamigo will be free, no matter the cost. There can be another fake. <laughs> yeah, imagine there's just like four. There's four griffins just walking around, man. All right, let's go. Cry let's go. Let's go. Fuck this guy up. Fuck him, dude. I don't know. Let's go. Fuck him up. Speak with Alfie. Let's go. Shit. Hello. That's a lot of you guys. From what Papa Limo told me, the trail has a, a head should lead us to the shadow of the wall. As we have two objectives, I suggest we di divide our forces. I shall make straight ways for the tunnels and attempt to intercept our comrades ere they stumble into a bloodbath. While I do so, I must ask that you scale the wall. Well, luckily I'm Menorah, baby. Know that I would not propose such a course if there were any other way. But the time for subtlety has passed. Take a band of your most trusted companions and cut a path through to the griffin. Make him see reason by any means necessary. Once we are free of the tunnels, we'll make for your position with all due haste. And if everything proceeds according to plan, Hilda will then swoop in and spirit us away to safety. I only pray that we have enough time. Why do we never use our flying mounts? Unless I just came later, maybe. Mm -hmm. Bale Sars Wall now accessible. Mm, dungeon or trial? I guess it's gonna be a dungeon, right? Hello, 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 hello. Well, 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 well. Dungeon time, is it? Can I join? <laughs> All right, I'm going to take three of you guys. I'm assuming it's three. Let me just check if it's a dungeon. It is a dungeon. I'm going to take three of you guys in. All right. I'm going to try and take people that I've not played with before. Okay. So, and I believe because we're on OC... There's a good chance there's quite a few people that I actually haven't been able to play with before. So, um, you know, it's a good, you know, it's a good opportunity for those guys. 
and apologies to people that have at least like i can take people that haven't played before prio and then people that uh, haven't played with for a while after that right the hell is this story progression on a rust stream fido exactly we're finishing heaven sword today baby look I, when i when i pump i pump you know what i mean right iku dorno have we played together before i don't know i don't think so from crystal right don't judge me i can kick your ass Step forward if you're uh, really wanting to join, by the way. Uh, and I'm going to try and take some people that... Wait, Cocte? All right, Cocte surely joins. Yeah, there's going to be a B team as well. Because there's some other people that need it for MSQ and stuff. Promise? Sai is no longer a Sprout. I know, I saw I saw him crying about his, losing his Sprout on Twitter. Honestly, 07 for Sai's Sprout icon. He rushed the game too fast, man. Yep. Pause. Cock. Cocktail, you coming or what? Why have you got your back to me? What the hell? Cocktail, come on. I want sleep. Tell you what, you can sleep after we clear Belsar's wall, Cocktail. How about that? You forgot my character. I don't remember every single person's character, I'm afraid. Sorry. Sorry in advance. Right. Um. Yeah, I want Cocktail. Uh, anyway. Let's take Alistair, uh, Alistair Kane. We'll take this cute cat boy in. He looks like he wants to join. Already in another party. All right, never mind. He's queued up for something. I see now. Iku, you want to join? Have, have we played together yet? Um, People Giggles. Cocktail. Hi, sir. Can you inspect the axe on People Giggles? Uh, yeah, I can. It is a uh, Mandevilius bath. Oh wait, no, it's Axe of Light. Axe of Light is called. Not really. Uh, hey yo, cute boy. Sheesh. Wait, is this you, Iku? Right, Alistair's in a thing. We can do this. Hippo giggles. Any anyone else that are like desperate to join, or are you guys just here for the vibe? You know. Because uh, Cirilla has played with me a bit. Barry, have we played together? Thank you, sir. Axe of Light got to be the most generic name ever. Yeah. <laughs> Just slightly less generic than Axe. Axe of Light, I mean... It's an Axe of Light that a Warrior of Light uses, you know what I mean? Uh, my husband is a cute cat boy. Ain't no way. Hey, I believe it. <clears throat> God, it's weird seeing you as an aura. Are you just a perma aura now? Is Volp's catboy gone? There's no way. Wait, where did uh all right Barry Yona come? Alright, let's take Barry Mochi in. Baby shoes! Oh you goddamn cute. Oh you goddamn cute for sale. Baby shoes. It's V Dash. Oh, is this your main? You did Dunscape. Yeah, you're all good. You're all good. You did Void Arc. Uh, it looks like... Uh... Oh, okay. Okay. When was the last time you played Rocky? Uh, we'll go like this. We'll go like this, right? Sag. Wait, I didn't get an invite. Oh, okay. Did you want to join? Okay, you're in a different party. Very. If, if possible, then I'll take in... Uh... I'll take Alice Store instead. Because they haven't played with me before, yeah? If you said you did Void Arc. Up to you. Since I invited you, I don't really want to... Okay. We'll do that. We'll do that. Hi, baby shoes. All right. We'll take... We'll take Alistor in. Boom. Thank you, Barry, for, for passing the space. Guys. Uh, someone got a heal. I'm doing it as Dragoon. I don't have a healer. Someone... One of you guys has got a heal. How's it going? Uh, we're, we're about to start Bellstar's Wall now. Um, uh, Miyuki. Wait, do we actually not have a healer in this? I don't have any healers. I don't have a healer. Oh, shit. I have, but I don't know how. Oh, no. Maybe we do need Barry. <laughs> maybe maybe, uh, maybe we do take Barry in. Oh, no. Oh, no. We have no healers, guys. I don't know how to heal. 
All right, okay. One of you, one of you can jump out, and I'll get Berry Mochi back in. We'll get, we'll get her in on heal. No healer run, yeah. Just need a warrior. Yeah, that's true. That's true. All right, one of you guys kindly jump out, and uh, I'll get Berry in to heal since she was already in. We're not doing a no heal run, guys. Will that be like we're going min eye level and stuff? That might be a bit rough. Uh, who has a healer and not what healer is it? Oh, uh, someone has a sage. Uh, okay, you, you'll be fine. You know what, Iku, you just fucking you run sage and then uh, someone can jump in. I can even tank if we need. Yeah, yeah, you'll be fine. Like, we'll take it slow for you. We can, we can have, uh, we won't pull like wall to wall if you're not comfortable healing. We can get it done. We can get it done. All right, sweet. This works. All right, we'll get EQ on Sage, Pipo on uh, Warrior. Other store, you can DPS if you want. We're all good. We're all good. Gonna have to kick someone? Nah, nah, nah. We're good. We adapt. We adapt. Okay. All right, sweet. Let's go like this Red Mage and Dragoon. Sounds good. Right, we're doing this, guys. Belsar's wall, minimum item level, no echo. Let me set the scene. <coughs> Marking the border between the Black Shroud and Gear Abanya, the legacy of Gaius Van Belsar is now a towering monument to imperial tyranny. And now smoke rises from its iron crenellations. In a bid to drag the armies of Eorzea into the struggle for Alamegan liberation, the Griffin and his resistance fighters have disguised themselves in the Grand Company uniforms and laid siege to Belsar's wall. While Alphano seeks to call your companions back from their now meaningless mission of diplomacy, you must ascend the war-torn fortification by the swiftest route possible. Gaius Van Belsar 69. He would be the kind. Gaius, welcome in. Tongue, thank you for the gift sub. While Alphano seeks to call your companions back from their now meaningless mission of diplomacy, you must ascend the war torn fortification by the swiftest route possible and persuade the Griffin, by force if necessary, to abandon his reckless ambition. Let's do it, guys. How very glib. How very glib we're about to be. Tongue, thank you for the gift sub. Let's go in. Let's do this. Sage healing is primarily using your 30 second and 60 second cooldown hitting AoE damage with, with Cardia on the tank. We'll get this done. We'll get this done. I believe in our group. We're going to persuade him by force. But Spanks may be included. Okay. Nice portrait. Classic. We're finishing an expansion with an Imperial dungeon. Dude, they they know they know their formula. Chills. What's up, Mr. Dust? Hello, Kia Beats. Hello, hello. How are we doing? Alright, guys. Nice portraits. On three of us, actually. We got this. I believe in Iku's healing, okay? I'm gonna make sure I eat my egg. Egg is eaten. Let's do it. Yeah, go go as fast as you want. Like if if uh, Iku is like comfortable with the healing and stuff, then uh, we can obviously speed things up if you if you need. Right. Like, if you feel like it's all going good, we can speed up. If you feel like it's not, we can slow down. It should be all good. We can adapt. We'll get it done. We'll overcome this, okay? Ebo Giggles has got big self heals as well, which is good. I'm going to get this dog. I think we killed the dog. 
Yeah, exactly. Raw intuition can really help out as well, right? It like, should be up for every pull, or at least like once or twice. Boom, there we go. Very nice. That was a pretty big pull. That was like six mobs. Cardia. Wind by what's this? I got poisoned by a lot of stuff here. Hi, uh, Chitalane. How are we doing? How's it going? What, so what does Cardia do? Is it kind of like a beacon of light? Does it like redirect your healing? To that target or something? Heals when dealing damage. Right, right, right. So you put it on the tank, Let yeah? Let the healer know that Cardia needs to be on the tank, please. Okay. Apparently, uh, Cardia goes on the tank, and then you just do DPS uh, EQ. First time healing, so you're all good, okay? I know there's some... I know... Don't, don't let chat bully you, all right? We're going to give... Uh, we're going to be nice about it. And give it. Give good advice without being mean, guys. That's the motto. So apparently on tank and do do big dam and they should be chilling. That's what I'm taking away from this. <laughs> yeah, it's okay. We can we can tell we can give advice. But as long as we phrase it in a nice way, you know what I mean? Oh, there's a there's a key. Let's get the key. Yoink. But mm -mm. damage to healing. Yeah, okay. Kinda like disc priest, huh? Sweet as security terminal. Looks like there's nothing up there. Open the gate. Yeah, tips are fine, guys. Tips are fine. Like, uh, we're all adults here. We can, we can, uh, we can take tips. That's that's all good. As long as like no one's like being a dick about it, you know. All right, shit. We need to. I think we need to get these down because they like they focus people. They have like a tether on them. I may have uh, fucked up not using litany here, but we should be good. Dungeon is hard. Ah, we'll be good. We'll be fine, guys. I believe. Me and my group. We the best. All right. Uh, do we need? Uh, there's a new key. Oh, you got it. You got it. So I guess we're just walking straight up the wall, huh? Yeah. Good job, team. Good job. We're doing fine. First boss. The Magitek Predator. Okay. Via Pretoria. Oh, shit. All right. Little throwback. Let's go. Let's do this. I'm popping some coolies for you guys. Magitek Claw. Do, 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 do. All right. Ads are up. They're going to focus. They're going to tether. They're going to fixate, I think. Oh, if you attack them, they fixate you. I do like that about the fixates in this game. You can kind of like bait them, right? Like it seemed that way in a lot of the savage stuff we did. You can kind of like, if you hit something first, it will just stick to you. Okay, dodgy dodgy. Not quite a mega beam. Look, we're brute justice killers now. I'm gonna faint that one. I'm ready for anything. You're doing terribly. Don't keep it up. You know what, Carbuncle? Just to spite you, we're gonna fucking slap this dungeon hard now. Alright, this praise. Just don't stack up and we should be good. Nice.
Can't faint that one. Do, 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 do. Dude, imagine, guys, when I have Reaper unlocked. It's going to be huge. Oh my god, that hurts like frick. Watch out. Remember, we also want OC ping here, guys. So you need to give, like, uh, Telegrass a little bit more lenience because of lag. I actually, I actually haven't really noticed the, the lag be an issue today. Like, I even really felt it. Jesus Christ. These things kind of hurt, though, man. All right, I'll get a res. We should be good. Keeper Giggles looks fine for a second. There's a tank buster. I'm going to get rezzed up. All right, we're good. We're good. We're chilling. We're fine. We're fine. Level is it? Yeah, 68 on my Dragoon. Oh, God. I almost got animation lock there. There we go. We're done. Easy clap. Good job, team. Good job. Let's play my loots. Uh, ooh, that looks like a cool bracelet. All right, I'm taking that. All for the glam, baby. Yeah, those are chunky. I don't want those. I don't fit my vibe. So close. I am. I am. I'm really close. Hey, what's up, Urusef? Yeah, I'm having a good day. I'm doing fine. All right, let's activate this. I think we're going to... It's either an elevator or like a gauntlet or something. See how this goes. Oh, it's a sideways uh, platform. Okay. Conveyor belt active. Oh, shit. It's just going to put... And it, it's just going to give us a ton of enemies. Right. Good luck, guys. Big damn. Oh, we're fine. Oh, dude, I'm doing so much damage. It's probably not even me doing damage. All right, we're good. We're good. All right, we have a new, new guy. I think we're kind of like on a timer here, so good DPS is good. Wait, is this Black Shroud music? Okay, we're done with that compartment. Going to the other side, I guess. Or maybe down the middle. Yeah, down the middle. Oh! Oh, shit. Alright, let's focus the middle. Focus the middle. Look, they, they learned, actually. They ha You can hear the alarms, like, very faintly in the background. Going like, wow, wow. You know? Huge. Good job. Good dodging. Good dodging. Happy feet. Ooh, that's not cool. Nice. Oh, we're fine. You're doing great, by the way, Iku. Okay. Good job. We got some treasure over here. Okay, we got a hand and some smallies. Leave off the hand. Massive crits. Just cleave off the hand again. Going to dot it up. All right, we're doing good. We're doing good. Elevator or gauntlet? I think it's a... Uh, I don't think it's a gauntlet now. I thought it might be one of the, like a gauntlet that we'd have to run through or something. But it seems like it's just packs of mobs. And we're doing fine. Everyone's healthy. Let's pick these up.
You said this dungeon was hard. Making short work of it. Oh, ouch. Ouch. Okay, that one, that one did kind of hurt a little bit. Chilling. Nice. Good job. Iku's doing big learning. Yeah, exactly. We're good. Guardian. Oh, yeah, right. So it's just like uh, something you keep up. Oh, we're going forward now. Yippee! Next boss is Urgot. They just straight up called it Armored Weapon. All right. I'm ready. Ocean tracking activates. Right, I think we stand still, maybe. Or maybe we don't attack either. Alright. I somehow didn't get hit. I somehow got away with it. <laughs> Alright, so stand still for that and maybe even stop attacking and using abilities. God, I'm so I'm so battle hardened now. Oh, fuck. Okay. We're fine. Refractive laser. Sensory jammer. Oh. Surely my auto wouldn't kill me, right? Yeah, we're good. Oh! He's on me. I might live for a sec. Okay, we're good. Good pickup, good pickup. Oh my god, that hurt. Oh god, that's a lot of ads. Alright, we need Alistair up. Hi, Ponto. How did your uh, sleep schedule fix go? Did you get it done? Like, did it work? All right, big AOE now. Nice. The deep V cut, yat. It's a, it's a shirt. I tend to not do too many buttons up. All right, stop attacking, stop attacking. And then we move. All right, sweet. Need to, oh no, EQ's down. Oh, this is not good. We have no reses. All right, we might be wiping here. Uh, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. We'll just go again. We'll just go again. Now we kind of know the mechanics, right? There sometimes seems to be a uh, telegraphed, like, thing on floor. Also, what the hell was that? It's definitely, like, you don't want to get stunned or whatever from uh, moving during the uh, detection. I've been here uh, a while. You actually finished the Realm Reborn. Did you get any relics? So what's up, Denny King? Uh, I did finish the Realm Reborn quite a while back, actually, back in December. I've been stuck in Heaven Sword for the last five five months and a bit. But I've been doing everything. Like I did all of the Savage on minimum item level. We did all the extremes, you know, stuff like that. So we've definitely been getting uh, stuff done. Which way is it? Oh, through here, I think. Homage to FF6. Oh, okay. Yeah, I've not played uh, the old ones. OC ping as well. Yeah, yeah. So you got to give telegraphs like an extra second. Debuffs an extra second or so as well. Anyway, we're doing fine. We're doing fine. B squad clear. Congrats, B squad. Are you in eye leveling as well on B squad? Oh, 
Also, <laughs> nice sniffer. I missed that one, Rocky. He's something fine. Alright, stop attacking for a sec. Do you wanna not not attack when uh, it does when it does the uh, red big red exclamation mark thing? Or you get the big stun and then you might die now. Yeah, you don't wanna get, it's the follow up if you get stunned, right? Luckily uh Iku got some heals pumped on you there. Oh, that's that attack. Okay. Good job. Okay. Careful now. It's the non-movie thing after this. This. We stop moving here. Hands off. And then we move now. There we go. Nice. Much better. Easy clap, team. We got this. Cutest chat. Uh, did you go straight to bed, Ponto? Did you get it fixed up? Are you good? Are we chilling now? Like, are you ready for... Uh, are you ready for holidays? Blasemble! Respect the mechanic. I'm hoping. How long did you sleep, man? Good job, by the way. You actually made it. You know? Or, wait, did you actually make it 24 or did you uh did you hit a wall? Look at 4 a.m. The fuck? <laughs> oh, did you go to bed at 8 p.m. though? I mean it's that's a little better, right? Oh fuck, I think I'm dead here. I'm fine, I'm fine. Oh, we're doing it guys. We got them doing it. I'm just going to LB1 this. Boom, boom. Good job, team. We made it. We made it. Of course we did. We adapt and we overcome. Learning is the best. Knowledge is power. Easy clap. Yeah, a week from more than 24. Yeah, that's true. 21 and a half and you died. Honestly, that's the hardest wall. The 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 like 20 to 22 hour wall is so bad. It's crazy. When I back when I used to do my long like 24 plus hour streams, I, I remember around like three hours, three to four hours before I hit the 24 mark was the hardest by like a really, really long way. When you're like like, I get really restless. My body would, like, feel like it wants to, like, reset. So I would try and, like, brush my teeth. I would try and, uh, like, go for a small walk. I would try and eat some food to, like, trick my brain into thinking, like, it just woke up or something. But it's really, really hard to do, actually. So it's pretty, like, fair, it's fair enough if you couldn't make it through that because it's really rough. Throat hurts. Yes, as well, like, when you're talking for that long, right? Right, we passed that. Wait, I didn't pass. Beep. All right, cruise security terminal. Do 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 do. You're dead. Yeah, yeah, no, like, uh, it's fair enough. That honestly, you need to train for them. Like, I don't think I could do a 24-hour very easily now. But back when I used to do them every month, I did like one 24-hour stream per month. And obviously, like over time, I kind of trained my body in like how to deal with it. So it became much, much easier in that sense. <laughs> Huge damage. Dude, when I get the guest Gogol through everything with the uh, life surged uh, doom spike, it's nuts. Big damn. Uh, I play red mage. I haven't been playing it much recently. To be honest, I haven't actually really played it in Heaven's Sword much, but I do want to bring it back for Stormblood because it gets like rares and stuff like that, right? So I can I can feel like I'm being like quite useful on it, which is like the main selling point of Red Mage to me, as well as it being really cool. I think we're going this way, guys. Exactly at 64, right? 
I can confirm three hours from the 20 foot one is, is rough. Yeah. Wait, why the hell did you go three days with no sleep? What the heck? That does not sound good. Oh shit, okay, we're getting some confidence now. Double pull. How are we doing by the way, Jen? How's it going? Mm -hmm. My evolution to Mr. Cool Guy. He did see. I think he's alright. When was there in the morning, no? Yeah, did you feel suitably cool? Did your eyes recover, Ponta? <laughs> All right, filibusters earring offending. Now that I kind of want. Oh yeah. Uh, he's retired now, Fenray. You'll never see it again. All right, here's the Griffin. We're actually gonna fight him. What the heck, dude? I, it has to be Ilbert. Don't answer, of course. Hi, Wickersons. Surely he's gonna take the mask off. Here we go. Here we go. No ads for this part. Of course. Of course. Oh, that was so hard to, to know, right? There we go. Of course. Of course it was. The Griffin. I mean, look. Who else was always blabbering on about Alamigo, you know? Blabbering on about Alamigo. Sounded, uh, sound, had that kind of voice and accent. Uh, you know, it was, it was quite obvious. Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Don't pull yet because people are sobbing. Hold on. Uh -oh. Sylvie Stars. Stinky. Oh, shit. Sorry. There were ads. Sorry. Sorry. If you skipped everything, it was a surprise. <laughs> See, I don't skip stuff. That's why. Sylvie Stars, thank you for the prime. Chitalane, thank you for the uh, six months as well. All right. Chat, hold. All right. There we go. Trange. No, no. Hold. Wacko Llama, no looking up. All right. We can do this, team. Uh, I'm now ready. We can now do a ready check. Wait, hold on. <sighs> I said hold tongue. Oh, stinky. <laughs> All right, let's do this. We're doing this. Let's go. Let's go. Thank you, Tongue. Yeah. All right, he's going to be shouting shit at us for sure now. Yeah. Beak of the Griffin. Oh, my God, that hurts. How do you like this? Uh, oh, my God. Look away. Look away. Look away. Ah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Okay, we're going, we're going. It's like my uncle Kagi once said with great I'll tell you limb from limb. How are you going? How are you saying sloppy? Is that was that him? Is that him saying that? Or is that something you guys are doing? Sloppy. Oh god, dodge guys, dodge. I have you Wait, we have to find a safe spot. Oh god. Yeah. Okay. Shit, I did not see the order they How came down. Like ah! Okay. Uh, oh, oh, we kill. We kill middle. We kill middle. Alright, kill, 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 kill. I see now. They have health bars. Yeah. Ah, here we go. Sloppy! <laughs> no ads, punk. Uh, Shit, let's go. Alright, we're good. We're good. We're chilling. We're chilling. Sloppy! <laughs> I thought that was you guys. I thought somehow you were doing it with bits or some shit. Sloppy. <laughs> um, let me get out of here. Restraint collar. What the hell? Get me out. Get me out. Sloppy. I've heard that voice clip somewhere. I thought it was like an internet meme. Not from this. All right, go, go, go. Oh shit. I've got to sprint this. Sloppy. <laughs> 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 
No way. I'll tear you limb from limb. All right, I'm, 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 I'm fainting. I'm fainting. No, right, we got this. We got this team. We got this. Sloppy. It doesn't sound like his voice. For Alamigo. I have you now. Oh my god, that hurts. Alright, kill the middle again. Yeah. Sloppy. How'd you like this? Oh, move away. Alright, we're good. Oh, I bet that would fear us into the spikes, right? Dude, I'm yeah. way beyond that. Did it? I was about to say, does he not know? What Here he comes. He's going to say it, guys. Sloppy. <laughs> it doesn't yeah. sound like his voice. <laughs> He's cracked. All right, I'm going to stand on top of the boss so you can get me out of my restraint collar. Get me out. Hell. Sloppy. Reek of the Griffin. Oh, that's yeah. going to hurt. That's good. Thanks, Smash, for sure. Yeah. Oh, he's so free. I'm gonna wait, 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 wait. We gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go. 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 Alright, we're fine. Sloppy. <laughs> I thought you guys were like spamming it with bits or something. Wait, hold on. Thank you guys for the gift subs, by the way. Sorry, I'm I'm trying to I'm trying to do the fight justice, you know. Sloppy. Sloppy. Easy. Surely now he's gone. Slopper. <laughs> Ilbert, you dick. I knew it was him, man. I knew it was him. Turn off alerts. I, I can't uh, before the cut if the cutscene is going to play insta. If it's not, then I can, yes. Yeah, I will disable alerts. I will, I will, I will. I will. Okay, okay, okay. Guys, I got it. I got it. I didn't know that I had to do them before the fight. Usually, you get a second after the fight, and then and then we could do that, okay? All right. Guys, Sora, thank you for the 100 bits. Tongue, thank you for the gift sub. Denny King, thank you for the resub. Lord Ch Chozo, thank you for the 100 bits. Okay, Fenrir, thank you for the five gift subs. Tongue, thank you for the gift sub. Sylvie, thank you. And Shitalin, thank you for the resubs and the new sub with the Prime. All right. Okay, how come I'm Oceana? So everyone can bring their characters over. For the end of uh, Heaven Sword, okay? So you can bring NA, you can bring Japan, you can bring uh, uh, EU characters over and everything. I'm just going to pause the alerts. You can still do subs and bits and stuff if you want, okay? But please uh, be respectful in the cutscenes to the viewing experience and things, all right? Um, yeah, that's sick, right? It's sick. Bye, Trange. Just in time for the cutscene. That was a perfectly timed little train there, guys, all right? Wash your dog. What? My dog is fine. He's clean. Okay. Um. Yeah. Yeah. Bye, train. Good little, good little train there, guys. We got it. We got it nice and on cooldown now. <laughs> Scope. All right. I've paused the alerts for a sec. All right. Please be respectful with like sound redemp redemption and and TTSs and stuff in the thing. Yeah? Don't 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 ruin the cutscenes for me and for the chat as well. Right. Um. Let me get a cut. Let me get a picture. Let me do all the uh, G posing and stuff. Filibusters, heavy gambeson offending. Hold. Jesus, that thing's huge. It's kind of cozy though. You know what? I'll I'll agree on that one. All right, guys, let's get a little screenshot with the uh, with Mr. Ilbert here. Let's stand. Let's stand like this. Yeah, let's make him part of the gang. I'm gonna I'm gonna hold my pike over him. You know. Maybe, uh, maybe like this. Mm -mm 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 -mm. There we go. Sloppy. <laughs> Dude, I've heard that voice clip somewhere, but I don't know where. And, and I thought it was just like some internet meme, you know? Sloppy. Add it to the alert memes. I'm thinking a thousand points. I think it's going to be an expensive one. Write a little note in uh, in the alert thing, though. I'll try and add it. Yeah, Iku. Yeah, can we get a shout out to Iku for first time playing Sage or Healer, by the way? 
Did it. We did great. We got it done. That was not even just like a walkover dungeon, right? That was minimum item level, no echo dungeon, right? First time healing. GG's. Good job, Iku. And chat, good job for uh, helping out with the tips and stuff as well in a, in a well-respectable manner. Good job. You know what, chat? You guys are pretty cool. You guys are pretty good. When it comes to stuff like that, you're pretty well behaved. You know, you're pretty well behaved. I heard it's rough. I have no idea. But Sage is going to be something I try at 70. All right, let me grab a G pose. And then it's, it might be a cutscene, okay? I'm going to trust you guys not to uh, not to be redeeming a bunch of like noisy things during the cutscene, all right? Because um, I can't be bothered to turn off every teabag point redemption thing. I'm just going to trust you guys not to fuck around with it too much, all right? What's up, Silver? How are we doing? I refuse to heal people. You've just got to do deeps. There we go. Wait, let me... There we go. Nice. Good job, team. Good job. I fucking knew it was him. He, I mean, he was the only person it made sense it was going to be, right? I wonder who the fake one is, though. That's the, that's the question. All right. That, that also means that I guess uh, Raoban did not succeed in fucking him up as well. Who would have thought? I'm the fake one, smile. Spit on him. True. You hurt my boy. <laughs> Alright. Um, uh, Let me get my hood. Let me get my hood up. Alright, guys. GG's for the dungeon. GG's for the dungeon. It might be cutscene time. This is a cool little uh, place, by the way. Are we right at the top of the wall? What the hell is that in the distance? Why does it have to be nighttime and foggy and shit? I wonder what this is. I guess that's just more. And I guess the black shroud's out that way, right? Can I even see? I guess not. Alright. Uh, arm for arm. Yeah, true, actually. We should give him the same treatment. Okay, let's uh let's do this. You've beaten me, I. Ick. But you cannot stop what I've begun. Behold, a glimpse of things to come. What now? Budget's back. God, I look good. Things to come, yep. <laughs> I knew you fucking guys would start talking about come. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, wait, these guys are kind of strong. We did it! We showed the bastards! Aye! Victory is ours! And who knows, lads? Mayhap the Eorzeans will finally see sense when the enemy turns up on their bloody doorstep. They're not actually Alliance soldiers, I'm pretty sure. Company soldiers. Who the fuck is this? This is for Alamigo. Oh, fuck. Fucking Laurentius, bro. This fucking guy, man. That others may live. Oh my god, this fucking guy. Ah, oh, you... This dude as well. What's he called? You hussy. Dude, of course. At the... guards, attack! Why have we trusted this bloke ever? Oh, Ergot's coming out. Seven hells. Do you hear that? Wait, they, he was, they were Imperial now. You have say in uh, the bomb. Machines. 
How did they get here so quickly? Stand your ground! For the resistance! Jesus. Well, we just kill one of these. But I guess we are kind of OP. Rip Bozo. Something's going to come out of that door. Oh, never mind. Brutal. Yeah, to be fair, there's quite a few. Wait, so these were the good guys. Oh, no, these are the resistance people. Bye bye. Holy shit. Sleep well. I mean, they were the resistance anyway, right? But the Imperials are just fucking them up. I can't believe Laurentius is now in the fucking Imperials. <laughs> God help oh my God. What we he went from wood whalers. The empire is too big. The crystal braves. Too powerful. To fucking empire, bro. Yeah, resistance dress alliance. Yeah, okay, that's what I thought. Mighty Rolker. Grant us the strength to crush our. Holger. Is that a god? Goodbye. By the way, when I ask questions like that, I'm there just talking are. to myself, so don't answer them. Just shrewsh. As you can see, our infiltrators did not elude me for long. Lady Ugiri is sending for an airship even as we speak. What do we do? This is a massacre! Yeah. We just got a ditch. <laughs> How wonderful to see you, Commander. Oh, the beef between him and Alfie, Ill man. Bird. I should have known. This has to end. It has to end now. Do you not see your countrymen dying? I knew. Have your ideals rendered you blind even to that? Order the retreat, and we will help your soldiers to safety. Retreat with the moment of my triumph so close at hand. You truly are a sheltered child. Wait, yeah, he's there. imperial. He's not even he's not even resistance. He's straight up imperial, dude. <sighs> don't throw Don't throw him off of No abyss is too deep for you, I see. But trust me when I say that such power was not meant for mortal hands. Literally worst idea ever, by the way. I just throw them into the into the ditch. These like supremely, extremely, super duper, crazy, high power things. Yeah, I'll just throw them down off the thing. Anyone could be watching. Oh uh, yeah, these things that like overtook a Stinian and turned him into fucking Nidhog. And it's like, I'll just chuck them off like no one will ever get him. It was Amrick's idea. How could he do this, man? Are we the sloppy one? Yeah. How sloppy. Long I struggle to reach this point. My countrymen, so inured to the taste of defeat, they no longer balk at its bitterness, shouting my throat raw with rallying cries, only to be greeted with dull eyes and blank faces. My brothers and sisters in Ulda have surrendered to their apathy and their appetites. Were it not for the glint of Lodorito's coin, I doubt even those here now would have answered my call. <laughs> Take back our homeland. Free Alamigo. Ha! They'll happily mouth the words, but they won't spill the blood. You say no mortal should wield these eyes, then I shall gladly become a demon. I will suckle on the souls of the hopeless and liberate the homeland they no longer deserve. 
Death too. Nidhogg, we've got to kill him again. Mean to do? <laughs> Did you hear their cries as victory was snatched away from them? Even with their dying breaths, they cursed the Empire. Never has their desire for vengeance been so raw, so true. A god oh, has no need of summoned by so pure a purpose. He's going to summon... Become Ralgar or something. You cannot mean to fight the Empire with a primal. You know full well the danger, the futility of relying on such power. Oh, yes, I know their limitations, which is why I will call upon a deity more terrible than the very black worm of the calamity itself. That's cool. Printing, printing screen. What? Here, now. Like hell, you will. Go on, Ida. Oh, what let down? <laughs> Hands up. He's about to go giga mode. An ending. To mark a new beginning. My pain, my longing, you shall have it all! Sloppy. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, he's suiciding to become. <laughs> oh, God, he's actually gone crazy, dude. Ugh. Dead lol. Full damage. He actually just straight up killed himself. And now with all the bodies, he's going to summon a primal. Of rage. Of death. Oh god. <laughs> Jesus. Oh shit, answers? It's sucking in all the corpses. Jesus Christ. This light, is it? No. His death completed the ritual. The primal is taking shape. Well, can't we stop it? There must be something we can do. You gotta kill it. Then we just have to fight it. We can't stop the ritual. There is one thing. Oh? Where do you think you're going? No. Master Louis Soir briefly contained Bahamut by means of a potent spell of sealing. Wait. I will now attempt to do the same. B but that's impossible. We would need hours to collect the necessary ether, if not days. Ah, uh, Alfino, though I concede it may not always be apparent, <sighs> I was ever your grandsire's finest pupil. Oh, fuck. Why is Marty, of course. The staff still holds enormous power, broken or not. Oh, Alfie, he's so Don't naive. You know, I know how that spell works. There's no way he's going to sacrifice. Damn it, then he's it gonna. Time to leave. He's gonna gain ranks. Because he would have done something Quite cool. Right. Quickly now, off you go. The further <laughs> away, the better. <laughs> no! No! If you're staying, then so am I. Oh, we can't lose either. Let's, let's, no, Ida. let's be serious. There is a path only you can walk, and it must not end here. Not like this. Jesus. 
She's important. Take her. Please, you have to take her. Wait, so this whole time Papalino was a fucking big shot. Luis Suarez's best student. And he's done nothing. <laughs> Yoink! This is one battle you cannot fight. Away with you. Go! Dude, all this standing around. Nothing's happened. What will you do? Trust in Papalimo and leave in the airship. Stay at Papalimo's side. Part of me just wants to ditch him. I'm going to stay at his side. Yeah, if I log out, nothing bad can happen, right? I'm staying. I'm not fucking leaving! <laughs> the illusion of choice. He's just like, get out of here. Oh no. Yeah, he'll 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 for sure come back. I bid thee farewell again, my dear Ida. Oh. Now let us see how good a student come on, man. He truly was. Fucking Ilbert, bro. Again. Yo, that's the one. He's going to contain it. That's the fucking one, dude. Wrapped up like Bahamut. He's going to use all the ethers of all the bodies and himself. Shit. I mean, I did not see the dead thing, you know? Look, look. I did not see him die, you know? Look up. Oh, you want me to look up? What? Shit. Well, the airship's here and everything. It kind of looks a bit like Diamond, huh? It's like an eclipse. It's Diamond. Oh, anyway, it's just uh, what they did to Bahamut, but then he broke out of it again, right? But this time it actually worked. So it's like a prison for Aether. Aether. It's Diamond. It's Al It's Diamond nuts. Jesus. Yeah, so it's like a new moon, kind of. It's like glowing. Yeah, like a primal prison. It wasn't even fully summoned. So it's just a fucking egg now. I mean... Unless that literally stays forever, it's, it's just a fucking egg. Waiting. Well. Yep, egg. Jesus. Okay. Surely Papa Limo's okay. <sighs> he 
He's surely fine. Cope. Copium. <laughs> I, like, okay. He put the spell up. I mean, I mean, Louis Soir was all right, you know? Kind of, in a way. You know? He, he lived... He lived a little bit, you know, we're chilling. He's surely fine. Let Paper him cope. Has become a baked potato. A baked papato. Baked papato. Okay. I'll give it to him. I'll give this to him. Finally, Papa Limo did something. The first and last thing he ever did. Fuck. <laughs> Shit. I mean, I didn't actually see him die though, right? So he's surely still alive. Like, you know my theory, guys. You know what they say. They go to the Isle of Val till further notice. You know? To the Isle of Val until further notice. He did something. Yay. It's being mean to little people. Oh, no. We love the Lala Fels, but Papa Limo. Oh, shit. We're going to have to talk to either. Let me see what these guys say. Apolimo knew what he was doing. I could not refuse him. I did trust him, by the way, guys. I just wanted to stay at his side, you know? Yo, Alandro, what's up? Papi entered Shadowlands. Nah, nah, nah. He's, he's fine. But he... he Look, Papalimo will be back, guys. Okay? Don't believe anyone's dead till you see a body. Exactly how I think about it. Exactly how I think about it. Tongue, thank you for the gift sub to Papa Limo. <laughs> he deserves that one. Okay. Thanks again for the healing tips. It was fun dungeon. I didn't expect to actually like Sage by the end. Hey, good job, by the way, Evan. Good job on the healing, okay? Yeah, you did great. You did great. How many more must we lose? <sighs> Man, nobody is fucking safe. Nobody is safe, man. Tongue, thank you for the gift sub to Elandra as well. Welcome back in, Elandra. Appreciate you, man. How are we doing today? Tongue, thank you for that as well. Thank you for that as well. Sorry, the alerts are just paused for a sec. Yuguri. I understand only too well the desire to reclaim one's homeland. What the heck? Elandra! I don't need no alerts. Hey, I appreciate you guys gifting stuff without the alerts on, man. I don't need no alerts. Alandra, thank you for the 10 gift subs. That's a that's a pay it forward right there. Jesus. Look up. Yeah, look, guys. There's a moon up there. There's a moon behind me. I can't rotate my camera. What's up, Decadence? How are we doing? Oh, hey, Alandra. Hey. Cheers, mate. Alandra, thank you for those. Thank you for the gift subs to uh, Eric, Cart, Johnson, Ras Games, Phenom, The Welsh Person, Nikosi, Ben Candy, Mackerel, Rebel Wrecked, Laminius, and Rai, Rai Dan Dan. If any of you guys are here and get gifted a sub at any point today or any point on any other stream, guys, please do make sure that you thank the sub gifters, okay? They honestly do a lot to keep this channel going. So we got to show our appreciation to them. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Alandra. Thank you, Tongue. Appreciate those. Right. Jesus. What the hell? Dude, it's so stormy here. It's hailing. Fucking hell. Ugh. Jesus. This camera is so hot. The white balance is so off as well. It's kind of cozy. Kind of cozy though. Jesus. England. England. <sighs> Jesus. Cozy though. Sloppy. <laughs> All right. You're taking our rain. Thank you for that. Uh, it's okay, guys. I got you. Is that your 70 shirt? This is my game show hosting shirt. I dressed up for the uh, for a special stream, you know. Hi, Reeps. Right. Oh, 
Who just come in from the rain? <laughs> really? Ten. No. Ten steps from the car to the house, and she's absolutely soaked. <laughs> oh, you're all good, Fido. It's all in on, on the VOD and stuff. Can't show your garden that one creep's gonna find me again. I'm hoping not. I haven't seen that person in a couple years in chat, so I think we're good. I think we're good. Right. I understand only too well the desire to reclaim one's homeland, but I cannot condone such a slaughter. Yeah. The Domans would never do anything like that. It has been explained to me what the light represents, and I have ordered our forces to stand ready. It seems we can do little else but wait. Wait, what the light represents? So it is an egg. It's going to... It's going to break out. So wait, this was for nothing then? It was like a stalling. Basically, Papa Limo deployed stalling tactics. Is that what you're telling me? Jesus. What's up, Reaps? It's going all right. It's going good. Yeah, big stream today. We got a lot of story to do. Every Ishgardian gets taught the Sea of Clouds churns in the grip of the warring elements of water and wind. Enough to tear you apart, they say. No one's ever gone to the bottom of the abyss and lived to tell the tale. Oh. So how did that bastard manage to get his hands on Nidhogg's eyes? I got one word for you. Asians. Immortals. All right, let's talk to Ida. She's going to take this bad. <laughs> Ruda. Why? Why didn't they let me stay? Jesus. Do you guys hear that? Papalimo is my friend. I should have been there with him. I'm angry. You could see it in his eyes, Ida. He knew what he was doing. What had to be done. Master Louis Soir wore that same look right before the end. Do you think I don't know that? I know, all right. I, I know. There is nothing more you could have done. Ilbert caught us all off guard. Even Russ was powerless to stop him. Even me. If you must blame someone, then blame me. Just promise that you'll never forget what Papa Limo strove to protect or the lessons he tried to teach you. Shit. Don't. Don't speak to me. Powerless? Yeah, I, I got... Hey, I tried to stay with him. He shot me out away, right? Leave Ida with me. Go on. Go back to the Rising Stones. The others need to know what happened here. Yeah. Shit. Dude, we're just we're just getting rolled again and again and again. Another brick orchestrian. I guess that's the music from the dungeon, huh? Jesus. Well fuck. Everyone's got their umbrellas up. Well, fuck. Elbert won. Oh, shit. He didn't win yet. Wait, it changed. It changed, guys. Yeah, I know, Pink. And, and, and Minfilia, too.
Right, we've got to, uh, we've got to go to the rising st Oh, wait, no, I've got to talk to Alfie, actually. It is plain that recent events have shaken Alphano to the core. Forever lost. Orchestrian roll. Fuck! Forever lost. Music roll for forever lost. Jesus. He. He's fine, Russ. Once again, I find myself at a loss for words. But Thancred is right. We must return to the Rising Stones and apprise our companions of all of this. Pray make your way there at once. I will send word to Yastola and the others of our imminent return. Fuck, dude. Just vacationing to Val. Can we get the uh, temporarily on Val orchestrian roll? <laughs> Jesus. That's more accurate. Surely. He'll be back, guys. He'll be back. Right? I'm going to Revenant Stall. You all look amazing, by the way. Right, I'm imagining we have more cutscenes here. He's cute, he's been waiting the whole time. That's not the end, right? This has been like three quests. We've had no movie yet, you know? Oh wait, was that the end of 3.5? Well, shit. So it seem you bring ill tidings, brother. A new glam is swag. Aye. Behind the griffin's mask, we found the grinning face of an old adversary. Ilbert. I know not how, but he had in his possession the eyes of Nidhogg, whose dread power he used to initiate a summoning ritual. Even as we looked on... Oh. Okay. Sussy's here too. By the Twelve. I feel like they should have voiced this one. I don't understand. To attempt such a magic requires every ons of one's aether. Not one, not even grandfather, could cast it and hope to survive. Well, I guess that... I guess that answers that, huh? Oh, indeed. It was ever a last resort. As I am certain Papalimo was aware. That's pretty noble. Mm, thus did the pupil follow in the footsteps of his master, even unto the grave. I have as yet been unable to explain how Ilbert came to possess Nidhogg's eyes. There's short. We're so naive, man. I guess. I guess to be fair, I I like know because I've seen the cutscenes, right? In the depths of the Sea of Clouds, a perpetual storm of water and winds, aspected Aether rages. No mortal could endure such conditions. Bingo! Then mayhap it was the work of an Asian, but now is not the time for idle speculation, Kryle. I have need of your- oh, Kryle, I have need of your assistance. I thought she was telling off Kryle then for doing nothing. Uh, I, uh, yeah, yes, yes, of course. We must inspect the cocoon of light and ascertain the state of the primal trap within. Between our respective talents, I dare say we shall glean some measure of insight. All right, yeah, so it is an egg. All right. Understood. I can't promise I'll be able to sense much through the barrier, but I certainly shall do my best. As shall I. Let us be about it then. Hi. <laughs> Off they fucking go then. Jesus. What? Without so much as a by your leave? 
Pray forgive Archon Yustola for bri uh, her brevity. She seeketh employment, lest her grieve deprive her of the act to will. Sorry, the will to act. A desire to comfort either doubtless compoundeth her unseemly haste. I, too, must contend to this grievous loss in my own way. <laughs> Classic. By thy leave, Alice say, I shall honour our fallen colleague through gainful study. There exist writings which may yet further our understanding of this cocoon of light. My lady. The act to will. Mayhap I was too quick to judge. Surrendering to sadness and regret would be a poor tribute to Papalimo's sacrifice. That is true. Quite. We must begin preparations to face Ilbert's accursed creation without delay. What time we have was purchased at a too dear a price for us to squander it. Fuck. Well, now the equestrian role makes sense, huh? Louis Soir's finest student. If he's so if he's such a fucking big dick, why did he never do anything till now, man? Oh seven. The Papalimo. School's out forever. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, Jesus Christ, that one's rough. Check your titles. Having a gay old time. Plain puppy. Defender of Eorzea. Mm. His Hulk Slayer. Imperial Nuisance under Archon. I have loads. Sky Pirate. Kingsglaive. Oh shit, Kingsglaive. Silver Lining. Hit Y for achievements. Why get why gave me fishing log? I got it. I got it. Don't worry. Do 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 do. Uh, the finest pupil's ally. So there'll be a dot, dot, dot. Oh, there. School's out forever. Russ just stole in the finest pupil's ally. Damn. I saw King's Glaive. The finest people's ally. Alright, I guess we're wearing this today. We'll wear this today. My own grief is as crushing is a crushing weight upon my heart. And when I think of what Ida must be feeling, Papalimo's sacrifice cannot be in vain. We'll find the means to deal with this primal. No legend tile. Alright, we'll get there. We'll get there, okay? All I want to do is weep. But right now, we need we need not hold back the tears and do what must be done. Sid! Dude, we're getting so many orchestrians today. Guys, is he fine though? We haven't seen the body. To be fair, we haven't seen the body, guys. Okay? He may be dead, like we've got the we've got title, orchestrian role, 
Everyone's doing stuff, but... Did we see a body? That's the question. Yeah, no body, no death. That's the logic. Okay, all right. Copium, copium. All I can say is egg. Disenchanted. <laughs> he got disenchanted. Oh, shit. The obvious solution. The intermite. The interminable wait for news from Gridania seems to be taking its toll on Alice. Ah, Russ, I wish I had more to tell you, but the situation in the East Shroud remains largely unchanged. Meaning we still have no idea how long it will be before... Hello? A communication from the Alliance. One moment. No budget. Rip. Yes, of course. Our representatives will be present. Many thanks. Hello. Word from Gridania. The council will shortly be reconvened. The alliance leaders have already begun to assemble. They wish to discuss the primal, of course. As of Yastola's last report, the cocoon yet hung above the wall unchanged. Yes, but the Elder Seeds here doubtless shares our concerns about how long it will remain so. I am told that Sid Garland has been called in to add his expertise to proceedings. A wise decision. The more minds we have working on this, the better. Well then, I suggest we leave the Rising Stones into Taru's capable hands and make haste for the Lotus Stand. Back to Gritty. Let's do it. Tataru, good luck. Tataru and, and uh, Philomen, they're, they're pompers. Oh, who's this? Oh, fuck. Hello, hello, hello. A word, if you would, good sir. This place, it is within the realm of Eorzea. Towering Traveler. You're an odd-looking fellow, aren't you? Still, takes all sorts, I suppose. Uh, this here's Vesper Bay. Thanalan's door Wake to the ocean, as some folk like to call it. Am I to understand from your answer that I have indeed arrived in Eorzea? <laughs> Speak, boy! Hey. Yes, you're in Eorzea. You can travel to Eorzea ah, by boat, then. Plain response at last, and the one I wanted at that. My journey was not without its hardships, and I would sooner travel by land than put to sea again. Fair enough. Sea kind of sea travel kind of sucks, man. <laughs> you do not believe that so small a bar could bear me across the ocean? Such timid little sailors. I had but to set my course and set my jaw till I made port. Legendary traveler. <laughs> <laughs> Do you use fart? Though, it would perhaps have been oh, he's is a stomach. Oars a moment to sup on more than okay. a spray of brine water. By the trembling of my limbs, I sense a brief repast may be in order. Why are you guys spamming giga chat? Nay, I will not hearken to the feeble grumblings of an empty belly. Duty comes before all. Oh yeah. Let's go. Oh, never mind. Good, good man. Are you all right? <laughs> he needs food. <laughs> you. Mm. Far indeed from home, friend. Hurry on, Jay. What's the crack? Egg check. 
I'll check in a sec. Speak with the silent conjurer at Nafika's altar. All right, we're setting something up here. Tongue, thank you for the gift sub to Giga Chad. Can't believe they weren't already subbed, am I right? All right, we need to go to Nafika's. Are right, you guys? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, Black Shroud. Gridania. A warrior needs to eat too, guys. All Giga Chads need to be, uh, what's it? Um, have the right supplementation. What a cute Lala fell. It's like you were waiting for me, huh? All right, let's go up here. No fikas. No one had the name. <laughs> The silent, the not so silent conjurer, huh? All right, we're gonna go talk to. Uh, I hope you guys are ready for bed, because we're gonna go talk to Kani Senna now. Okay. Welcome, Warrior of Light. This way, if you please. Bed time. Sid's here. Oh, I forgot he's so swagged up nowadays. I like that they give people new outfits as the story goes on. That's cool. Carney Sanders has not changed her outfit yet, and nor is the Admiral, I think. They need to get a glow up soon. Keep in line with the others. Although hers Dear isn't friends, too bad. Pray accept my heartfelt thanks for your efforts in defense of Gridania's borders. I would fain dwell longer on my gratitude for the support of the Alliance, but the situation at Belsar's Wall demands that we forego such pleasantries. According to our most recent intelligence, the cocoon of light that formed in the air above the Wall remains undimmed and unbroken. After measuring the cocoon's etheric concentrations, Archon Yishtola has confirmed the presence of a primal entity. It's literally an egg. <laughs> so we must assume that Ilbert's thrice damned god is indeed trapped within. And what news of the Imperials? They're not like to ignore such a spectacle. Yes, sir, a Galian airship was observed making an approach. But the vessel was destroyed when it drew near. The Empire appears to have made no subsequent attempts to reach the object. Oh, it's that powerful. Hmm. But we, we still have to fight it then. The soldiers who witnessed the incident spoke of a lance of light issuing from within the cocoon. Of an entire warship being reduced to smoking ruin in the space of a moment. Lance of light. Don't fly too close to the moon. Veterans of Cartano, meanwhile, likened the destruction to that wrought by the fiery wrath of Bahamut. We could face another calamity. Yeah, like, isn't that more dangerous when it breaks out now? It's like powering up in there. So the primal is awake then? Contained, yes, but for how long? We must destroy it now, lest it break free. How? Agreed. There is, however, the small matter of how to get close enough to a being that swats warships from the sky as you would a bothersome gnat. <laughs> Daddy. God, I look good. Oh, no one has any ideas. Never mind. Is, is this be? truly so complex a puzzle? Nero! Or have you no stomach for the obvious solution? Oh, we're going to Death Star it. He was at like a control panel. What in the hells are you doing here? His boyfriend. A pleasure to see you too, Garland. Now, if you'd be so kind as to explain to these good people why you should be begging me for my assistance, that would be most appreciated. I forgot we saw him like last stream. Legend. Yay, Nero! We're gonna shoot a beam at it. 
Who is this man? Oh, how terrifically rude of me. Nero Tolskeva, former Tribunus of the 14th Legion of the Garlean Empire. These days, however, one might say that I'm something of a free agent. What do you want, Nero? <laughs> I was getting to that. Although you already know what I'm about to propose, old friend. Hmm. As you have rather belatedly realized, within that frail binding the lurks an entity are alike in again. strength to the great Bahamut, and the only force in existence which might conceivably contend with such a foe is the very creation which captured the Elder Primal in the first place. I speak, of course, of Omega. Oh, shit. That smile. Omega. That hulk has been gathering dust beneath the plains of Cartanal since the Alagans breathed the last. And none alive knows how to wake it. I'm sorry? Do you understand who it is with whom you have the privilege of speaking? I'm Nero Tolskeva, Master Engineer, the mechanical genius who restored the Ultima weapon to full operational capacity. That is true. Just restore Omega. And Easy clap. Have it, I'm graciously offering you the use of my considerable expertise. Wasn't that Teleji's plan? And what? You just expect us to accept? You're a fool if you think your deeds at the Crystal Tower are enough to win my trust, Nero. I mean, he was kind of going at the Crystal Tower, trust? let's be honest. You wound me, Garland. All those years studying side by side at the academy, sharing both trial and triumph, we were countrymen once, you and I. But sentiment aside, have you a better solution? Or do you mean to send in your vaunted hero there, as you always do, and pray the world is not engulfed in fear? <laughs> Look at me! <laughs> uh? <laughs> <laughs> Let us approach the problem in a rational manner. Does not the fact that Omega slumbers in stasis point to the existence of some overriding technology? A means of control? Mm. He's got it. I would ask a question, if I may. Nero, was it not? Tolskava. In the event that we succeeded in using Omega to shackle the primal in the manner you propose... What then would become of it? Do we not risk repeating the mistakes of the Alagans? Omega is but a tool. How we choose to employ that tool is entirely up to us. Of course, if you would rather leave it buried beneath Cartano while you continue your petty squabbles above, then I suppose that is also your choice. Spare us, mm. Nero. The Seed Seer's concern is a valid one. He who controls Omega wields the power of the gods, the very power which led the Alagans to destroy themselves. They're not all gone, though. And does it not fall to we engineers to prevent such misuse? What was your company's proud slogan? Freedom through technology? <laughs> A creed you follow, is it? <laughs> I like Nero. What say you? Do we take this villain at his word? Yeah, I mean, we've not got much other choice, have we? He makes a convincing case. No, but I'll keep an eye on him. Ah, I'm sold. I'm sold. He makes a convincing case. Fuck it, dude. He's in. Makes sense. Sid, Sid shook his head at he me. He makes man. me grind my teeth is what he does. Sure, but bud. I suppose we don't have much of a choice. Exactly. There we go. You know Sid's in when he does the hand and balls. Uh, I mean, piston hands. Would the council be willing to entrust this matter to a pair of former Imperials? Sorry. <laughs> a 
<laughs> so. <laughs> yes. The task of restoring the Alagan relic will be yours. But I the speak. responsibility for its reawakening must remain with the council. Do we condone this course of action? <laughs> yes. Aye. Could seem we do. Let the record show that we invest this contingent with the authority to enter Cartanau and take command of Omega. Sid, I appoint you. Wait, we're going to go expedition. down to Cartano. Science, I would ask that That's you cool. assign some few of your number to escort Master Garland and supervise the other one. Another dungeon, maybe. The other one. A Nero's good, man. Stop being mean to him. I mean, he was kind of a villain once, but. I'm seeing double. We should be happy to oblige. The politics of Cardano being what they yeah, are. Look, they have opposite I earrings. Dare say our neutrality will prove useful in avoiding any unnecessary entanglements. And opposite hair. If I am not mistaken, Doma occupies a similarly neutral position. Might we not persuade you to join the expedition, Lady Yugiri? If you suspected any foul play from Nero, you would be welcome to kill him. <laughs> Let's go, Yugiri. My blade is yours. Hmm. Not a moment's hesitation, eh? You'll forgive me if I do not shake your hand. <laughs> I like his like shitty and grinny goose thing. <laughs> Dude, Amerik had like the least input on this thing. They did Aimeric dirty in this one. But to be fair, he's like, who the fuck are these guys? He knows nothing about what's going on. He's been hiding under a... He's literally been hiding under a rock for like the past hundred years or some shit, you know? Yeah, can they just kiss? Okay. Guys, I really need to pee. So, uh, I've been holding it in for like 20 minutes now. Before we hand this quest in, I'm going to do that quick. All right sink not in the sink okay what the heck no how could you kill the king being like that riff flow all right look All right, I'm going to go pee real quick. Uh, I'm just going to play the ad break now so it doesn't play for like an entire hour, okay? For the uh, for the people that are dealing with the ads at the moment. Then there won't be ads for like an entire hour. Um, so I'll be back in just... Oh, wait, I can't even... I can't even play it. Wait, can I? It won't let me play an ad. I guess it played it too recently. That's weird. Wait, wait, wait. Let me refresh. I just want to turn it off for... A significant period of time. Oh, okay. Okay, well, I can't play an ad. I'll be quick then. I'll be quick, alright? Two seconds, guys. VOD enjoyers. We're listening to Funky Town. I'll be in two seconds, okay, guys?
What a groovy song, man. All right. I be back. Hello, 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 hello. Good grooving, guys. Good grooving. Damn, that's a lot of dance emotes. Okay. What is an ad? Oh, sometimes they play for some people that aren't sub, but don't worry. Everyone in here is pretty much subbed. I can see like one. Uh, I can see one person that's not subbed in the chat right now. <laughs> All right. Get them. Don't look at me. I'm hideous. Okay, I can see three now. Who is subbed? A lot, a lot, a lot. By a lot of them by force. <laughs> uh, Akaya, Sora, thank you for the follow, by the way. Wicked Sins, thank you for the 100 bits. Mwah! Tongue, thank you for the gift sub to Nero Tolskava. Thank you also for the gift sub to Faranir. Suspect Putus, thank you for the gift sub to Hellhound. Apologies about the alerts, guys. I don't want I don't know if I should keep turning them off and on because we're getting cutscenes quite often. So I'm just gonna keep them off until like I can open the floodgates, I guess, right? Meow meow, look what you did. It just takes you three, huh? Meow meow. Thank you for the gift sub to Emmett Spacer. Uh, yeah, thank you guys. Thank you. All right. We, I guess we're training on cooldown, huh? Voss. <laughs> he has a tiny dick. I can still hear it, man. I can still hear it. I bet he has a tiny dick. How do they know? <laughs> Yay, train. What's up, Armo? How do they know? I can still... Everyone else in the chat can just kind of hear it. I can hear it. Everyone's like, tiny pee pee train. Yeah. I'm now watching an ad as punishment. There is literally not an ad playing right now. Wait, are you watching four ads right now? There's no way, because it right, it says there's no ads playing for 17 minutes. Voss, thank you for the 10 gift subs to Sam the Great, Carrots, Senrak, Wolverheim, Kid9044, Rifthaven, Tickwick, Glowy, Novris, and Verbandabog. And Anonymous, thank you for the gift sub to Fido Montoya. All right. Yeah, now you're not watching any ads up. All right, Fido. Okay, I'm watching an ad on 14 right now. Small bowl roll. Hi, Chucky. How are we doing? Yay, Anonymous. There we go. Everyone now is subbed, right, guys? You probably have, you a, probably have a tiny dick. How do they know? There we go. We got an unofficial alert. The, the alerts will play later when I unpause them. But right now... um. I don't want to like keep turning them off and on and off and on because I don't know when there's going to be a cutscene and stuff. So I don't want to like ruin the immersion because a lot of people are here to like watch the, me do the MSQ and watch the story and watch the cutscenes and stuff, right? So hopefully you guys understand. Um, yeah, the unpaused apocalypse. It will come later. It will come later. What's up, Not Tricks? What's up, Glowy? You two smell real good. Rivflow, thank you for the gift sub to I. It's Greg. There you go. My card won't accept. There you go. You don't don't have to worry about it. Rivflo got you, Greg. Okay, Rivflo got you covered. What the heck, James? <sighs> We're doing a subless, uh, an alertless hype train right now. <laughs> How do they know? <laughs> Can I get a sub, Tom Brickev? You have a sub, okay? Crimson Dragon James, thank you for the ten gift subs to Sebakari, to Sea Buzz, to Osiris. To um, Little Joker Jr., to Wrath Hit, to Wraith Hicks, to Dragon Fangs, to Angus95, to The Naked Flame. Or what is going on, guys? To Angus, to Naked Flame, to uh, Eshestia, to K2, Mazurzi. Dude, you guys can't bully me with the alerts off, okay? That's not how it's supposed to work. Dark Huntress, thank you for the follow. No Tricks, thank you for the follow as well. Uraseth. Thank you for the five gift subs to Party, to Geospone, to Zumozum, to Warmatran, to Frameskip. All right, has everyone got a sub now? Peepo talk. <laughs> has everyone got a sub now? All right, so no more ads for anyone that's watching for the cutscenes and the story. Okay, I'm going to try and be as respectful as I can with like putting ads on before the cutscenes and snoozing them when it's not a good time. I'll try and keep my eye on it as best I can, but if it does go through, I do apologize. Anonymous. Thank you for the gift sub to No Tricks. Okay, Anonymous. Anonymous has been in up in my chat recently. Yeah, not me. Vaz. Just say easy dodge and someone might be very generous. Just say that. Honestly, it's like a code word. No Tricks. Congrats on the sub. Also, Peepo Happy Shake is a great emote. Easy dodge. <laughs> 
dodged easy clap. Anonymous. Surely not. Mino Shin, thank you for the gift sub to uh, Papa Papa Limo 40 seconds as well. <sighs> All right. Anonymous. Wait, Tongue, thank you for gift sub to Anonymous. Now Anonymous Gifter has been paid forward. Trucky, thank you for the gift sub to Vaz Red Claw. There you go. Oh my god, what the hell is going on, guys? Inara. Inara Adrestia. Thank you for the nine months and nine months streak as well. Welcome back. Appreciate the support. Guys, only sub and gift subs if you want to. Right? Everything is I try and keep nothing paywalled on my screen on my stream, okay? Everything is free. Free to watch. I never do sub only anything, all right? Unless I absolutely have to for some reason, which I don't think I should need to. Uh, but I'll tell you this. I would appreciate if you're here for the first time. I know we might have some new people in here because we're doing story stuff today. Feel free to follow the stream, okay? Follows are free and they help support the channel. Plus, you'll get notified when I go live, things like that. Another free thing you could do if you were interested is obviously completely optional. Follow is optional. Joining the Discord. That one's also optional, okay? So feel free to uh, jump in the Discord. You can make some friends there as well, all right? Whoa, what the heck? You've been subbed for nine months and never said a word in chat. I was just thinking that. I saw your name pop up as first time chat, and I just said, thanks for the nine-month streak. I've been subbed for nine months, never talked in chat. <laughs> Holy shit, that's kind of based. That's kind of Giga Chat. Yes. Yeah, Devil Bird's got it. Giga Chad energy there, right there. Jesus Christ. Yo, welcome into the chat, Inara. Okay. Welcome into the chat. There you go. Wicked Sins, thank you for the gifts. For, sorry, thank you for the 100 bits. Mwah! Okay. Right. Did I miss anything? I think I got every alert. I think I got all of them. Okay. Uh, I'll just do the. Du, 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 there we go. Just in case we had one of the dad alerts go through there or something, I got you covered. All right, guys. Strong look, give money and support, doesn't say a thing. Yeah, sub for nine months, never say a thing. So it's proof though. Some people are watching and just lurking and hanging out and having a good time and vibing and supporting the stream. Appreciate you guys. If you chat, appreciate you. If you sub, appreciate you. If you don't sub, appreciate you. If you just lurk and never chat, appreciate you, okay? Shout out to the lurkers, all right? Frame skip. I've been lurking a while, but thanks for the sub, Urusef. Thank you for thanking Urusef as well. Trucky, thank you for the gift sub to Berry Mochi. Frame skip. Welcome into the chat. There you go. Respect. Uh, look, only chat if you want to chat. Okay, you can lurk away, do your thing. That's all fine. All right. That's all fine as well. Thank you, though. But I will say the chat's pretty nice and they will give you a good old sniff if you do chat. All right. If you decide to chat one day, they'll give you a good old sniff. All right. Thank you guys for the gift subs. Okay. We're going to, we're going to, we're going to, we're going to, you know what? Never mind. It's too, it's too soon for me to do that. Never mind. <clears throat> uh, not Zhao. Thank you for saying hi. And wait, you can't sniff yourself as your first message. Okay. <laughs> but we can sniff you. All right. We can sniff. You. Yeah. Sniffception, man. All right. All right. Tongue. I saw what you did there. Look up. <laughs> Yay! Yay! You need a 10. All right. Tongue, you hit the 300 now. All right. Thank you for the 10 gift subs to Jazz Pug, to P Duster, P Duster, to Akaza Akatzali, to Unit Unitama, to Rizla. Nice. To Cockti. To Cockti. To Kier Smack, to Epicentor, to Lord Shozo, to Not Grave Mind. All right. All right. Look up. Yo, what's up, drummer? How are we doing? It's a free channel. We can sniff ourselves. It's a free channel. Everything's free in here, guys. Sora, thank you for the gift sub to Not Zhao. Suspect, thank you for the five gift subs. Hey, look, 100. Exact All right. We leave it on exactly 300, exactly 100. Boom. Guys, <laughs> you guys are going too crazy. I'm just sat here. We've just had bad news, guys. There's an egg. There's an egg in the sky somewhere. There's an egg in the sky somewhere. All right. I smell myself every day. It's good to smell. Yo, I smell pretty good today, guys. I've got this body spray thing I've been putting on recently. It smells like... Uh... Oh, it smells good. It smells good. I'm layered up with scents right now. You, If you were here, I would actually give you permission to smell me. Yeah, like body spray. Like I have deodorant. 
Then I have like body spray and then I have aftershave. Some might say that's too many scents, but like each one is like discreet, right? Like you got your body. I basically like rather than put deodorant like sprayed on, I just put like a little bit on my chest of the body spray thing. Smells like triumph. Yeah, I smell good today, man. Uh, suspect, thank you for the five good subs to RBC, to Movie XD, to DMG9, to Veilufa, and Kevin, aka Eros. All right, I've seen a lot of those guys in the chat, so guys, make sure you say thank you to the sub gifters. All right, we're gonna talk to Alfie. Okay, it's about layering the scents. Exactly, Voss gets it. What's P dusting? I don't know what P dusting is, Stubbages. There you go. Guys, make sure you do thank the sub gifters if you if you can. It would make their day a little bit better. It definitely makes my day a little bit better seeing people be like thankful and stuff for that kind of thing. Because I'm I'm also thankful for it. So thank you guys. Alright. Well, that was a rather unexpected development. And one which raises a number of questions. Not least among them, how Nero chanced to learn of the council meeting in the first place. That is a good question, Alfie. You know what? That is actually a good question from Alfie. Not gonna lie. How did Nero know? <laughs> He's been spying on us. Okay, dude. Steal reason. You know what that one is. Princess. Thank you for the gift subs. The five. To Urbish. To Aruma. To the cunning... The cunniling linguist. Wait, what? The cunniling linguist. I'm so gonna get what now? I'm gonna get so angry. I am gonna get angry. You know what's making me slightly less angry? The alerts aren't there to tell me I have a tiny dick. You know. <laughs> so I mean, I I I, I can get. I'm get, I'm like slowly boiling up. But also, it's gonna take a it's gonna take a lot to get me angry today, guys. Because I'm having a good day. We're doing story. Everyone's here chilling out. All right. We've had people come in the stream who are like, "Oh, I didn't come in since you finished a Realm Reborn." Like, wait, you still play this game? You still stream? You do story? You sometimes do MSQ? What? Yeah, we have people come back in and be like, what? He does story stuff? Don't worry, we'll remind you. Yeah, I know you will. Spido, thank you for the 100 uh, bits. Mwah! Princess, thank you for the five good subs. Appreciate that, guys. Make sure you thank Princess. All right, we're going to talk to Alfie again. Alphano is eager to join Sid and the others. Question mark, question mark, question mark, huh? The greater obesance. Uh, obesance. Obisance. I don't know how to say that one. We're doing story today. What's up, Cry Havoc? Hello. Tune in. The first thing I hear is tiny dick. Clearly, I'm right on time. Chat's trying to tell me I have a tiny dick, but I'm telling them... I'll tell you guys in, in about a minute. All right. I'm going to tell them something. <clears throat> Stormblood today. But, well, end of Heaven Sword today, I guess. I guess technically, does that mean Stormblood starts today too? How do they know? How do we know? <laughs> Sid and the others are reassembling at the airship landing. Alice is already Hard on her idea. way. And I would not do to lag far far behind. Let us be off. All right, to the airship landing. Guys. You're all looking incredibly the cute. PP small. Stabages, don't you look up, okay? You're all looking incredibly cute. I will see you guys soon, okay? By the way, guys, in chat, if you would like... To join us, all right. We are playing on Oceana today. We're on Oceana server Ravana. You can bring your NA characters over. You can bring your EU characters over. You can bring your Jap Japanese server characters over. Stop looking up, all right. Level nine is pretty good. Okay. Look, we didn't even get to any special point yet. Well, I mean, we got to a sad moment, I suppose. You know. Story time. Yes. <clears throat> you can bring your characters over. This is the entire reason we're doing on NA. There's a slightly higher ping, but it doesn't really matter if you're just going to be vibing and hanging out, right? So we, uh, I decided we'd do MSQ today. So if there's any kind of meetup spot, any kind of point where people usually, you know, want to come hang out or something, then uh, we're going to get that done on Oceana. Kovo! Oof, so close. Unless that was intentional store. So yeah, you can you can bring your characters. In fact, I encourage you to come on over to Oceana um, because uh, yeah, quite often we have some nice community meet meet up kind of vibe kind of things at the end of these like big events in the story, right? So um, I put it on NA on OC today so that anyone can come. Oceana people can obviously come, and then all the other regions with the cross region data travel can come over as well. Cobalt polar bears. 
Thank you for the five gift subs to Xantes, to Rainbow Panda, to Rejaku, to Nagezuba, and possibly a Gecko. Sorry about the alerts again, guys. There will be an alert apocalypse soon TM. Okay, when I when I get to a safe spot to unpause. Rejaku, thank you for thanking Cobalt Polar Bears. Sad moment. Do not wish death upon him back up. I never said I wished Papa Limo to die. I just said he was useless. Okay. Oh, wait. Wait, I think I did. Yeah, shit, it was when Moonbreeder. I was like, why couldn't it have been Papa Lima? <laughs> oh my god, it was like it was like the same kind of thing as well, actually. Dude, I hey, that's a pre I predicted it. I predicted it. Yo, Chef Monkey Gaming, thank you for the follow. Thank you guys for the hype train as well, guys. I really do appreciate that. Thank you for all the support you guys have been saying over the past 10 months. Uh, yeah, you guys have been really, really, uh, supportive of the stream. So thank you. I'm glad you're enjoying the content. Okay. All right. I predicted it in a way, right? More like wish death upon him. Kind of predicted though. More like damned. That's still kind of a prediction though. You know, in a way, like depends how much we squint our eyes, you know? Russ, Alphano, ready to go? The others have stepped onto the out onto the landing for a moment. Lest you wonder, Nero insisted that he be allowed to inspect the Excelsior before boarding. And you let him? Despite his very timely offer of assistance? The thought of that man poking about in the workings of the ship without proper supervision does not fill me with confidence. Calm yourself, Alphano. Your sister was adamant that he would never leave her sight. She and Yugiri are... Ah, well, here they are now. Arisef, thank you. Be sure, be sure to catch it in the VOD if you've got to go to bed and stuff. For sure, for sure. If you're enjoying it, that is, of course. Thank you very much for the five gift subs as well, Arisef. All right. Oh, fuck. This is auto playing. Hold, guys. Sorry. All right. <clears throat> right. I think that's everyone. I shall set course. Shall I set course for Carter? No, that was Sid. All right. Now we're back to Alfie. <clears throat> ah, might I ask that we delay our departure slightly? I require no more than a few hours at most. Our colleagues are studying the cocoon even as we speak, and I would hear their latest observations ere we proceed. It would seem wise to gain as clear an understanding of the situation as possible before formulating our plan. Oh, I thought time was against us. How foolish of me. Hold your tongue. When we want your opinion, we'll ask for it. <laughs> Forgive me, my lady. I shall keep my counsel until such a time as you have finished procrastinating. Oof. All right, while Alphano speaks to his colleagues, I shall fly the Excelsior over to Mordona and we can reconvene at the Rising Stones. Mine apologies for the trouble. I shall visit Yastola and the others forthwith and join you as soon as I am able. Russ, pray accompany Alice back to the Rising Stones. I should feel safer knowing you are present to entertain our guest. Right. Everyone heading to Mordona is welcome to travel aboard the Excelsior. I'll clear things with that girl at the counter here. Let her know when you're all ready to leave. All right, we're going with City Boy. I want your opinion, Nero. <laughs> Me. Can I have Nero's opinion? <laughs> Gag him? Wait, what? Who said that? No, no, no. Just... He told... Never mind. Amy, you're getting on the ship too? All right. Hida. You traveling with Mr. Garland? Yes. The Enterprise Excelsior is right this way. The Enterprise Excelsior has two names now. All right. This is eerie. Wait, what? Oh, there's a crystal tower. I was going to say, where the hell's the crystal tower? He's looking at his ship. What manner of airship has no private cabins? Then again, I suppose Garlon had to find somewhere to stow his half-baked uh, inventions. Not quite a door-to-door -door service, but I couldn't exactly land her in the Toll's main square. Shall we adjourn to the Rising Stones then? Alright. I probably should have talked to the others. 
This is so eerie. Nero probably spills the best tea. Yeah. Nero's got some sass to him, for sure. All right, let's do this. Let's do this. Sorry for the ads, guys. Well, I'll wait before we start cutscene. Hello. You on the piano there, Savages? Holy shit. ARR Night Silence. That's the worst part about ARR. The fact it doesn't have nighttime themes. We must be careful, old friend. The walking weapons of a lag were expre uh, expressly designed to subdue primals, but men like Gaius will always seek to use them against mankind. It falls to us to ensure that Omega is never deployed as a weapon of war. In the wrong hands, it would be... It would be bad. One, one was created to capture Bahamut and the other to surpass him. Which will prove the stronger, I wonder? I fear not. I shall keep a close eye on our new ally. Lots of money! <laughs> I know Nero's a guest here, but we don't exactly have the happiest history with the Empire, do we? So my question to you is, do I offer him tea? <laughs> oh, I love Tataru, man. Oh, what's going on with Homie? <clears throat> ah, the determination upon their faces. There is nothing more blinding than young than youth burning with purpose. Ori, Boulder, and his companions left to continue reconnaissance on the beast tribes. They were adamant about shouldering what burdens they could while senior science occupied with this cocoon emergency. All right, let's get to it. Mr. Nero! Budget? Surely. Yes. Mm, so yes. these are the fabled headquarters of the Scions. Nice. I confess I would have expected an order of self-proclaimed warrior scholars to surround themselves with the fruits of man's enlightenment. And yet there's not so much as a single piece of magitech in sight. <laughs> We're simple down here. It never ceases to amaze me how primitive you Eorzeans truly are. <laughs> oh, I'll have you know that the Rising Stones is home to the very latest in Magitech innovation. Oh? Wedge calls it the Mark 14 Thermocoil Boilmaster. The kettle! <laughs> the finest kettle I've ever had to own. Yo! Wedge, let's go. The Boil Master 5000, dude. T mention. We are returned. Hi. Well, Ida and I, at least. Ishtola and the others remain behind to continue their assessment of the binding magic. There didn't seem much point staying just for that, so I decided to come back with Alphano. How are we gonna? Papalimo bought us this time. We shouldn't waste it. He literally just stalled. He died for stalling. True guy. You know what, Papalimo? I respect that. He he died for stalling. Good God, that voice could fell a gigas. How do you know where we this are? This is the Rising Stones, domicile of the Scions of the Seventh Dawn. I enter. At the invitation of one Lord Urionje. Urionje. <laughs> I spy you there, Shadow Walker. You always were a hard one to find. His Doman. Yugiri, do you know this man? He's gonna hug her. No. Oh. Gosetsu. Why are you come to Eorzea? Gosetsu. I recognize that name. In search of you, Yugiri. For days and nights did I row across the angry sea. Why do I recognize I that name? I may fought in good spirits, only for my own flesh to betray me over the trifling matter of an empty belly. Collapsed in the street like an unfed stray I was, until Lord Urionje came to my aid. Urionje. He was a good voice actor. welcome meal. We spoke of the plight of Doma, and I learned of our displaced countrymen's work to resettle this blighted land. 
T'was blind fortune that I was able to locate you so swiftly. But now we must make ready to depart. Our master languishes in dire peril, and Doma calls her daughter home. It is not so simple, Gozetsu. There are obligations which bind me here. She's cute. I like her little horns being pink. You refuse? Oh. You mislay your oath during your flight from our homeland. The laws of hospitality must be honored, but surely the vow to defend your master demands the greater obeisance. She got she got friends who were dying, man. Let me guide our people to safe haven by any means necessary. And it was the scions you see before you who provided us succor and sanctuary when all others refused. Dire peril or no, were I to return without first repaying such hospitality, our master would cut me down at the threshold. That's some integrity right there. Hmm. Mayhap that is so. There is more. A crisis threatens all within this realm, Eorzean and Doman alike, and I go to play my part in its resolution. I will not bring shame upon our liege by abandoning my people or my duty. Hmm, how very noble of you. Now, in the name of honor, kinship, and, <laughs> oh yes, practicality, might I suggest we get this expedition underway? Or would you rather debate the finer points of duty and leave Omega to the Empire? Uh, I love Nero. He's the so Empire. good. You giddy. You draw steel against the curse of Gollumold? Yep. Then why did you not say so? My blade is oath-bound to fall upon the ranks of the Imperial. Plus one, baby. They march. Lead on, Shadow Walker. And may the enemy tremble at our coming. Whoa. <laughs> They're going to be trembling. They're going to be trembling at his uh, uh, our coming. Holy shit. Plus one, Chad. Yeah, Jesus. Russ, wait. Can I speak to you for a moment? Do you remember when, you, when I had... You meet me in the Diamond Forge and we uh, ambushed you. Yeah, you took my... Oh, we're getting suited and booted. Well, once we had your measurements, I set my work making you a traveling outfit in my spare time. I've only just this moment finished the stitching, but I wanted you to have it before you left. Here. New glam, baby. Come on then. You can try it on right now if you like. I'm down. Let's do it. Hold. Wow. Ooh. God, I look like Alice and Alphino's long lost sister. That's dripped. Assuming we measure correctly, the fit should be just right. Snug, but not too snug, if you know what I mean. So, how does it feel? Yeah, I'm a levier now. You're not just saying that, are you? Oh, I can't tell how much this means to me. To have something crafted worthy of the Warrior of Light is... It's... Well, let's just say it makes all the practice worthwhile. Ah! <laughs> Alfie and Alice say, and Sid... With the with the practice targets, she was just warming up for me. Ah, oh, I'm the real, I'm the real prize. I also sewed in a blood pearl charm to, you know, bring you home. May it always protect you. Yeah, that that does look, that's a good outfit. It goes with my hair so well. Scion adventurer's monocle. Wait, I have a monocle? Adventurous jacket, bottoms, and boots. Nice. All right, I guess we know what we're wearing for the rest of the stream, huh? I guess we know what we're wearing then. All right, are we putting this outfit on or are we continuing as a dragoon? I guess we got to put the outfit on. I mean, Tataru just made it for us, right? Because his armor is on the store. 
It has his name on it. That would be it. Looking at it the other day. That would be it. Yeah. New outfit. Okay. New outfit. Uh, da da da. Silent Adventures monocle. The monocle's kind of cool. Wait. Okay. We got to turn off the shoulders and stuff as well, right? Body. Dee dee dee. Oh, there we go. Yeah, we do. Oh, the shoulder's part of the body, isn't it? I gotta hide the gloves. Ah. Oh. Wait, wait, wait. I have to do it this way. I'm learning. I'm learning, guys. Don't worry. Don't worry. Gloves are invisible. We got these. Oh, mama. And then the shoes. Don't look too hard yet, okay? Wait. What weapon are we going? All right, I gotta. We gotta. We gotta put the gay bolt back on. There we go. All right, sweet. There we go. Nice. Yeah, yeah. I probably should do that, Raviel. Fine. All right, we look pretty good. We're ready to activate Omega, I think. Look at that. She knows how to pose. Monocle? Oh, yeah, true. <laughs> oh, yeah. Alright, I'm going to take the monocle off, though, for, like, cutscenes. So cute! Hi, Hina. How's it going? Alright, let's talk to Gosetsu. My blade shall carve a path through the Empire's ranks as a scythe fells stalks of wheat. Legend. What's he got to say? Hmm. The Mark 14 Thermocoil Boil Master. Dear me, how risable must the pre previous 13 iterations have been? I could design a more efficient water heater in the time it took to the that ill-conceived lump to become lukewarm. Oof. Legend. What's he got to say about it? Oh, I think he's going to fit right in. <laughs> Wait, dude, imagine we get Nero to come join us. Oh, my God. I truly had no no idea Domans could be so... Oh, he was talking about Gosetsu. Domans could be so loud. He and Yuguri should hardly be more different. Never did I think to hear Gosetsu's voice echo through these halls. All right, let's chat with Ida. Ida's eyes shine with rekindled determination. Who the hell is this? Oh, I didn't talk to Tataru. Shit. Sorry. So, we have to wake Omega up, right? When do we start? Ida. You... Are you sure that... I'm sure, yes. I won't lie and say I'm completely fine. But I feel a lot better if I'm doing something useful. Sorry, I didn't talk to Tataru, guys. Very well. I'll remain here and continue coordinating our efforts with, with the Alliance. Alphano, may help you could return to Gridania and assist Yashola and Kryle. What the fuck is that, whoa, dude? <laughs> A fine suggestion. The rest of us will form the Cartano Expedition Party. Nero and I will focus on rousing Omega, whilst Russ, Ida, and our Doman friends take care of security. Oh yeah! So wait, is he a is he a row but with a human face? He's like a row body with a human face, right? Like a Highlander face, I think. The Excelsior is by the lake just outside town. We'll leave as soon as everyone is ready. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. What was this quest name called? Fly free, my pretty. All right. Hey, cuties. Fly free, my pretty. We're going. We're going. Been a while since I heard this. Whoa, that's a big Ruskasm. Better? Yeah, I guess. Ah, oh, <laughs> J Ruskasm. Why the giant? I think Twitch added a new thing. Gigantify an emote. And uh, yeah, it costs bits or something. Taking the peas in the freezer. Sheesh. <laughs> Alright. Wait, it's Sataru here. Damn, we missed her. Soon, Omega. Soon. I will see you rise again. Okay, this seems like a bad idea now. Can I tell someone that he said that? Kasetsu is an accomplished swordsman. Should it come to battle, he will prove a staunch ally. But I could say the same for Nero. Can I tell on Nero? He's just sat there like plotting in, in broad daylight, man. Caught! Will this contraption truly bear us through the skies? I was a bit lost for a while back there, but I'll be fine. Trust me. All right. Let's do it then. Uh, I get the bits. Yeah, so basically how bits work, guys. If you buy the bits, you pay Twitch like as you buy them. Once you have the bits, every bit is one cent. So 100 bits is a dollar basically, right? So 30 bits is 30 cents. Um, I, they don't take a cut after that. They take a cut when you buy the bits. So like 500 bits costs like $7 or something like that. So they take their cut at the start. We really haven't far to go. With any luck, we'll be in Kartano before Gosetsu graces the decks with his dinner. <laughs> Once there, however, we had the best be on our guard. Given that Aline Roil was still active when Omega was discovered, we can be sure that the Empire has long been aware of its existence. And if Nero deemed it poss the, the obvious solution to the threat posed by this new primal, it's not impossible. Oh shit, yeah, the traitor. That Garlemald might do the same. Have your weapons ready and your wits about you. Something tells me we're flying into a fight. Well, fuck. Oh, duty calls. Fly free, my pretty. Duty. All right. Well. Here we go then, guys. I will see you on the other side. <laughs> Ooh. Let's do this. Thanks, Colleen. Thanks, whoa, dude. <laughs> he said duty. <laughs> I already hate the new feature. <laughs> Why did they add this? Oh shit, this is where we saw him in the cutscene before. Now where was that? Ah. I've enabled the teleporter. One brief jump and we shall arrive in Omega's control room. How convenient. You've been here before. Of course. It was no easy task threading a path through all the skirmishes. But how could I ignore the existence of this is a such piece a of fascinating toy? This is a piece of diamonds. You may trust that my preliminary examination was suitably thorough. Trust? Aye. I trust your appetite for technology. I chased down a suspect airship, and who should I find but the traitor? Sid Garland. And Nero. Grinwatt. Who the fuck is that guy? Searching for something, engineer. Something big. He's it's got Nero's nice, hammer. Isn't it? Something big. <laughs> 
It's like all my name days have come at once. Who the fuck is this guy? Do I know this guy? All the scouts the Empire could have sent. Take care of that brute, will you? He's got he's got Nero's hammer. Of all my name days. God damn it. Can't let Nero tinker around in there by himself. I'm sorry to leave you to it, but I dare say you'll manage without me. <laughs> this Claude has no idea who he's dealing with. Sneaking off with Nero, are we, Sid? On my name days, isn't it? <laughs> Alright, we gotta fuck him up then. They're sneaking off together, those two. He is a big guy. I am Gorsetsu, Samurai of Doma. You will rue your choice of opponent this day. Let's do it. Yo, what legends. Oh, this this tune slaps. All right, it's just a 1v4. All right. Well, let's go fuck him up then. Nah, you know what? Let's go. Oh, wait, I can't even. Let's go. No holding back. Leave this to me. Oh my god, he's he's kind of owning me. Look upon a samurai of Dama. It's all over now. Yeah, honestly, are we? It doesn't even feel like we're on OC. Do 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 do. Tis my right to strike. Oh, ads, 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 ads. This one will sting. Oh yeah. Make him sting. No retreat. No surrender. Oh shit. I'm just gonna line him up and knock him down. I'm just lining him up and knocking him down. Oh my god! Gosetsu just killed everyone. Your defense is lacking. This takes me back to um, Camp we Cape Westwinds. With soul and steel. Oh shit, we're done. He was He's going to he's going to charge up. He's going to turn on the hammer. Surrender. We have you outnumbered. Nah. Never. Wouldn't be the first time. Uh, Eda, what you been getting up to? Jesus. still playing with those soldiers i suppose i can lend you one of my toys but only if you promise to give it back we're gonna get toys baby toys for days oh yo i've seen this red maggie toys Perfect. Spooky Donkey, thank you for the follow. Behold! Oh. Behold! The Red Baron. Now end this nonsense. Yo, let's go. What the? No one told me they'd have Magitek armor. Uh, <laughs> forward! F for the Empire! Yo, he's, he's already gets beaten up a lot. He's got like cuts on his face and shit, dude. Mock station mount. The honorless Kerr thinks he has a, to abandon his men. I shall see that he shares their fate. Pray attend to the rest of his minions. I'll fuck him up. I got a rocket ship now. Oh, they're, they're so dead, man. 
That's so dead. I'm snoozing the ads. Bum, 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 bum. Oh shit, I just... Oh my god, I just get to blow him up. Oh my god, I got an airstrike. Send in the airstrike! Oh my god, they're getting owned. Wait, what's this? Mega beam? It's all over now. Woo! No retreat. No surrender. Oh shit, hello. Look upon a samurai of Doma. You watching Papalimo? <laughs> you watching Papalimo? Oh, that was cool. Come on, let me place it. There you go. Stupid OC ping. All right, hold. Let me line up the beam. Massive. And opening. I have you. Oh shit. Uh. All right, we need to kill. We need to kill. This one will sting. Woo! Leave this to me. Okay, I gotta focus the Colossus. With soul and steel. Nice. Oh, dude, easy clap. Easy clap. Hey, you can't just run off. Dude, we killed so many people there. Deserting a battle is punishment. Oh, he's going to get rolled. Sorry, mate. Sorry, mate. Now that's embarrassing. You bring this fate upon yourself. Pitiful. Damn it to seventh hell. I'll kill you bastards. Oh, see you later, mate. He's so dead, dude. No retreat. No surrender. Oh, he's so owned. Look upon a samurai of Doma. A samurai of Doma. Genocide, <laughs> Jesus. Nice try, mate. Oh. Oh, he's got nothing on uh, Ritalin, dude. Ritalin was a pumper. That guy actually wiped me. Twice, maybe. Even. You watching, Pablo? Oh, so easy. Ah, uh, yes, Ritalin. You haven't seen the last of me. Mark my words. It'll be you. Uh, wait, what did he say? Who rules this day? ADHD mention? <laughs> no, <laughs> we're not going there, guys. All right, we're in the control panel of Omega. Temporal stasis disengaged. All systems operational. Garland. All clear on this side. It's waking up. Transformers. Bonk. Snoozing the ads. There it is. Remarkable. Omega sensors immediately detected the presence of the cocoon, even at this distance. I was just ready to fucking bust. Of energy exceeding certain magnitudes. I still don't see any means to control the machine directly. It seems to have been designed to act wholly autonomously. Hmm. Destroy. 
Once nice. we release Omega, we can be fairly certain it will attempt to capture the Primal at Belsar's Wall. Assuming its mission is successful, our only option at that point will be to re-engage its stasis system and put it back to sleep. That's where it goes wrong. And should the machine happen to misbehave, we'll simply initiate an emergency shutdown. I confess, we don't yet have a complete grasp of its capabilities, but I'm certain the details will not mm. elude us for long. Well, I understood less than half of that. So, my question to you is, are we doing the right thing? I mean, Papa Limo... Well, what do you think? Is there any other way? What does she think? Because obviously, Papa Limo kind of stalled and bought us the time. If we don't execute, we won't be doing anything with the sacrifice, right? And also, we don't really have any better ideas. So, does she think? Yeah, does she think? This can't possibly go wrong. <laughs> what do I think? Yeah, you heard me. She's zoning out. All right. Step aside, Sid. Hmm. Is this the thing I need to press? Uh, yes, that's the one. A massive red button. Oh, it's an hourglass. You yeah, let's let her do it. To waste this chance, Papalimo. So this is for you. And me. That's my girl. Time to wake up as something that can destroy mankind. Yippee! <laughs> yes! Fly free, my pretty! Show us what you can do. Well, that was quite an evil laugh. The launch sequence has begun. Omega is loose. Typical Nero behavior, yeah. All right, let's blow up the egg. Time to blow up the egg. There we go. Buzz, buzz. <laughs> Jesus. That's kind of powerful. Oh, it's still there. It's still chilling. It's Rayquaza. Oh shit. Uh, I don't think this is what was supposed to happen. I don't think this is what was supposed to happen. <laughs> Did this break PlayStations? Oh shit, here he goes. Go on, Omega. Do a barrel roll. Damn, this thing is powerful.
I guess that's... Goodbye, Omega. <laughs> oh, never mind. They're going to do the that thing again. But they hit each other. Yeah. Classic anime moment. Yeah. The beam struggle. He's going to push back. No. They're equal in power. This is something. Yeah, it's Harry Potter, isn't it? Is it Harry Potter? Yo, so many people died right now. So many people just got absolutely slapped. Did we really save the world? I, it doesn't feel like it. Dead. Yeah, billions dead. <laughs> Jesus. Yo, oh, it was all contained behind the wall. We're, we're fine. Jesus. Also, that primal is so strong. Such devastation. The wall, dude, Bal. Of course, the wall's still standing. It was built by my goddamn boy, Van Balsa, you know? Well, that did not go as expected. Uh, Omega has stopped transmitting. But that shouldn't be. I, I didn't engage the stasis system. It went off leash? No way, Sid. And what does this signify? I have little understanding of these contrivances. There it is. Oh, it, it's got a mind of its own now. Okay. <sighs> the launch went exactly to plan, but all signals emanating from Omega have ceased. What about the primal? This may indicate any number of things, but we will need to join the Scions out in the field if we are to ascertain which one. We got there just in time, by the way. Straight as it hatched from the egg. Right. I've ordered a malfunctioning beast to go to sleep. That should prevent any unfortunate mishaps. I suggest we make our way back to Gridania. <laughs> Alright. Oh, it's just that easy. Oh, emergency shutdown work then. <laughs> right? <laughs> right? Oh, shit. What? Omega destroyed the cocoon. Papalimo's spell is fading. It was bound to his ether, you see. And if the connection is broken... The fuck does that mean? No, do they... Do they all lose their tattoos because it was Papa Limo that gave them to... So he was... So he was still kind of chilling. He was still around. And he's what made their tattoos. I mean... Hmm. What? Just shrewsh. Yeah, just shrewsh. I can't look at chat if there's a dink donk. Good dink donking though, guys. Good do good job. Good job. All right. Let's talk to Sid then. We get straight back into it. I'm not sure why we lost contact with Omega, but I mean to find out. Uh, Guys, there's ads playing in five minutes. Should I play them now before we get into something else? I, I've snoozed them three times, so I can't snooze them anymore. Play them. Okay, okay, okay. I'll run them now. Sorry, guys. You won't miss anything. You won't miss anything. All right. I'm going to stand here, AFK, and I'm just going to stare into the camera for three minutes. I'm going to play the long one so that they don't play for like an entire hour. All right. There's going to be no ads for an entire hour. Okay. We'll see you on the other side, soldiers. Okay. See you on the other side. BRB. 
Right, I'm hitting them with the three mins. Hold. There we go. Time for the back. <laughs> All right, guys. Now we can do the backflips. Bring on the backflip. Let's enjoy this during ads. All right. I'm going to stare at them as well. There we go. Nice emote, Honk Saber. What the fuck, dude? This this new thing is so trolly with these massive emotes. They're so, fro they're so fucking huge. What the fuck? <laughs> Jesus. Okay, so I guess I'll just sit here and like digest that for a second. Um... Okay. Don't Okay, please don't confirm or deny anything, all right? Just rouge. All right? Not looking for answers. I'm just going to talk. I'm just going to think out loud, all right? So the egg hatched. I'm thinking that's primal's called Ralga because um that's what that guy said as he was dying. He was like, "Ralga, save us." or something. And then because Ilbert had the eyes, he like use all of their like beliefs and shit to die and summon Ralga because like that was what they believed in and shit and that was his primal bud I guess and then Papa Limo put in the egg and used up his ether but because the egg was still alive and bound to Papa Limo's ether he was still like in the plane of existence because he was like part of the egg basically like Papa Limo was the egg and then the egg got blown up. So then Papa Limo's Aether faded. And then that has something to do with their tattoos. Which I'm imagining because they were scholars of... Charleian? Then they were like given to them by Papa Limo because he was Louis Soir's finest student. So he like carried on legacy. Something like that! You can just shrooge it all away. That's where my head's at. Okay, that's that's my thinking out loud. That's where my head's at, right? There you go. Just so you can have a glimpse inside my mind. And now... Sounds very shrooge. And now... Omega has just gone off the grid, basically. And fucked off. Also, I, I feel like we don't even know if... Uh, <laughs> We don't even know if, like, Omega won or the Primal won or if it was a stalemate or if they're both alive or if they just fucked off or if they got, like, teleported somewhere. Fuck knows, man. Who knows? Chat won. Fine cooking. Let's await the taste test. Let's find out how much of that is true. They're back from ads in three... Two, one. Welcome back from the ads. Hi, guys. We waited. We waited. I did a small cook of what I think's going on for any ad enjoyers, basically. Uh, we're going to find out what's going on here. But pretty much my head is at. Don't confirm or deny this. Non ad uh, uh, people that didn't get to hear me say this in the ad break. But basically, think that Primal was Ralgar. Think. That and Omega had a were like basically evenly matched. Don't know where they've gone to. We think Papa Limo became the egg, and now he now the egg's broken. Papa Limo truly died out, and also, uh, he gave them the Charlay and tattoo things, and now that he's gone, the tattoos faded. That's basically where I'm at. Don't confirm or deny anything. That we're gonna find out what's going on now from Sid. All right, no confirm, no deny, only shrewd, only stare. Yeah. All right. You can also blah as well if you would like. I'm not sure why we lost contact with Omega, but I do mean to find out. Let's be on our way. Travel to Gridania. Well then. Yo, that was fucking crazy. That was fucking crazy, all right. Got me looking kind of cool, huh? That was fucking crazy. That cutscene was nuts, by the way. What the fuck? That was like a whole mini movie. That was like some like uh like Pokemon the movie battle scene kind of thing. Shit. Like Mewtwo and Mew going at it basically, man. Jesus Christ. That was nuts. We 
Yeah, we definitely shouldn't have released Omega. I came as soon as I heard the Excelsior had been spotted. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, Alfie. <laughs> TMI. Jesus, Alfie. Yeah. Do you really need to say that? Jesus. All right. One moment everything was functioning perfectly, and the next, it wasn't. It makes no sense. We need to see what happened for ourselves, and soon. He who continues the attack orchestrion role. Imperial will orchestrion role. I hope... Oh, do we get the, the uh, Imperial songs? That's sick. <clears throat> Report those whispers via the support desk as a phishing attempt. The Cotomy whispers? Well... Rip Bozo. Alphano has the look of a man with much to say. These fucking massive emotes, bro. Okay, let's find out what's going on. Stupid budget ran out, man. Words can ill express how glad I am to see you all unharmed. When Omega came hurtling towards the cocoon, everything dissolved into chaos. It was it was Eda that did it, by the way. I have to see it. I have to see it with my own eyes. Me too. Eda, wait! We must first... <sighs> the Elder Seedseer is expecting us. Worry not, Alphano. Gosetsu and I will watch over her. You may safely attend your meeting. We got fuck, Dude, I want to go see the moon. I don't want to see the meeting. My thanks, Yugiri. The council reconvened a short while ago. Let us make haste for the Lotus Strand. All there are eager to hear your testimony. All right, let's do it. See what the fuck's going on. I, I mean, I guess, I guess, I guess Stormblood is, yeah, gee, okay. I mean, is it movie time? Sick council. It might be movie time. Speak with Kani Senna at the Lotus Strand. All right. We might need to assemble soon, guys. It might be popcorn time. Do, 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 do. Is this the last quest? The far edge of fate. Blassemble. It's Van Hydrus' song. Fuck Van Hydrus. He killed your sail. What are you capital D coloning? He killed your sail, dude. What you like when your sail died, did you guys? You really like that? The Elder Seeds here awaits you within. Proceed to the Lotus Strand. All right. The final meeting. God, I feel like an angel of death. Doing these quests and everything's going wrong, man. I should probably take these wings off, huh? Bird arrive. Had I not instructed you to throw Nidhogg's accursed eyes into the abyss, all of this might have been avoided. I thought them beyond reach. Imrik. And that was top 10 worst. That was top three worst decisions in the game so far. Honestly. For sure. Maybe top two. He's just a simple man. Another calamity averted, eh? How many times have you and yours hauled us back from the brink? Not that other time. It would seem Garland's little friend was as good as his word. <laughs> yeah. I wonder if that was Nero's plan all along. Hmm. I'm not I'm not sure. He did laugh quite 
villainously, you know? He's still with us, though. My friends. <clears throat> oh, I've got to do the voice. <clears throat> I'm going to do her ARR voice because we don't get to hear it very often anymore. <sighs> My friends. Full eagerly have we awaited your return. Few indeed could have discharged the duty entrusted to you. And most humbly do we thank you for seeing it done. You're too kind, Elder Seedseer. As I recall, we as good as demanded the right to try. But tell me, how did the battle unfold? We succeeded in waking Omega Eye, but we lost contact with the weapon shortly after it launched. From our position in the control room, we were blind to all that followed. What about all the deaths and shit? <laughs> what words could do justice to such a scene? None of, but none of my choosing, that much is certain. But I can give you the facts. The cocoon hatched even as Omega arrived. And from its midst rose a great dragon. The pair duly set about each other in the skies over Gear Abanya. The primals might defied belief. But it seems very the very heavens would be rent asunder by the force of its blows. And it wielded such magics as I have never seen and hope never to see again. The battle raged on with no end in sight, until both combatants were engulfed in a blinding flash of light. When the radiance faded, I saw the pair fall motionless from the sky, coming to rest somewhere on Alamegan's soil. I will not speak for the rest, but to my eye it seemed that each had landed a fatal blow upon the other. Oh, it actually just one shot. Okay, they killed each other. While well, most among... Oh. <clears throat> While most among us could think only of Bahamut when looking upon the primal's form, the domans were heard to whisper the name Shinryu. It would appear that the being resembles a creature of far eastern legend, and we have found it convenient to refer to it as such. This Shinryu's fate, and indeed that of Omega, is yet unknown. We have, alas, no eyes on the Gear Abanyan side of the border. Aye, which is why we have sent our main force, under the command of Marshal Tarapin, to capture the war. With the Imperials in disarray, we have the perfect opportunity to secure Gridania's border and assess the aftermath of the impact. I myself will join the Marshal and his men, when the council is adjourned. Father and son, baby. Oh, yes. Well, that explains a few things. I'll wager that flash of light coincided with our loss of contact. Lest you wonder, we quickly re-engaged Omega's stasis systems. So even if it has fallen to the Empire's lap, it will be of no use to them. Save, perhaps, as a statue. Correct. <laughs> Without me to guide our efforts, it would take them decades to decipher Omega's core functions, if they managed at all. To be fair, it's pretty good that he's not working with the uh, with the Empire. Such reassurances do much to calm our fears, yet the Relic's fate is but one of several concerns. You're gonna lend us a hand. Just one though, Mobius. Indeed. I humbly submit that the time has come for us to make contact with the resistance representatives in Gear Abanya. Though Elbert has forced our hand, it would seem... Oh, oh yeah, he died. Yeah, thank God he died. Dude, what a good villain Elbert was, by the way. Honestly, fucking dick, but a great villain. It would seem only logical to seek an alliance, given the inevitability of Imperial retaliation and by working in concert. It is not impossible that Alamigo may finally be wrested from Galamal's grasp. Sloppy! <laughs> bit sloppy, yeah, bit sloppy. <laughs> Alright. Alfie? You must be exhausted. I would ordinarily suggest that we retire directly to the Rising Stones. But I wonder if we might first make a small detour. 
Gestola and the others have gathered at Amaraswa's spire. And I imagine that you too would be interested to see what has become of the wall now the cocoon is gone. It is decided then. Lead on. Oh, I see a dink donk. Need to move it up a little more, perhaps. I should very much like to see this Shin Ryu creature for myself. Oh, I hope we're going to get like a uh, several cutscenes play in sequence. All right, let's go. Wait, hold on. Uh, if, as seems likely, we put Omega into stasis after. What did they call it? Ah, yes. After Shin Ryu was defeated. So it wasn't Rail Guys, Shin Ryu. Okay. We should have little to fear from either one of them. Oh, there's just no way it pans out like that, you know? Ding dong. No spoilers. Behave, chat. Behave. I didn't see anything. We're good. Thank you for ding donking, guys. You got my back. You got my back. Please, my lord. What's this? Sludge woke. There you go. Good dink donking, guys. Hopefully no one's intentionally trying to spoil stuff. People just getting a little too excited. Keep it in your pants, guys. Which mount was that from? Oh, was that a uh, Nidhogg's one? Yeah, that was Nidhogg's, right? Yeah, I still haven't got them all, actually. <laughs> Why is it playing me tunes? <laughs> My friends, I cannot well express how glad I am to see you both unharmed. I didn't look up. They say that Fuck. Omega's clash with the primal shook the very firmament. You need not have worried. The battle took place far above the ground. We were able to observe in relative safety, though I'm given to understand oh. that there were casualties on the far side of the wall. Oh, rip. <laughs> rip. Oh no. It was like watching a nightmare unfold before our very eyes. Illbird's primal manifested in the form of a colossal dragon, a being of pure violence. It burst forth from the cocoon with such terrible force. That such a horror should spring from the eyes of Nidhogg comes as no surprise. Nor do I wonder at its form. Illbird all but announced it in the moments prior to his death. Plainly, it was his dying wish to visit a second calamity upon the Empire. Apparently so. I thought he just wanted to free Alamigo. Also, I'd say, in terms of like what's played out so far, it, considering like the eyes of Nidhogg were like essentially used up, right? That's not. I mean, it's a pretty bad outcome, but all things considered. So far, I mean, obviously, we've got Omega to worry about, I guess. Maybe. <laughs> Unless they're both dead. If it's in stasis, we're chilling. But, like, the eyes of Nidhogg used up. We didn't really have, like, that much crazy, like, shit ha happening, right? Like, we did avoid a calamity, which is kind of cool. Shit, I didn't mean to do that. And I am quite certain the abomination would have obliged had it not found itself outmatched by a mega. Gods! Even I'm no stranger to the works of Alag, but even I was unprepared for the machine's furiosity. It beckoned belief. Yeah, that was kind of insanely OP. That shit's on Ultima, man. Jesus. And how fares poor Eda in the midst of all this? Have you spoken with her? She is up on the platform, lost in thought. 
We deemed it best not to disturb her, but mayhaps she would welcome some company after all. Shall we? Let's do it. Did they all lose their tattoos? I can't see your shoulders, but I don't know where it is on her. Moon's gone. Egg is gone. The light's gone. It was all we had left of him. Man, that is rough. I don't blame anyone. I knew what was going to happen. I knew the spell Papalimo meant to cast would drain away his life force. I knew that it would only buy us a little time. She. We're going to take her mask off now, is she? Yes. 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 Ida, there is no need to explain. Yes. Ah, oh, I lost. But there is. I can't hide in Papalimo's little shadow anymore, and I shouldn't hide behind my sister's mask. Damn. Ago, on the day the Empire marched into Alamigo, I was still just a child, not even five summers old. My father had been one of the leaders of the revolution. He had fought to overthrow the mad king, Theodoric. And my sister had fought alongside him. She was strong and kind and always knew what to do. We're getting so many face reveals recently. But when the Garleans came, everything changed. My father went to war against them too. And I never saw him again. Or went out for Papa. After that, I remember a lot of running. My sister dragged me for moms and moms until we came to the city of Charlian. That was where she met Master Louis Soir. He introduced her to the Circle of Knowing, and she eventually became an Archon. Big sis, pump. She was your inspiration. Is that not why you took up her mask and her name? Or did you simply mean to continue what she had started? This music's good. You've known all along, haven't you? That I wasn't Ida. Of course. We all recognized you at once. It was Papalimo who persuaded us to maintain the charade. Ah. It was silly to think I could fool you. So I knew that even then, but I... I sort of... decided not to know. So Ida was her sister. So who the fuck are you then? Ida died six years ago. On a mission to smuggle refugees out of Alamigo. They say she was overwhelmed by Imperial soldiers when she stayed behind to save a little girl. Aww. She was so strong. There must have been a lot of them. Either Junior. Why did you never tell me? <laughs> dot, dot, dot. <laughs> I mean... I don't really want to say, why do you never tell me? That's completely fair, I think. I almost want to hit her with the triple dot, but I guess we'll go with the dialogue option because it's a little bit more interesting. You did the dot I'm dot? I'm sorry for lying to you. My real name is Lise. Lise. When Papalimo brought me Eda's mask, it was meant as a keepsake, but... I decided I wanted to be his new partner, to keep alive all the good that she had done. That's cool. I didn't want to become Ida, exactly. At the time, though, I still didn't know who I was myself. And it almost seemed easier to play the role. Yeah. Papalimo agreed to help, of course, but it was never what he wanted for me. He wanted me to walk my own path. 
And those were his final words to me. Oh shit, the cutscene now. The Archon's mark he gave me is faded, and my last excuse along with it. Yeah, he gave it. So this is it. Whatever I choose to do from now on, I do as lease. And I choose to continue my family's fight. I want Alamigo to be the country that Ida and my father always wanted it to be. All right. Let's go, Lise. War is upon us once more. Do you regret standing against the Empire? Would you have chosen a different road, knowing what you know now? To claim that I never doubted the decision would be a lie. But I made my choice, and I have defended it with blade in hand ever since. The battle continues, and our steel is needed. Come, Shadow Walker. We leave for the east, for Doma. For Doma. Wait, we're going like we're expanding. We're gonna go to like Alamigo. We're gonna go to Doma. I think. This is cool. I guess we've kind of explored the whole world in EOC, right? Lise was hot. My gal, Lise. It was brave of Lise to remove her mask after so long. Though she has scarce begun to come to terms with Papa Limo's loss, that one act made plain her determination to move forward. Yeah, don't dwell on the past, huh? And should she ever falter, we shall be there to support her on the road she has resolved to walk. Let us return to the Rising Stones. We have quite a story to tell to Taru and my sister. I'm wondering, like, where this ends? Oh, shit. Wait, that's it? Is this credits? Oh, shit. We do have quite a story. <sighs> Damn. That was good. So, Russ, did you buy the new expansion or did you lice it? <laughs> Please. I bought I bought the new expansion, yeah. Not mid. Okay. Guys, I can confirm. Onto. Clap. Thanks for the claps. Don't you start, okay? The I can confirm. Heaven Sword. Not mid. Above mid for sure. Pretty good, I'd say. Okay, it's not Heaven's Mid, guys. I never I never actually said it was, alright? Clap. Midwoods. He loves it. Okay. It was pretty good. I actually really like the patches. Honestly. I feel like uh I feel like going into Stormblood is gonna be Danvar. Thank you for the five gift subs, man. To Ther Theralin. I'll unpause the alerts after Dragon Song, alright? Uh, clap, clap, Danvar, clap. thank you for the gift subs. Look up. <laughs> Yay! Lucky it was off cooldown, huh, guys? Danvar, thank you for the gift sub to the Rallin, to the High Valley FC, to Veruca Salt, to Naleka, to Evil Frankie. And finally, thank you for the 100 bits. Mwah! Ponto, thank you for the 100 bits. Mwah! Yay! I think I'm going to enjoy Stormblood. I feel like. So far, like, this whole setting up of Stormblood has been, like...
it's been like more deeper plot kind of like and more like emotional you know like it's been like a more like emotional kind of plot rather than like an action kind of plot i i'm a big fan of that kind of stuff like that kind of storytelling so if stormblood follows suit obviously don't say anything but if stormblood follows suit then i'm probably going to enjoy it a lot you know uh Arakon, thank you for the continuing the gift sub you got from crimson dragon james as well thank you if uh you all ever think about how being basic used to be a bad thing, but now being based is good. Oh shit, let's go, howdy nerdy. Preferred it to heaven sword. Like I'm like, tell me it's bad so I keep my expectations low, you know? But I secretly think it's gonna be pretty good. It's a recurring thing that the patches are better than the base game. Mm -hmm. I've also heard of some people saying that they skipped, they started skipping a lot in Stormblood. So I'm not sure what to make of that, you know? You did it in 2024. I did it! Guys! Stormblood before Dawn Trail? Just skip Stormblood. Skippers! Yeah. Oh, I'm not going to skip anything. No, no, no. I'm not going to skip anything. I'm just saying I heard some people did, uh, like, started skipping cutscenes and stuff. You know what I mean? Mm, mm, I'm still in the free trial, Paddy. I'm still in the free trial. Thank you guys for the bits and subs. Appreciate you. The Dragon Song's so fucking good. Yeah. Yeah. It is. About skipping the credits. I'm not going to skip till the music's finished, you know? Until we get to the... Like, we're still looking back for all our moments right now. How's she in your sail? Oh, rip, dude. Oh, 07 to those guys. Estinian. Yay, Alice. That was really good, though. That was a good build up. There's some unanswered things, obviously. Oh shit, dude. There's gonna be a goddamn cutscene after the fucking credits. I didn't even think about that. It's, I bet it's gonna be Urianje being sus again, dude. It's every time, man. It's like Asian shit, you know. Evan. Thank you for the five gift subs to Mr. Noko. I will unpause all the alerts very soon, guys. You can do what you want. Like, you can do your subs if you want. But, like, the, the alerts will come back on probably, like, when we get to a point. Like, we'll, we'll see where we go now. Like, we'll probably go... We'll probably do the first quest or, like, watch the trailer or... Like, I don't know if it's anything similar. Like, if there's, if we're going to, like, a new city or something, then we'll we'll do the same as we did, like, at the end of era. I'm, I'm fine to do a little bit of a longer stream today, however long it takes, right? Hunter, you started this, by the way. Evan, thank you for the five gift subs to Mr. Noko. Heavensward, by the way, there's the book. To Jerem, to ja Den Xavier, to Maximal Disguised, and to Rogue Tent. Yay, extended. Yay, strange. Alice, you're such a little fire starter, you. Hee <laughs> hee. Hee hee. I don't have that emote, actually. I like that emote. We should probably get that one. Yeah, we got we got to do the Stormblood trailer and everything. Illbird, what a great villain! Yeah, absolutely. He was a good villain in ARR, and he was a good villain in Heavensward, and he was only in the like end of both, I guess, right? I just like to support people. Thank you, Alice. Rip Count von Dripula. He's not dead. He just closed his book and decided he wasn't doing anything. Like, he was just, like, kind of done done with it, right? It's almost a controversial expansion. Oh, the the VA is, yes. Yeah, that. We can RIP that one. I thought you meant the character. Sorry. Whoa, dude. I heard he's got a tiny dick. <laughs> How do they know? Yay. Look, guys, if you keep doing that, Alice is going to keep clapping her hands there and being super happy in chat. You're not even doing it for me anymore. You're doing it for Alice, Ruth. <laughs> Ee -hee. All right, Stonker, I got you. 
Oh, I need to sign in. Wait, why have I signed out? I was just logged in. I don't want to report it. There you go. First spam. Yeah, the voice actor sadly did die. Yeah. But at least the character, we're still chilling with him for a, for a bit, which is awesome. Push a trailer on YouTube. I will, Danvar. I will. Hurricane! <laughs> we're doing stealth hype trains today, apparently, huh? Whoa, dude. Thank you for the 10 gift subs to Lightsmith, to da uh, Dana, U Dana Yuyan, Walker, to Trista, to Eterif, to Plude Man, to DJ James Dark Knight, to Arde, to Jaunty Healer, to Proto. Uh, this is a, To be fair, it's good to do the hype train on the credits before we get to the cutscene. Yeah, right? Happy Alice! Yay! <laughs> there you go. Hurricane Red doing their part as well. <laughs> Yay! Thank you, Hurricane, for the five gifties to Sheenamist, to BTM5013, to Tamanya, to Bobbis, Boblis, and to Dark Shin. And Lord Chozo. Dragon Song or Answers. Hina? Dragon Song or Answers. Oof. That's a hard question. Oh, they're both so good. I, mm, I kind of want to say. I kind of want to say Dragon Song. Ah, it's so close. They're so good. Chozo, thank you for the 100 bits. Mwah! Hina, thank you for the five gift subs to Glue Fire, to the Real Tree Dude, to the Pachimari, to Necro, to Nikroimo, and to Falco TTV. Yay! Keep Alice happy! <laughs> Yay! Hee <laughs> hee. Hee hee. I don't know, dude. Answers is so good. Because, like. Answers, like. Ah, uh, dude. Answers is so good because like in the Bahamut fight, it's like evolving as you as you go through the fight, you know. I, I need to I need to hear them both like one after each other to decide. But they're both really, really good. I don't know. I really like the the like drop part of uh I feel like answers overall may be better. I don't know. But like the drop of Dragon Song is so good. I don't know, dude. For Alice Migo. Colleen, thank you for the 200 bits. Mwah, mwah. And Surfing Beard, thank you for the gift sub to Saint Carrot 15 as well. Night Shroud, thank you for the follow. Um, thank you, Hina, for the five gift subs. I don't know if I said that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm very overwhelmed. <laughs> I'm very overwhelmed. Right. Do you want to hear my opinion on Heaven Sword, guys? Pretty good. Pretty good. Um, yeah, good setup to Stormblood. The patches were really good. The voice acting was top tier. Um, particular shout out to the voice actors of uh, the bar wench in uh, uh, you know that that part where that part where Emelenian shot got the guy shot that bar wench person with those protesters shout out to the griffin to Ilbert's voice actor shout out to the uh, uh, fuck Dude, there was another really good voice actor recently. Death to Nidhogg. Yeah, that, that as well was sick. The bar wench. Splitter, thank you for the follow. Oh. I don't know, dude. This song's also top tier. I haven't saw music. It just goes hard, man. Yeah, you know the one that poisoned me? That bar wench. Monago, we still don't. We I don't know anything about her yet. I guess we're gonna find out in her, in Stormblood, right? Lisa, what's that called? Lice, Lise, Lise, Lice. What's her name? <laughs> She's either to me. Lice, yeah. Lise, 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 Lise. Not Lice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lise, Lise. Okay. Nabuo. Spelled least, pronounced least. Yeah. Wait, that wouldn't make sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. PS3 was holding Heaven Sword back. Oh, yeah. What were you guys talking about uh, the PlayStation in the cutscene? Was it like, was it just a lag fest in the cutscene? Alice, I see you. Don't, don't, don't encourage anyone anymore. Okay, you've done enough damage. She was always eater to me. Yeah. I mean, she kind of still is, you know? She's done everything under the under the persona of Ida. It was struggling. <laughs> Five twelve megabytes of RAM. 
It was optimized to look good on PlayStation. Oh, so PlayStation ruined it for all of us. Is that what you're saying? Persona 5? Persona Eater. Eater forever. The graphics will improve. Oh, dude, I'm in for a treat. And it's corresponding to the worldly graphic update in, in Dawn Trail as well, right? She will always be my wife. Huh? Hey. Fair enough. Me too. Me too. Mean Cupcake. Can we share her? Please. Can we share her? PS4 is holding us back. Yeah. But soon soon it will evolve to PS5, right? PS4 support was killed, so you should notice an increase. Right, right. When, when are they switching up to PS4... Support being turned off. Yeah, and then PS5 will hold us back. Bye, Trange. Bye, Trange. Hi, Peeny. What's up? Good train, guys. Thank you, guys, for the gift subs and bits. Appreciate you. Appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, PC min spec is also around. Yeah. What a banger, man. To victory. So, yeah, I imagine Stormblood is going to be uh, about... Um... Well, we'll get a, we'll a cutscene now. We'll get a cutscene now. Next expansion. I'll be up to date by next expansion, guys. It's amazing how much of the music Russ just knows from playing the game. Can you name the titles of any of the pieces in other games like you can here? I mean, to be fair, I don't really know the titles of most of the songs. Dude, that's just banger after banger, man. Banger after banger, dude. Can you sing the, back the WoW background music? Uh, like, I know a couple of, like, the, like, Wrath of the Lich King ones. Like, Invincible and, like, Arthas, my son, and the Stormwind one. Like, I could sing, I could, like, I could sing, like, the Stranglethorn Veil music. <laughs> you know? So, like, they're the, it's, like, the big hard-hitting ones which have something to do with, like, big story moments. They're, like, the ones you remember, right? Also, that, that one goes hard, though, to be fair. Oh my god, ban me. Wait, what happened? You woke up as the credits hit? No, we got we got we got Stormblood trailer to watch. Don't worry, Takunin. You haven't missed everything. This is the moment FF14 got Heaven Sword in the genre. Yeah. So like was this kind of a sleeper game until Heaven Sword and then everyone was like, fuck. Final Fantasy kind of fucks. We will, we will, Night Shroud. Oh yeah, true. We'll we'll get to see the trailer now, right? Um, but yeah, Voss, like, I don't, I wouldn't say I know, like, all the titles. I know, like, the one we just had was called Heaven Sword. I know the one before that was called Dragon Song. I know the one called Answers. But I only kind of know it because you guys say the names of them, right? Whereas, like, no one cares enough to tell me in WoW. And, like, I never cared enough to, like, look it up, I guess. I don't know. Like, I know a couple pieces from WoW. And I know Dreams Aloft because I wanted to look that one up. But I can't think of a single, like, bad piece of music so far in this game, you know? I, I can't think of a single bad one. Like, one that I didn't like. Like, not even just one that I felt, like, neutral about, but one I didn't like, you know? Yeah, I suppose so, CNED, right? I had, like, a bad rep. Yeah, there's Jaina's song. Hmm. This music, this music kind of slaps as well. And it's just like the... This is like the good... This is what I associate as like the... Let's fucking get energetic, boys. We got good news. We're making a plan. You know what I mean? 
like this comes in in the cutscenes or like and stuff whenever it's like all right alfie you're gonna go be politic boy somewhere else all right don't you worry you fucked up enough for one expansion we're gonna send the warrior of light to fix your mistake all right sid you biggs wedge you will go to the Garland Ironworks and set up the mana cutters. We need to go up to the area in the sky. We're going to take on Nidhogg, okay? And then it's like, yeah, it's a time to fuck music. Exactly. Let's fuck shit up, you know? Yeah. There's a piece uh, of content you've not unlocked yet for over 60 hours. Somehow I'll never get tired of it. Oh, right. Like, uh, with the music, you mean, Eclipse, or? Oh, you mean, um, like, I know this Palace of the Dam Dead I haven't done. All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Time to fuck. Let's go! <laughs> yep. Alfie gets to go... Gets to Dude, I can't believe, like, it zoomed in on Laurentius and Yu Yu Hase. Okay, so, here's my predictions. Actually, let me wait till the next cutscene before I do the predictions, okay? What's up, Corrupted? Hi. Predict this. Yeah, all the composers are Giga Chads, man. Even as the background tracks for the zones in FF. Uh, oh, yeah, I agree with that, boss. For sure. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Like, Like, I can go into a zone and just be like happy to kind of sit there and like listen to the music or I like for some like you know some of them that's what I love about the mounts having their soundtracks as well like I actually like quite often I'll mount on a mount and be like oh sweet I get to and because of the shuffle because I have the mounts on shuffle as well it's like I'll mount on something that I haven't mounted on for like a couple weeks or maybe more and be like oh shit yeah this song and then I'll like specifically not get off it like i'll get to my destination like, i'll find i'll get i'll fly over to like my quest giver or something and then i'll just run around on the ground because i want the music to keep playing for a little bit longer because like, i haven't like i haven't got my fill of it yet you know what i mean so i'll just sit there like on the mount moving so it's quite loud i just be like oh yeah we get to hear this part you know it, it's like get to the good part of the music kind of thing Yeah, yeah, it's more, it's more like subtle, I guess, Stanvo, yeah. But yeah, like churning mist music and stuff as well, right? Oh yeah, for sure, Cage, for sure. What candle of choice do we have today, guys? Cucumber melon. Cucumber melon, apparently. It fucks! <laughs> hey, boy. I tidied up my desk a bit, guys. Did you notice? Yeah, call to arms is a good wow one, yeah. You did. His computer desktop is tidy. Ah, I mean, the bit you can see, yeah, a little bit more. I can't tell the difference. Is it because this bowl of uh, sorted goods is mess is messy? You know, it's, it's like tidied up this part, it tidied up this part, you know? All right, we're going to skip this cutscene soon. Oh, yeah, not my desktop. Not my desktop. No, no, no. The desktop physical? Yes. The desktop on my PC? No. I don't know where people are to coon in. Um, I don't think they're going to say in chat. So maybe someone will DM you if there's a location. I don't know. Uh, 
Okay. Or just ask in Discord or something, because uh, I'm not looking at Discord right now. So you can you can plan stuff in there if, if that's what's going on. I don't know. I don't know if there's a meetup. I don't know. Last I knew, people were at Balsar's Wall. I mean, you can use the general channel right now. Yeah, we're just on Ravana. We're on Ravana. All right. I kind of... I want to skip at the end of this song, unless it just doesn't end, potentially. Yeah, let's just skip. Let's just skip. I'm ready. How do I do it? Oh, there we go. Okay. Let's do this. What? There's no cutscene. Wait, who's this? Ephemi. Lady Philomene, I sent her outside to enjoy a quiet cup of tea. Much has happened these past moons, and we can all use a rest every now and again. <laughs> all right, let's see what's going on with these guys. Oh, that's Ephemi. Yeah, that's her. I made a fool of myself. <sighs> On our last mission, <sighs> I will show him <sighs> what I'm made of. Come on now, Hori. <sighs> Is that the best you've got? Should the Archons be called away to Gear Banya? <sighs> it will fall to us to deal with the Scion's usual obligations. And thus, <sighs> we must remain in <sighs> peak condition. My sister has the most curious ideas about courtship. A fine showing, brother. But you have yet to outpace Anor. Coltonet. Though it might be simpler to surrender to despair, I have chosen to resume my studies in the arcane. I received much wisdom from Papalimo, and I would put his advice into practice. Bet the corner smells like the inside of a pack of dry roasted peanuts. Jesus Christ. Umi! Who's Isildir? Yeah, we've seen that guy before. Back in the Far East, retreat back pain with a long soak in a hot spring. What say you to a short journey? Ellis, uh, Isildur. I'm told the waters at Camp Bronze Lake are famous for their healing properties. At last, I was able to rise from my sickbed. But the pain when I tried to take up my axe... Oh, what a sad old man I have become. Okay, let's chat with these two. You should have seen the look on Tataru's face when I recounted Lysa's... Uh, I realized in retrospect that I should probably have waited for you to return. I uh, also told Alice, apologies. <laughs> Dick. <laughs> Lise, Lise, sorry. Did I say Lysa again? Fuck. He may have mentioned that Alphano has apprised me that all uh, of all that came to pass in Gridania. Your only task now is to rest. Rest. This is the calm before the storm. Blood. <laughs> Lise has chosen her path, and as her friends, we must do what we can to support that choice. We are fated to join the conflict in any case. Once the Alliance has taken the wall and opened the way to Giabanya, we will have little choice but to fight. Which is not to say the cause is unworthy. After all, ignoring the plight of those whom one might conceivably save is but not wisdom, but indolence. Correct? I, for one, look forward to joining hands with the Alamegans and striking a blow against the tyranny of the Empire. As I rather suspect, do you? The far edge of fate. Dee -dee -dee. Okay, here we go. Do do do. Oh shit, okay. Quick march! The Imperials will soon come to their senses, and we must be ready to face their retribution. Pippin! Hmm. 
Here's daddy. It's almost time, father. Aye, almost. Stand firm, Pippin. I learn to brace myself against the charge of the bull of Alamigo. No foe will dislodge me. Let's go. Pippin! Join the maelstrom. <laughs> Birds. Very well, Ilbert. I will take our homeland back. Hmm. For Alamigo. For the both of us. Stupid Ilbert. Oh shit, here we go. All right, Varus. I don't remember what happened to Hydrus. I, I think he died. I don't remember there. Who the fuck is this? That's not Varus. My Lord Viceroy, our sc scouts have confirmed the preliminary reports. Belsar's will has fallen to the Eorzean Alliance. The hunt for Omega and the unknown icon continues. Though both yet elude us, my Lord, their battle caused considerable damage across the region. Should we perchance divert some of our forces from the search to undertake necessary reconstruction work? Wait, did he do something? Or did he shake his hand or something? I... Forgive me, my lord. I did not intend... Your will be done. He just he just stared. Okay. Sorry, I looked away for a sec. I thought he was going to speak, so I was readying the voice changer. Viceroy. He looks kind of, uh... Alright, it's a helmet. It's a helmet. Unknown? My spies tell me the Domans call it Shinrayu. And that it prov proved to a match for Omega. Yes. The coming days promise to be the most interesting. Most interesting. Wait, why are you la why are you lamowing? Why are you lamowing? What most? Why are you lamowing? Oh, okay, good. It was it good? Okay. Oh, is he going to have a really ratty voice? Oh, he's going to be like, Eh, yeah, most interesting, yeah! <laughs> At the far edge of fate, the road begins anew. The heroes look to eastern skies and behold their truth. A dawn of liberation, a gathering storm of blood. Okay, we saw a face. We saw a face. A new chapter of New Game Plus has been added. Five minutes of fate. 
There you go. Title drop, kinda. A storm of blood. A storm of blood. Who did not miss the trailer, Mario, if that's what you meant. So watch the trailer now. Heaven Sword completed. Trailer and then first quest. Okay. There's an ad in four minutes. I need to pee. Conveniently, I'm just going to sync those up. All right, guys. I'm going to turn off the ads for an entire hour while I go pee. All right. So there's going to be an ad playing for the non-subs. All right. And then uh, I'll pee while that's happening. I might top up my bottle of water. Bottle of water. All right. Ad and pee. Fake pee. No, I actually need... I've been... Dude. I've drank this much water. Okay. While I've been questing. All right. You see, you see this? This was full. Okay, uh, there's like there's like two liters of water. All right. So I'm gonna quickly uh I'm gonna I'm gonna um, yeah second weekly pee of the day. <laughs> exactly. All right, I'm gonna play the ad for an hour to piss. No, I'm gonna piss for probably like I don't know, sixty seven seconds. Well, that would be a long one. I'll probably piss for like. 30 plus walking there, walking back, wash my hands. So like, let's say like a minute to two, like maybe two minutes total. Of those two minutes, the ads will be playing plus one extra minute where I'll come and sit down on my chair. You know what I mean? All right. So I'm going to let them play. You won't miss anything. All right. And then it'll, the ads will be off for an entire hour. And hopefully my, my pee will not happen for an entire hour as well, which is great. All right. Okay. Good luck. See you on the other side, soldiers. And then we'll watch the trailer after that, all right? I have returned, but the dog is, uh, the dog also needs to pee, okay? He's good. To a shriveled husk. Doggo spotted. Yeah, the dog was, uh, was chasing me, chasing me around and stuff. Hey, chat, while Russ is away, do you think Hawaiian punch is more soda, juice, or a combination? Juice. What's Hawaiian punch? Is that like pineapple, uh, pineapple juice? Shrivel this, what the heck? A beverage, pineapple? I mean, I, I'm think I'm just putting it two and two together, right? Hawaiian pizza, Hawaiian punch, pineapple. 
shit ton of sugar. Can you see down my top? Oh, we're good. I think. Oh, we're fine. Well then. Alright, sweet. Tropical fruit punch with sugar dialed up to <laughs> 10 million. Alright. Right, okay. Wait, what's a punch? How do you make punch? Mm -mm -mm. Don't forget to listen to Stormblood title menu music. Yeah, I will. I will. Never had fruit punch. It's not really a... I don't think it's really a thing in the UK. Punch. Yeah, not that kind. Like, the closest thing I can think to it is, like, a mulled wine or, a, like, you know when you make pims? When, when you say, in the UK, it's pims o'clock in the summer and you make, like, a bowl of... You, like, mix, like, pims, lemonade, and, like, some fruits and shit. And it's, like, kind of like a punch like that, right? Fist and orange, I guess. Oh. Fruit juice and alcohol. Yeah, I imagine it's close to like PIMS for the UK enjoyers here. Hawaiian Punch was originally created as an ice cream topping syrup in 1934. It originally contained five fruit juices. Orange, pineapple, passion fruit, guava, and papaya. Imported from Hawaii. Uh, da, 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 five... Uh, made five ingredients, sugar. Oh my god, we're essaying about punch. Okay, milk, curd, butter, honey, sugar, some believe English punchian, which is a vol volumetric description of certain size barrels. Just drank sangria. Fuck! <laughs> Curry butt? Good call. No punch in the UK, only stab. Yeah. Yeah. We skip the punching here. We go straight for the stab. Right, guys, it's Stormblood trailer time, yeah? And then we'll unpause the alerts after that and do the first quest and see what happens. Right, Storm Blood Trailer. Mid Blood Trailer. Storm Blood, guys. Storm Blood. It's it's gonna be. I reckon it's gonna be pretty decent. Like the trailer, the expansion, all the shenanigans. You know, all the shenanigans. Right. I know. I, I kind of want to watch it from the menu to get the screen, but I also kind of want to watch it on this because I'll get, like, my camera won't block part of it. You know what I mean? Yeah, game sounds playing. I know, I know. Just because I haven't found the video yet. Yeah, for the React, right? Because uh, otherwise my camera and the chat will be up there and like covering some of it. So for like the reaction, for the first like reaction thing, I want like uh, the whole of it to be captured. And then we can just watch it another time after that, right? You can't fit for the react chat vod, then makes sense. Yeah, yeah. React harder! But we can do it from the menu afterwards so that we can... Um... I'll tell you what, we'll do it like this, right? If I log out... And then let's do this and then I can mute this 
And then I'll unmute that. And we'll just like skip through the thing, right? You know what I mean? Does that make sense? In game trainer trailer is low quality. Yeah, we'll watch it on this then. Alright, is it this? Final Fantasy XIV Stormblood trailer. <clears throat> right. I have hit record. Okay. Let's see how this goes. Stormblood trailer. I genuinely have like really no idea what to expect apart from uh, it's probably going to go over a couple of events. It might show us uh, Shin Ryu. Is that what it's called? It might show us a little bit of that battle, but in higher quality, which will be cool. Hi, YouTube. All right, let's check it out. We just, for context, we just finished Heaven's Ward. All the patches, all the cutscenes, everything like that. So let's give this... Wait, hold on. I don't want it to keep playing the Heaven's Ward thing in the background. Okay, what about if I do this? Okay. All right. Let's do it like this. It pauses the vid. Just click start. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, sweet. We can do that now. Okay. Stormblood trailer. Let's do it, chat. Peggy 18. Okay, there I am. Okay, we got dancer coming in. Was that the? Was that? Was that John Final Fantasy sitting on the th on the finger there? Oh, oh that's uh, that's fucking uh, Lise. Okay, that's me. Nice. She's a dancer, not a monk anymore. Yo, this is sick. Oof. She's still got monk skills. <laughs> Wait, what was that thumping? That's us. Oh, shit. <laughs> Yo, we're, we're fucking strong, dude. Oh wait, it's not dancer. Holy shit. Oh, we we're just two monks. Alamigo. Okay. So we go in there. Garlemald. Yo, this is cool actually. What does that say? Uh, arc, arcard, orchid. It wasn't Doma. Offered. Oh shit! Wait, what? We're going underwater. Oh shit, this is uh, that city. 
I think, maybe. Wait, this is me now. Sam Samurai! That's not me. That that is the warrior light, right? Yeah, 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 okay. Cut the bullet in half. Go on. Cut the three bullets in half. Oh yeah. Nice. Oh, I even went forward. Nice. <laughs> oh, is that the fucking Ah, oh, what's that thing called? Titan. Yeah. The resheath. Oh, sick. Gosetsu. Nice. That was cozy. It, was, it wasn't like too much of like an action one. It was showing a... Uh... Wait, didn't Monk come out in Stormblood as well? So Monk, it was like showing Monk Samurai. It was like the two new... No? Oh, yeah, Monk was... Oh, Monk was 2.0. Okay. wonder why... It... I guess just it wanted to show uh, Ida. Uh, like, Le 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 Lease. Red Mage and Sam. Interesting they didn't put any uh, red mage in there then. Nice. That was good. That was cozy. Um, wait. There we go. That was cool. Yeah, so it's going to be like very uh, Eastern themed, which is cool. Pre-order now, guys. Monks are tied to Alamigo culturally. Right, right. Are you good at parkour? <laughs> we'll find out, I guess. We'll find out. Red Mage getting shafted is a trend. Man. BRB pre-ordering. Sam time. Maybe I should pick up Sam in Stormblood, huh? I've been wanting to pick up Sam for a while. I just haven't had like a burning desire to pick up Sam. Could be cool to do some like MSQ on Samurai. You prefer Monk? Sam's fun. Cool as hell. Love it. Love it. Very fun. Sam and Red. I have Red, but I've not picked up Sam. That's at 50, though. That is true. It could be something that we pick up and uh, level with, like, Wondrous Tales and stuff. That's the main. Weeb arc. Woohoo! I know. Reaper. I know. Reaper's coming out. very. We get Reaper very soon. Two different ideas depend for art, depending on if you go Sam or Reaper. I'm probably going to pick up Reaper first, just because I'm almost at 70 and I've been talking about it for ages. I don't know. I kind of like this, the idea of the Sam too, but I think I do want to try Reaper for sure soon. Yeah, whenever it is. Need to pre-order it. Yeah, do it. Definitely pre-order Stormblood, guys. Okay, should we watch it again on the main menu and then we can see it, how it goes into the starting soon, like the, the screen, the title screen? Yeah, because like, you know, that's the, the Yushu React kind of done now. So, all right. Good shit. Good shit. Pre-order it. It will be bigger for us. Okay, let's do this. Let's get out of this. Config. Okay. Movies. Stormblood. There you go. Now you can, now we can like see. Oh shit, now it has like the. Oh yeah, it is a bit lower quality. I don't know if it is actually. It is a little bit. Leave my blood alone. I couldn't, see, I couldn't tell what it's trying to say here though. It says like su swa or something. <laughs> Sura. Oh, Square Enix. Oh. 
shit. <laughs> Swat in the east. Oh, that makes sense. That really makes sense. <laughs> Whoa, I did not see the fucking outfit she was wearing before. Maybe this becomes the react, huh? <laughs> the booba, the booba window, dude. Oh my god. Yeah, look at that pretty face. I always knew she was gonna look good. We're so strong. I didn't see. I didn't, guys. Stronger man than I. I didn't see it the first time. I always spot it on the second look, guys. Okay. I like how it's showing a lot of the scenery in this trailer. It's like a more peaceful one. I really like the map. Come. Is that say come? <laughs> oh, Doma. <laughs> My bad. Uh. Coma. <laughs> okay. Here I am. The monstrosity. Get rolled. Oh, that was just with the shaft. He didn't even uh, fucking stab him. He just... Beat him with the shaft. Oh, it's cool as hell. Nice. Titan. Just the shaft. So I guess this is a Shiragane. Naoki Yoshida. Nice. Nice trailer. Hatsetsu. Oh, okay. My bad. Ooh. Very cool. Ah, guys. Is it official? Have we made it to Stormblood before dawn trail? 07 to Heaven Sword. We had a good run in there. Oh seven to Heaven Sword. Took us five months. A lot of content. New Sam Main. Sam <laughs> Sure, you can have it. Someone has more content. Well, I guess we're not getting to Shadowbringers this year. Nah, we might. Okay, look, we're going to do a... 
we're gonna do our first ultimate this year. We got we got all this MSQ to do, and we got ultimates. We got um, oh, oh baby. We got the uh, next raid series. Actually, no shot. I studied the blade, Samber. Made it to based blood. Yeah, that's what I like to hear. That's what I like to hear. I did not finish. I'm still an ARR Hildy, I think. We might be doing some over the next couple of weeks, actually. Some Hildy. At least one stream of Hildy, probably before Dawn Trail, I reckon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's one thing with the game that I really like. All the trailers have done. They've done for expansions dated uh, so well. And jobs with them get people hyped for them. They don't want to show too much. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It's just like a, like a small glimpse and like foreshadowing and stuff. Like it shows you the theme. Like it shows like Eastern themes and stuff, like samurai stuff, the, a little bit of the uh, artwork and like zone, I guess, and the city, which is cool. Did he get in the gate? I have not gotten in the gate yet. We're going to go back in the game now. We're going to do the first quest, okay? We're going still back on. Guys, if you want, you can come over. We're on Oceana. We're playing on OC server, so more people can come over if they would like to. Uh, and we're going to Ravana server. All right, so I'm logging back in on Ravana. Literally a year. Well, I'm I'm not gonna like. I don't have to finish the ultimates before I move on. That's that's what I set myself. I'm not like. I'm not keeping myself sat there. Like ultimates is something I'm gonna work on. Like in parallel when I unlock them. Like they're just gonna be something that I like work on in parallel. Like from time to time, you know. Otherwise, uh, I will just be stuck in in slumber forever. MSQ, yay! Right. You cop clear? No, you cop clear. UCOB 2024. It's that simple. It's that easy. Okay. UCOB 2024, baby. All right. Sure. UCOB 2024. All right. New Year's Eve clear. Nah. Way before. Not even copium, guys. Stop saying sure. Stop saying copium, okay? No, you cob. Hee hee. One lockout. No, no, no. And I'm not even getting carried, okay, guys? We're going to assemble the old coils roster. Some of them want... Uh, at least I know some of them want to join. They're going to get first dibs. Um, and a lot of them uh, haven't cleared before. So it's not even a, a clear for us, okay? Sai is in despair in Uwu. Well, no shit. Because he's fucking going blind, Okay. Blind solo cook. All right, that's why he's despairing there. All right, there's a reason he's despairing. <laughs> I, however, am not doing Yukob blind. Uh, no, I already know how Yukob works, kind of. Like I've I've done a reaction to it. I roughly know how it works. Like I've done uh, I've done uh, what's it called? I've done the coils and stuff. Blind solo cook. I mean, there's blind, which is fair enough, but blind solo cook is, uh, yeah, that's ultimate despair. Not, couldn't be me. Couldn't be me at least. I mean, fair play to him if he likes playing the game that way. Fine, I'm not. I'm not here to tell him he can and can't have fun. You know, you just wouldn't ca be catching me doing blind solo cook. Ain't no way. Right, let's do the first. Are you reacting to DSR? At some point, I will. At some point, I will. I will probably do uwu like semi blind. Like I will probably do a few lockouts blind, or I will like play it until we hit like a hard mechanic, and where I feel like I want to look something up, and then I will, and then I will go back to being blind, and then I'll get to the next mechanic and do that way. I don't know how I'll do uwu yet. I might just not do it blind at all. I don't know because I kind of want to do a react to it as well. It could be fun. We'll see. Yeah, so like twenty seconds. Who knows. Maybe like I'll do a few lockouts each phase blind or something and then and then study up something like that. I don't know. I don't know how I'll do it yet. But all I know is I'm not doing Yuko blind, so. Let's do the first quest, guys. Beyond the Great Wall. Belsar's Wall. Phase three on Yeah, as soon as uh I heard uh Ultima Weapon has like some crazy mechanic that is like 
impossible to work out blind. Um, and like people, I've heard people say like, don't even know how the race world first players work that out because it's crazy. So if Sai is trying to do that blind, I mean, he is literally the one in charge of his own destiny and he's writing off his own sanity at that point, in my opinion. <laughs> so uh, to be fair, though, the only person between him and uh, not doing a blind is when he wants to, right? As soon as he wants to not be blind anymore, he doesn't have to be, you know? So, yeah. Once you know it, it's the easiest. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure it's like a trivial thing that's really impossible to work out or something. It's probably something like jumping. You know, you just jump when a mechanic happens. By the way, guys, I know you guys always give me shit for like, for suggesting jumping as like a mechanic solve. But you know that that's like, okay. I don't know if you know this or not, but I come from a WoW background and I recently been playing Cataclysm Classic and there's literally two mechanics in Kata that you solve by jumping. Okay. I've literally been like playing the dungeons and being like, oh shit, you actually have to jump to solve this mechanic. And everyone's sat there like giving me shit for it in FF. Okay. That's why I'm like coming up with that. That's why it's in my brain, you know? Really? Wow, refugee. That's me. Yeah. Wow, pilled. Yeah. Stone Core and um, Vortex Pinnacle. Yep. We're at the same quest now with the EU character. Uh, catch up to you. I'm going to do story with you. Yeah, nice, nice, nice. That's the one you actually skipped. Fair enough, fair enough. You played WoW. I played it, guys. It's been in every single title of every single stream so far, except for bar one, I think. Uh, actually, no. I think it's every single one. Yeah. Mechanic was the last one I saw before I quit. See? You can tell now, Mari, why I thought about it. But like, why it crossed my mind, you know? You can pull the rust out of WoW, but you can't pull the WoW out of rust. True. That's one of the truest things ever said in this chat by anyone. What's up, Vintage? Some things you can jump for without... Se yeah, see? Jumping is legit, guys. All right. <clears throat> Beyond the Great Wall. Let's do the first quest here. Alphano is a man with a great deal on his mind. Truing. You can't pull the dick out. What the heck? All right. Uh, anyway. He's not playing well. Unlike Sai, he used it in his titles, but is still playing. Yeah, like, I don't play retail. Like, I, t I, I dabble with classic off-stream with some friends. But, like, uh, I use it in my titles because... Well, I mean, I've said this a billion times, right? I use it in my titles because someone might be like, Oh, shit. That person probably has a similar life ex game experience to me. You know what I mean? But Sai actually plays retail on-stream, so... Alpha No is a child. He's a man with a great deal on his mind. Nah, I think we can say that Alfino at this point kind of is a man. You know, he's like, he's not technically an adult. I don't actually know how old he is at this point in time. But like, uh, I feel like he's like molded into a man. You know what I mean? Like, he, he's still a little bit, he's still a little bit of a shit. But he's, you know, he's definitely not had an easy time recently. 16 at the moment. Okay. I assume he ages as we go though, right? Because, like, wasn't he 16 originally? So, like, has time just not passed? Still 16? Has all this happened within a fucking year? What the hell? What a fucking crazy-ass year, man. Time does not exist. Right, so he just never ages. Right, okay. <laughs> it's odd. Right, okay. All right, let's see. Let's see what happens. The question is... How will the Empire respond to the disappearance of Omega and the Primal? Oh, I didn't see you there. Forgive me. Word from Baelsar's wall is proving long in the coming, and my mind cannot help but stray to grim places. Alphano, a message from the Alliance. It's about time. Pray summon the others at once. Let's do it. Yes, sir. To Doma? We gotta go to Doma, right? Sorry, to Co Coma. <laughs> oh shit! We actually went into the fucking Solace. General Oldin reports that his forces have secured the breach in Baelsar's wall. And what of the Primal and Omega? 
there is still no sign of either. It was Uhu Kali. He writes that they will begin a more thorough investigation shortly. And as expected, he wishes to petition the aid of the Scions of the Seventh Dawn. Classic. As expected. The Alliance's decision to capture a part of Balesar's wall is open to interpretation. The wall serves to demarcate Imperial territory, Alamigo included, from the rest of Eorzea. To an observer, the Rulban Alliance's actions Batman could be seen as a prelude to invasion. Ishish. Indeed. And the Alliance leaders have no wish to be branded invaders. Yeah. You're saying they won't fight for Alamigo? Even after everything that's happened? Not without the consent of her people, no. Make no mistake, Lise. The Alliance is in complete agreement that the Empire must be purged from Eorzea. However, they will not set foot in Gear Abania until they have formally secured the consent and cooperation of the Alamegan opposition. They would have us act as intermediaries. Precisely. The Scions are uniquely qualified to serve in this capacity. That is to say, leases, given her personal connection to the Resistance. Classic middleman. An agreement between the alliance and the people of Alamigo. Uh, Assuming you are willing, of course. We're just politicians and middlemen, huh? Of course I am. You know I'd like nothing more. Oh shit! It kind of makes sense now with the guy that came over to Ida. As from Lil Alamigo. You on said diplomatic mission, I had a mind to volunteer myself. Me. Well, that covers the talking part. But you just know there'll be trouble along the way. Are you available? I'm available. Take me. Yeah, Gondo bald. Exactly, yeah. As if you have to ask. I got nothing better to do. <laughs> dot, dot, dot. <laughs> Thanks. It means a lot knowing you'll be there. I too shall accompany you. Such endeavors are seldom hampered by a surfeit of healers. Good point. Allow me to offer my services as well. Oh, so everyone's going. I guess I've we're going together, guys. Time here of late, so I'll be coming. But we will need someone to keep an eye on things. Now, maybe Alfie should stay back. I trust you oh. have no objections. I guess Alfie's going to do the talking. No, my lady. Gladly shall I continue to serve as caretaker of the Waking Sands and there keep watch for signs of primal and Asian activity both. As capable as my learned friend is, just banished. Is, there are some troubles that may prove too much for a single scion, on account of which I mean to stay. It is settled then. Let us each see to our preparations. <laughs> it's kind of cool that, like, we all have our part to play in the story. New motif. Like, like it's not just all about me. Like, champion. Like, they do kind of lick my ass sometimes with the whole, like, War of Light. Oh, how could we do this without the War of Light? Blah, blah, blah. Like, when they when they put me on a pedestal a bit, sometimes I feel like it's maybe a, a little bit much. Like, a little bit akin to a different story, I know. Um, but it's kind of cool that, like... Everyone has their own responsibilities and duties, I guess. Wait, what does this button do? Oh, okay. Yeah, go like that. Yeah, everyone has their own, like, responsibilities. Like, I couldn't really get this far without Alfie, like, doing all the chatting shit all the time, you know? And I'm kind of literally just, like, the fighter at this point. Like, I'm actually the warrior, you know? Like, I'm not the diplomat of light. I'm the warrior of light, which is kind of cool, I suppose. Champion! <laughs> I don't know, that's right! <laughs> you remember uh, Amnago, don't you? The messenger who brought word of the Griffin's attack on the Belsar's War? Well, she left not long ago. 
having made a full recovery. If you see her in Girabanya, be sure to send my love. Oh, yes, we're going to meet her. We're going to actually finally find what's up. Please. So, it's finally happening. Don't tell anyone, but I'm feeling a little bit nervous. Only a bit, mind. I'll be fine once we get along. Get going, hopefully. Okay. Speak with Alfie. Mango. Ready, my friend? I'm ready. Well then, Tataru, I leave the rising stones in your capable hands. Don't worry, Alphano. I'll see that the place is still standing when you come back. Ah, get on, Tataru. All I do is smile and nod. I'm the smile and wave, boys. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Mistress Yishtola has unfolded all. You are bound for Girabanya? Girabanya. So that's like the new Aye. continent, I guess. The would have us make contact and Doma is like a region in there. And same with uh, Alamigo, it yeah. It begins then. As soon it shall in Doma, if the gods are good. It is but a pity it must oh, be I guess now. I'll find out. I am sorry that we shall not be present to fight beside you in the battles to come. You have stood with us countless times, Lady Yugiri. Pray do not apologize. Then let us thank you instead. You and yours stood with us from the first when we came to this land as refugees in search of sanctuary. Loath am I to think what might have become of my people had you not extended to us the hand of friendship. We will never forget. This I solemnly swear. Much has changed since first you set foot on these shores. Revenant's toll stands as a testament to that. I'm sure your people will manage in your absence. Indeed. Uh. They have built a new home for themselves and no longer need me to shepherd them. The time has come for Kosetsu and I to return to our master. I wonder who their master is going to be. Can't wait to meet them. I know how you feel. It's time I went home too. Though our battlefields be a thousand mounds apart, our purpose is one. Let all men hearken to the clarion call of freedom, of liberation, from Eorzea to the far east, that they may rise up and cast down the curse of Garlemald. This guy's a giga chad, dude. <laughs> Wokage. Take care, you hear me? When all of this is over, we're going to celebrate together. Just you wait. Oh, don't say that. Fuck. I should like that very much. Fare you well. Yeah, together. Oh, good. Great. <sighs> oh, seven to those guys, I guess. <laughs> Fuck. A thousand miles apart, yet united in purpose. Let us pray both our endeavors meet with success. Shall we then? Let's do it. So they're going to Doma and we're going to... I'll... Green. Wait, wait. Not just yet. I knew I'd forgotten something important. Ah, oh, she's getting swagged up. Lies, Lise. Could you come? Could you come with me? Me? What now? <laughs> uh, all right then. If you insist. What the heck? <laughs> all right. Um. <clears throat> anyway, she's gonna get dripped up, guys. Full, full on swag, man. Lise, sorry, Lise, Lise, Lise. Not lice. I sorry. Let's see the new outfit. Ooh, red. Ooh. Nice. Jesus. Let's fuck shit up, music. Looking respectfully at least. <laughs> what do you think? 
Nice. Belly looking. Big stretch. Bonk. <laughs> As you can see, I designed it to be light and loose. An outfit tailor-made to the knees of a skilled fighter like Lise. Your work never ceases to impress. Much more of this, and I may have to stop introducing you as the Scions receptionist and start referring to you as the... as a, a preeminent seamstress. Preeminent. It's lovely, Tataru. Thank you. I feel like I could take on a lesion. I'm glad you like it. And with that, I'll delay you no longer. Safe travels. Then onwards to Gear Abanya. Our first stop will be at Amaris Am Amaraswa's Spire in the East Shroud. I guess we're going to go through the gates, right? That's cool. At Belsar's. Belsar's place. Red Oak. Hi, Alice. Boom. You, uh, you got hit with the drive-by, dope. It is what it is. All right, let's go. The Black Shroud. So you guys want me to do finish the first quest, yeah? Ball sacks. What? What the fuck? Yeah, you look cool as hell, by the way. If a beehive makes honey, what does a dehive make? All right, let's get to Belsar's wall then. All right, I'm going to TP to the Hawthorne hut. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. Dunny? <laughs> Bee salami. No, 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 no. Oh, my God. Yeah, we're looking for you, Raviol. I think I, think I know some people looking for you. Dunny. <laughs> I think it was something else. This one's kind of a jam. <laughs> Alfie. All are present and accounted for. When you're ready, my friend, pray inform the officer that we wish to proceed into Gear Abanya. All right, to Gear Abanya then. Ah, the Scions of the Seventh Dawn. We were told to expect you. Shall I summon someone to escort you to the wall? Proceed to Custom Orients. All right. The Fringles. The Fringes. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Another cutscene. Ooh. Oh shit, we're traveling kind of far. Alamigo. The Fringles. I remember Ooh. crossing the border. Standing in Girabania once more. Me and my fellow Scions. The warrior of light among us. Hey, he does the narrator. L li uh, l Behind uh, us, <laughs> Baelsar's wall cutting the land in two. Freedom on one side, tyranny on the other. Oh, he made a big wall. Tyranny and the promise of a new beginning. But one that could only be bought with flames and blood. He's basically Donald Trump. Stormblood! Yeah! Heaven Sword, goodbye. Goodbye, Heaven Sword. It was an absolute blast, mate. Good expansion. 
Oh! Whoa, 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 what the hell is this? A kitsune kind of dog thing. Ooh. Hey, guys. You are cute. Yay! Now I can start Shadowbringers on the alt. Aww. Right, let me hide my UI here. Here I am, a voyager, guys. Here we all are voyagers. Weeb expansion. <laughs> Yay, we made it! Aww. Except you, yeah. Who have we got here then? Uh, huh? Of course, I'm going to walk the line with you guys. All right, let me walk the line, and then I think I can finally unpause the alerts, right? I think it's time. Let me see here. Oh, shit. Hello, hello. And they're in spirit. You're all good. I see you in the chat. That's all we need uh, is the theory. Look at the Sams. Samurai. Samurais. What the hell's this mountain then? Cirilla, Barry. How long have you guys been waiting here? <laughs> I never, I'm in bed. Yeah, I saw you. <laughs> you guys must have been waiting here fucking ages. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. Literal hours. Sorry. I have, I have arrived, guys. Oh my god, it's really long. There's loads of you guys. This mount is sick. How have I never seen this one before? So many people that are like AFK. Because <laughs> they just part of the character and like, alright, I'm out. I'm out. Yo, Mepament, what's going on? Hello, hello. My newest dragon girl. Hi, Eleanor. Oh shit, you could have even brought Tia. Oh no, you couldn't actually. She's not high enough level, right? Hey, cuties. Oh shit, look at Yuki over there. Meditating. Akito, Raviol, Iku. Alice, Rudav, Embla. Right, let me gra grab some pictures in a second. AFK is our best quality. True, Sneeko, what's going on? Bob Shagger. I knew I'd catch you. I knew I'd catch you changing up on me. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, but at the same time, get home safely. Yeah, you're all good. Dri drive safe, get home safe, or however you're getting there, of course, Tula. Azriel Remez. Reams. That's a cool, uh, that's a cool Ellison. Shit. Professional Dandy. I almost read that as Daddy. Honestly, Professional Daddy would work too. Oh shit, look. We have some peeps up top there. Marion Volp. Wait, didn't I just see Volps? Uh -huh. Sneaky. Rosie. What did you do with Volps? She sent him away. Hey, cutie. Can't fly. <laughs> right, I'll grab some pictures in a sec. Nice. Thanks, guys. Thanks for coming over. Thanks for waiting as well. Nyavya, my arch nemesis of chocobo racing. We have a goblin samurai down here. Cami, so cute. True. Yippee! Can we do be cute? Huzzah. Oh, I think, yeah, a goburai. Goburai. I need to, uh, I do need to go grab that one for sure. Mercury. Nice lizard. 
Nice Lizza. Mutant. Dressed up. I feel I feel like well I guess I'm in the correct clothing, I suppose, for arriving here. Tataru did make this for me after all, you know. Tataru worked hard on this outfit. Nice music in here. Why has it gone quiet now though? It's not looping. Oh here we go. Here we go. Sakuya. Oh. It's actually Link. Oh yeah, I need to lick her. I need to lick her. Okay. Guys. What a day, man. Heaven Sword did us well. And I've heard. There's even more content in Stormblood. So I don't know how long we're going to be here. But we're going to give it its justice. We're going to give it its time in the sun. Just as we did with Heaven Sword. Just as we did with A Realm Reborn. It don't stop here. First on the first on the list is going to be more MSQ. We're going to get all the way through 4.0. And then unlock the end game. And just see where we go from there. You know. That's the plan. That's the plan. And let it be known. I know it's slightly behind my original estimate of uh, my original estimate of starting Stormblood in 20, uh, sorry, in t like, what was it? End of March, beginning of April was my initial estimate. I mean, it's start of June. Okay, it's halfway through June, but Alexander took a little bit longer than I was expecting, you know? Now, let's lick it together, guys. Okay. It's a good aetherite, man. It's a good aetherite. <sighs> Ooh, yeah. Tasty one, baby. And with that, guys, I will unpause the alerts. Yeah, boy. All right, I'm unpausing your alerts from ages ago. That thing just went up by like 100. It's time for the chaos. Yeah, we'll just let it go. Thunder Squall, thank you for the prime. Welcome into the Rapscallias with a new sub right there. These uh, these alerts are going to... Uh... They know. How do they know? How do they know? How do they know? Now, there's only... There's only... There's probably like a few alerts coming, you know? This is why it's chaos. What's up, Custard? Hello. How do they know? Uh... Yeah, no, guys. Thank you for the earlier subs, gift subs, and hype trains and stuff at the uh, at the uh, what's it called? It's like my uncle the credits and all that stuff. Appreciate them. We're just gonna let the alerts catch up so people get you know they get their alerts to play and stuff, right? They they paid good money for those, you know. Um, Papa Limo just subscribed. How do they know? Fuck. How did I know? <laughs> Fuck, dude. What's up, Custard? Welcome in. A few? Yeah, there's just a few. There's just a few. Thank you. Thank you. How do they know? God, how many times is it going to do that alert? I can't remember. It must be like three or four, I think. Nero told Skaver also subscribed. Dude, Nero was such a badass. I, that character's so good, man. All right, let me grab some screenshots for you guys. They know. How do they know? How do they know? How he, do they know? He subscribed at and promptly died. I think he might actually be gone. You know, I thought I thought like Minfilia was was not dead, but Papalimo, I think I think he's gone. Yeah. Let me grab some screenshots here. Let me grab these here. Yo, Uber Custard, thank you for the follow. Right, I'm just going I just want to document everyone that's here and stuff. I'll go back and do the other side as well, of course. I just want to always have like good a good amount of screenshots to like look back on, right? Quieres? Thank you guys for coming over to OC. Thank you guys for coming and meeting me in. I actually don't even know what city this is, so I'm gonna check in a sec. Thank you for coming to meet me in um. I'm with the coolest mom I've ever. Gear Abanya. I don't even know if this is a city or if it's just a. 
I'm a stud. I don't know. I'm ballsy. I don't take no shit from anyone. I smoke my The fringes? This is the Val. Yeah, the Val. No, find that's a gone. Clean. Like you. <laughs> yeah, let me let me do this. Baby oh. shoes. Red oak. I'm working hard for my money. As a cat boy Stop mate. laughing at me, man. Solaris. <laughs> oh, wait, that's a nice blade. That's a nice blade right there. Look at that stamp. Dude, I keep thinking I'm getting gift subs because I'm hearing all the alerts. I'm like, oh, I need to say thanks, but I already did all the thank yous. I still have my dignity. I still have my dignity. Why are you laughing? Time cannot erase your whispers in my mind. How long will they know? All right, that, I think that must be the tiny, the last time, the tiny time, the last time I got the tiny emote, the tiny alert, okay. Fellow Russ, I'm baby shoes. I know, I know. I looked at your plate before. Jammy boy. Let me grab some screenies. Never give up on your dreams. You got this. True. We'll never know why she laughed. She laughed at what I said, I think. But she was also wrong, okay? She was wrong to laugh at that. Izu Ryujin with a rose field. Oh, oh. Sheesh. Oh, that's you, Takunin. Ah. I always forget your character name. Oh, uh, yeah. Ula, you're cute. Oh, yeah. Ula, guys. Rilla Rossfield. Side quest enjoyer. Fair enough. Fair enough. It's different from the Twitch. Yeah, that's all good. Let me grab these ones. Let me grab everyone's names. I want to grab everyone's names and their mounts and their glams. Look at Amy go. Yeah, you could do some damn with that. <laughs> God, that looks sick. I'm a stud. Okay, I'm dude, there are some really cool katanas, I will say. I smoke my stogie There's some really good ones. I don't have to find like a truck a stop on the way to a military like base that's out in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> right, so this is not even... We haven't even made it it's to the like city yet. We just got to the first Aetherite. Nice. I guess, to be fair, like, Ishgard was always, like, looming over us. You know? Can we spell it out? You're a poopy head. Hound Hellbane. Oops. Hello, hello. Nice dragon. For those we can yet save. I'm a free trial player. Nice. Free trial is kind of OP. Not gonna lie. Here it is. And last but not least, Oregon, Vossenbergen, and Lydia. That's a lot of damage. There we go. It's actually a wyvern. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, nice. Well, guys, what did we think? Did I react hard enough? Did you guys enjoy me do, doing the end of the MSQ? I thought it was really cozy. Like, not cozy. Because, like, Papalimo and all that shit. It was kind of sad ending, to be honest. But it wasn't as crushing it wasn't as crushing as like ARR for sure. A plus. Good, good. Buying it at the end of the month. Oh, hell yeah, Hellhound. When are you gonna cry? Look, I'm sorry that I didn't shed tears for Papa Limo, you know? Game just needs to try harder. I guess they just need to take away a character I like, you know? They just gotta take. Well, I mean, they've taken away characters I like, but they've got to take away, like, I don't know. They need to they need to make me, like, one, like, inseparable from a character and then t tear it away from me, you know? I'm glad he's gone. Oh, my God, Alice. I've also not cried yet. Yeah. I mean, I cry at, like, movies and TV shows all the time. So I think there probably will come a point where I think I think what gets me to, like, cry in those situations is um like you need to like feel really like bonded and connected and like there needs to be like humanity and empathy involved you know and I guess I don't know I, I guess I have an easier time with it when it's like human faces rather than character faces maybe 
Because I feel like seeing... I don't know. I, I think like I'm to see with the with the Ida thing, like I'm Ida Papalimo thing. I'm just gonna keep calling her Ida, by the way, the for the for, for now. Like, cause she was Ida at the time, uh -oh. right? Like with the Stinky. Ida like Papalimo thing, I feel like it's it's on like it's getting you there, but we I feel like we don't really know enough about them, really, to like really like feel the connection, like. It, from my from like where I was, it's like they kind of go around together, but it's like you know. But if it's like if it's like something deeper than that, then I feel like that one could have tugged on heartstrings. You know what I mean? For me, at least. Um, are we actual OC enjoyers? I don't think we have seen this many people on my server before. Here, custard. Shit, I almost missed that one. Um, yeah, we came over to Oceana because we can. Like, we can bring all our characters from EU. We can bring our characters from NA. We can bring our characters from Japan. Damn it, there it is again. Whoa, How dude. Do How do they know? How do they know? Um, yeah, we can bring our characters over from, like, every data center, right? And, and get involved on this server. So that's why we're over here. Yeah, it's a way to get NA and EU and the, the couple over from Japanese servers all on the same server. So thanks for coming out as well. Don't go, don't gotta hurt me like that. What's the most populated uh, OC server? You're a poopy head. Peepo arrive. Hello, Dula. What's up? Tug on this. Oh, tug on my heartstrings. You know what I mean? Right. Thank you guys. Uh, by the way. I know, I know some people did like some TTS, some people did like gifts up, up something cutscene. It's all good. Just, uh, yeah, it, it was all good. Like, I think it was accidents and stuff. Just wanted to say like, you're fine. You're fine. I, I'm not going to hate you forever. But, but please do try and like generally refrain from that like during cutscenes. You can do like subs if I have the alerts off and stuff, of course. But some of the some of the alerts it's hard because sometimes bits go through and subs don't because I'm using like two different platforms to do my alerts. New census data came out the other day. Oh right, Sephiroth is the most populated. I mean, he is a cool he is a cool guy. Where can I check that? Uh, we could link the census if you want. Before we log off, permission to pile on you and shower you with love in game on your signal. Uh. Yeah, yeah, you can do that. Like now that like the alerts are playing and everything like that, I've taken some screenshots. You can do you can do what you what you need to do. Uh, I'll also hand in the quests before, you know, we do anything else as well in a second. Oh look, shit! I didn't see a Rude Avin smug back there. Who's that? Valeria. Wait, let me go. Let me go screenshot these guys. There we go. Nice. It's my home server. I just caught up on the whole thing. Did you... Like, how did you get to the stream from here, Custard? Were you, like, randomly walking around? You saw these people and then you just asked? Or... Wait, that's you? Oh, shit. Here we go. The heart of the party. The party's arrived now. Mm -mm. We can wait. Yeah, yeah, I'm uh I'm very uh very much whelmed now. Like we're we're chilling. I'm we're we're kinda good. You can you can do what you want now. Um I'm at peace, yeah. Lucky Bancho census data in Japanese. Yeah, there you go. That's uh It's uh it's Allura Almedia. Uh okay then. Please tell me you're Aussie, it's almost six AM. <laughs> I mean, could be up early, got to me, you know. I created a bun boy on the server. Very nice. Found him. You got him. You got him. Very nice. Yeah, I, I, I enjoyed the uh I enjoyed the end of it though. Heaven's War was good. The patches were really good. My favorite part probably was like Like favorite part of today. Uh, I I don't know. Like the whole like Ilbert cutscene was kind of cool. Obviously the Omega versus um, what was that? What was the primal called, guys? Or the one that like at least apparently like something Ryu. Was it like 
Shinryu. Like the Shinryu versus Omega cutscene was also really, really cool as well. Yeah. Um. I also think like my favorite part on the patches and stuff probably is like Alice actually. I think like she brought back some like some like much needed like humanity to the Scions, I guess. Like I get why the Scions can like seem kind of cold. But also it's like they're always all cold all the time, you know? And I feel like uh, Alice is kind of... I wouldn't say balancing it out, but at least... Like, the only time where... Like, like they want to like, like, oh, I'll go mourn in my own way. And, oh, we can't dwell on the past. We've got things to do. And I get it. But like sometimes it does just feel like maybe a little bit too cold sometimes. <laughs> Whereas Alice is like even just like someone we just met, she was like, no, please don't like kill this little rat thing. You know what I mean? Give me your fucking money. Takunin, thank you for the gift sub to Uwu Custard. Hey, the alerts caught up. Nice, nice. Uwu Custard, welcome in. Thank you, Mia Estella. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hi, how we doing? How we doing? Fun fact, Omega and Shinryu are both super bosses in FF5. Oh, is that why uh, someone was like FF5 nerds like rejoice or something? So they, they're like evenly matched because they're from previous games. Right, okay. Interesting. Apolimo is technically a primal. I mean, I no, because he was part of the egg, right? And then like the primal was inside the egg. Oh, thank you. Welcome in, welcome in. Blew me away. It was it was sick. I actually think the Ilbert cutscene thing was so so good. Also, called it. Also, what else did I call? Dude, I called a lot of stuff actually. I called the Ilbert thing like pretty early on, but I guess he had the same voice, right? So it was kind of obvious, I guess. Uh, what else was there? Thing is, I don't know who the the double is. That's the one thing I'm a bit unsure on. Obviously, don't say anything. The double. Like, who's the second part of the griffin, you know? Like, I guess we don't know that. And we're not supposed to know yet. Not even pre-watched. Just like I didn't pre-watch the trailer thing, I just thought, probably going to cut the bullets when they show a bullet firing at a samurai in slow motion, you know? It's me. Different voice they changed. Hmm. I guess I saw like his uh like height and skin tone and build and stuff as well, right? I'm waiting to see something like that for nearly 30 years. Wait, did you not Oh you mean like You mean when you first watched it? Like you weren't you didn't first watch it today, right? Got I me? Mean, like you did it you did, you watched all the stuff when you started playing or or have you actually not done the story, haven't you? What is your main? Kinda tells you does he? Oh, okay. If Papa Limo doesn't come, there is no egg. Wait, what? Um. <laughs> Even Highland doesn't know the identity of the double. I guess not. Well, is that? Oh, okay. I mean, we'll find out. I guess maybe, or maybe not. Maybe not. I guess. Played FF5 back when I was 6 or 7, so I've been waiting long for a big cinematic. Shinryu and Omega having a go. Nice. That's sick. That cutscene was cool. That cutscene was cool. Imagine with, the like you said, like the better graphics and stuff in the cutscenes. It's going to be interesting now going forward. Right, shall I hand in to Raul Barn? Is that a thing? Is that, do I need to do anything else as like part of this segment, guys? Or is it like, is this the end screen kind of, so to speak? Right, right, right. All right, I do want to go talk to Raban. It starts a cutscene. This is good. All right, I'll talk to Raban. Oh shit, everyone's here. Let's see what Kral's saying. 
Hand in too soon, bro. Huh? Bro, he's lost the whole arm more than just a hand, okay? Uh, broken. Quite an atmosphere here, isn't there? Everyone seems to be on pins and needles. Though one can hardly blame them, given recent events. You know what? I want to look around this place, actually. Hey, look. So Rukoko's up there. Oh, look at that mount, dude. I need that one. There's the wall. So this is actually just like a little... <laughs> it's like a little town on the edge. Serpent Marshall Brookstone. It's a good mount. Yeah, that one's sick. All right, Yastrola, what's she saying then? We just forgot Nago. Yeah, hopefully we're going to find out uh, what happens to Nago, like who Nago is. And like that, that's the most like random character introduction and just now she's gone again. But I guess it's going to build up something. Yeah, this is just a gate, right? Yastrola. The Alliance has done well to repurpose these Imperial facilities for their own use so quickly. The general is high in spirits, don't you think? I know the feeling. Oh, is he? All right. To see the colors of so many nations. Limsa Laminsa, Gridania, Older, and now Ishgard. Well, now he brings a tear to my eye. We have much to be proud of for us. To be fair, for all the mistakes that we do make, we do get some shit done. You know, like we did actually, like realistically, we did actually, uh... We got Ishgard, like, into the Alliance. We... Like, we... Like, half our problems are self-inflicted, though, I feel like. Like, we did kind of stop the Shinryu thing as well. Although, like, we kind of had to release a beast to stop it. <laughs> yeah, we saved Ishgard. We killed the evil Pope, the God King, the literal God King. Uh, we have done some good shit, to be fair. But we definitely make it harder for ourselves. Should I learn my rotation knowing it will change once Storm Trail's out? Uh, probably not. I mean, learn it to a level where you're comfortable. Like, if you're planning to do content before Dawn Trail is out, then probably yes. If you're, like, playing casually, I wouldn't bother. Yeah, it probably depends on the job, right? Noted. Thinking. The pig on arrive. Because you listened to Emmerich and threw the balls into the valley. Yeah, exactly, right? Exactly. Yeah, true, actually. None of this would have fucking happened if we just actually disposed of the balls as, as appropriate, you know? Like, if we'd have just handled the balls with care, if we'd have, um, like, done what is necessary with the balls and just locked them away kind of thing then none of that would have happened and we wouldn't have needed to release Omega. So like we did kind of make some mistakes. The eyes, sorry, the eyes. Gauge the balls, new to the ball, like. Yeah, so wait, so wait, 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 wait. So, okay, wait, if I backtrack events, right? It's like, we did all the stuff with the dragon eyes and Ishgard, right? That's 3.0, right? And then everything like leading up to 3.3 is because Astinian got the balls and turned into Nidhogg. And then all that happens. And then we finally get rid of them and we throw them into a chasm. And then obviously Elidibus went and got them, gave them to Ilbird. And then that happens because of the balls. So like really, is it kind of Astinian's fault? I know, it's easy to look in hindsight and point point something out, right? Uh, I think getting some notable changes compared to most jobs. Yeah, I heard uh, I heard Monk is changing and people are a bit unsure why, because people quite like it. Death to Nidhogg. Victim blaming. Balls in Waffle Maker. I never said balls in Waffle Maker, okay? Balls arc. 
Heaven's Sword was kind of like the patches were kind of the balls arc. Yeah. Like the all the patches on Heaven's Sword are kind of about balls. We really take it back to the Calamity. Uh, yeah, if the Calamity didn't happen, we would be pretty sweet. Yeah. If Louis Soir was still around, oh, we'd be chilling, man. <laughs> But yeah, throwing the eyes off the cliff was... Um, I can't believe that was Aymeric, by the way. And I can't believe we didn't go, actually, buddy, probably not. Maybe sit this one out, yeah? Bring back 1.0. All right, let's not go too far, okay, uh, Silver? All right, let's not, let's not lose our minds. All right. Would it be expansion without changing monk? Yeah, I've heard. I've heard that sort of thing. Uh, brings a tear to my eye. We have so much to be proud of. All right, let's see what Alice says. So this is East End. Not too different from this rest of the shroud, is it? Though truth be told, I'm not sure why I thought it would be. It's just uh, wait. Let me have a look out here. Let's get my chocobo. Just dead forest out here. Ooh. EastEnders. In it, mate. <laughs> it's just the dead part of the Black Shroud, huh? How long have I been playing so far? Uh, I have been playing for... Now, don't laugh at me, okay? I've been playing for about 10 months. Okay. But I'm enjoying the time. I'm taking it slow. I'm enjoying the ride. It's a slow burn. I'm exploring all the content. You know, I'm taking it in. Jeez, gee. Gee, jeez. 10 months to get through this gate. Yeah. Hee <laughs> hee, smile, not laughing. I'm having a good time, you know. We're in the brown shroud now. Oh, look, there's dummies here. What's my playtime? Forty-six days, sixteen hours, and twenty-seven minutes. That's a good use of time, right there. Jesus Christ! <laughs> I'm ready for the ten months of, of Stormblood. It's gonna be like uh, I reckon we'll get Shadowbringers before New Year's, guys. Good numbers, maximum. Sometimes I leave myself logged in when I go to make food after stream. Okay, guys. Look, chat, it's a bunch of you at level 60. Striking dummies. They are very striking. I became a father in the meantime. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> well, look. Meanwhile, I have been exploring very closely the insides of Alexander... And the sounds and music of Brute Justice. And all the air stuff. Doing all the side content. Monlei Lu has actually created life. Yeah. So. Yeah. There's perspective. There's some perspective for you guys. Which was the better use of time? Who knows? <laughs> Alexander Colonoscopy? I mean, I'm definitely sure I was down or up there in some regards, yeah. But it'll be ages before he can get his kid to farm tombstones, so who's the real winner? <laughs> I gotta dip out, have a good rest of the stream and a good weekend. Have a great weekend yourself, howdy nerdy. Thanks for watching, thanks for hanging out, of course. 
Yeah, you've got to raise that kid now until they are of a good age where they can farm for you in game, Monlay. Whereas I, 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 I've got all that extra time myself that I don't have to parent that I can farm, you know? So really, I'm, I'm definitely on the uh, short-term investment cash cow style here, yeah. Considering the amount of time spent stalling, it's not that bad. A month and a half in the last 10 months. Wait, what do you mean? Oh, yeah. Yeah, exactly, right? A month and a half played. Well, let's see. I stream about... I'd say like... 25... Ah, probably a bit more. About 25 to 30 hours a week, I think, I stream. Uh... And it's been how many weeks is that? It's not quite a year, right? And I've barely taken much time off. Like the odd stream here and there. A couple streams like a few weeks ago. I'd say like I've probably not streamed for like maybe... I'd say it, ba I'd say it balances out with like the subathon, right? There were longer days and it was like all in a row. So I'd say probably on average, yeah, I've pretty much hit my weekly quota kind of thing, right? Like if it all averaged out. So how many weeks has it been? Uh, I think we're on day 160 something at the moment. Yeah, we can just count the streams actually, right? So it's not too bad considering I've mostly been logged in this character. A couple of times we've been on like the NA character, I suppose. Um... Wait, what did what did Custard say? Hold on. I've been playing for eight days. Dude's a vet compared to me. Wait, you've been playing eight days? And you were level what? 79? Oh no. <laughs> What's our current day count? I don't know if Mari has the days. Uh last time I the VODs are updated to like 50 something. Wait, I can check actually. We are on day... Hold. We are on day... 56, 57, 58, 59. 60... 161. It's day 161 today, guys. So, you know. Go figure, I guess. I'm an MSQ junkie. I haven't done anything else. Are you enjoying it? Are you having a good time with it? You really underestimate how many how much people only do MSQ? Oh yeah, no, I, I I definitely know that people people do. Like a lot of people come in, they're like, yeah, I've been playing like two weeks and they're way far ahead of me. Some people finish the game within like two weeks of starting, right? 164 days, four hours and forty minutes. Over how long of a time period, Necro? Like this is over ten months, but this is also uh you know, I play I play like I'm logged in like five, let's say like five hours a day, four times a week, right? So like 20 hours a week. Plus the AFK time after stream, I guess. Well, it's been a blast compared to the base game. Oh no, don't shit on ARR. Oh no. We're going to have to have words custard. On the first pass of the character, I just do MSQ and blues. Yeah, yeah, that's fair enough. I mean, the blue quest still give you like, well... Like, all the side content, really, right? Like, the optional dungeons, they give you the, um... Well, I mean, you'd even do the raids, just not on Savage, right? I mean, technically, the Savages are blue quests. Technically. I did MSQ first, and I want to do raids and stuff, farm all the mounts. Um, well, Peeny, you, uh... You, uh... Applied to do Alex, right? And you were actually on the bench. You're on my bench, my backups list, if I remember correctly, or my secondary picks, right? The way that I'm going to do the next raid series is I'm going to do it in, like, I'm going to make three teams of eight. Instead of one team of eight that do all three tiers, I'm going to make one team of eight for each tier. So there's going to be, like, 21 people that get a chance to play the, the raid, right? Um, rather than just seven. So we'll get more people through, but it'll be four bosses per team instead of instead of 12, because I think it burns people out a little bit with the 12, you know, especially when it takes as long as Alexander took us. Um, 
you know, that took us like quite a few months. Some people sort of burned out a little bit from that. Some people, you know, like what people agreed to, and this is completely fair enough, by the way, you know, if people agreed to give me a certain amount of time of their week, but then like two months later, like life happens, right? Things change. So I can't really expect them to continue to like give me so much of their time. Uh, so I think it's just better for everybody. It's better for like the, the raiders not getting burned out as much. It's better for me like possibly having to not deal with as many like people dropping out and stuff. Um, like if we just do it that way. Also, it's better because more of you guys get to get involved each time we get to a raid series. So I think I think generally that would be okay. And like the people that were on my backups list for the previous raids, Pini, so yourself included, will get like higher prior basically so i'll try and get you in for one of those if you want to play that is and if you want to apply and stuff bless you and your early dedication to the game so it can become what it is today uh 2.3 was there since 2.3 april 2014 with the ps4 launch yeah yeah honestly shout out to people that have been playing this game for since like 1.0 2.0 early before heaven sword starting in heaven sword because yeah without those players the game would have like died off and and it wouldn't we wouldn't have it now you know it's just cool it's 4 a.m over here you're going people sleep out welcome to Stormbird silver Kohi, thank you for hanging out thank you for watching of course i have 124 days over 13 months active and i haven't caught up yet wait is in you haven't caught up to the, the patches or you haven't caught up to me there's no way you're behind me right with her that ain't no way Phantom's doing the longest possible version of AR is not is never not funny to me. That is that is hilarious. <laughs> you know one of my mods, Phantasm, he um he basically he started he started doing AR before the uh like they cut the content or something. So I think what I, I can't remember exactly how it works, but he started he did all of AR before they cut some of the quests. And then he started the patch content before they cut some but he just got to like the point where they started cutting stuff and then they rejiggled some things so then like he took a break and then when he logged back in he had to like redo some stuff that he'd already done because they changed how the questing worked and then he got through the patches on like the longer thing after he'd already so he did like the patches like one and a half times or something and the original base game in the long in the long form as well <laughs> which is just hilarious like he couldn't have stopped and started at two different times to make a different result like he he so he's like he claims like he he was one of the one of the people that played like AR the longest like longer even than pr before the like they squished it right because um he had to like redo some parts of it or something like that i can't remember exactly how it works but i find that funny and he moans about it all the time I did MSQ first. Oh yeah, I read that one. I read that one. 467 days, 12 hours, 41 minutes. And that's only for Holo. Oh yeah, and you have like eight characters, right? CNAD? Uh, I skipped Shadowbringers when it was new, but I've been playing since Heaven's Sword. So, there seems like a lot of people skipped... Wait, you skipped Shadowbringers. Jesus. A lot of people that seem to have skipped some stuff and they actually do like get their... They, they actually get to see the story through the stream, which is cool, right? 675 days for NA boss. Damn. To be fair, though, my WoW days are, like, close to the 1,000, I'm pretty sure. So, you guys are doing pretty good. I think I think in WoW, I have, like, 800 or something. Maybe more. I think it's, like, 860-ish. Which is a lot. But that's over all my characters, right? And that's over, like, since... When I have that account since? Since Wrath of Lich King. Plus, I've probably deleted some characters that had playtime on as well. It's nuts. Yeah. It's e it's super easy to rack up time in that game. Because, like, you're always trying to do stuff. And you're always gatekept. So, you just rack up time. I'm going to cry more. Uh, now I need to order food because we're standing here for five hours. Look, dragon, I might do the same to be honest. I don't, I, I ate the food I was gonna have for dinner for breakfast, so I might just order myself like a burger or something. 63 days, 21 hours, and 10 minutes. Wait, that's like nothing. Well, I'm almost catching up. Be sure you can quest from Blizzard your total time logged in. Can't remember how, but doing it a couple years ago. Solid two years. Oh shit, yeah, this, mine doesn't even include like classic. I'm just talking like retail is like 860 or something. Pictures are in disc. All right, let's check out Discord.
Azeroth cries out to me, champion. Thanks, for, uh, Vobs. <laughs> Fuck's sake, man. All right, let's have a look at this. The wins. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Screenshots. The the not occult meeting on OC. It's not occult, guys. Oh, that's a cute pick. Who took this one? Cami. Nice pick, Cami. Nice. Let's see. Bossenberg Essen. Cuties. Now that Russ has reached the boss, here's B team. Oh, you slapped him? Oh, you slapped him up good. He got rolled. Spoiler? Wait, is this a spoiler that I can't click still? Or can I click now? Got me. Look in the selfies. I'll, I'll look in a sec. Yeah, yeah. Safe for me. Oh, that's cool. Oh shit, look what he did with the lighting, with the purple and the blue. That's nice. That's a good pick right there. The egg. Did you change to bun from aura just today, tongue? Emric hairstyle. He looks good, Jumantis. Uh, now take the clothes off. Okay. Classic carbuncle. Uh, maybe I shouldn't click that one. Alright. Uh, <laughs> here we go. Look at the mounts. There I am. Okay, let me make them in big mode. Bring them up in big mode. Nice. <laughs> she do be cute. The angel of death. Taking Papa Limo's soul away. Nice. Dude, you guys got the heads of the mounts like all perfect. God, I look good. And this is why we're aura, guys. You see, it's got to make sense in all the screenshots. Look, so cute. It was him shirtless. Oh, big mode. <laughs> Damn, this is nice. Look at the quality. Look at that HD, baby. Aura, best, best race. We're back to the mug. Yep, you know the mug. We're at the truck stop. I can't wait till we get to the city, though. We need to have a photo shoot when we get to the city and stuff as well. There's more pics. Thank you for those, Murray. That one's nice. That one, too. Yeah, we got, like... Belsar's wall in the background and stuff. I really like the doting one too. I like the colors in uh, in this one, uh, Holo. They're really nice. There's also this, look. Badass. Who did this one? I can't see. Uh... I can't see who did this. It's just this E dot dot dot. I don't know whose picks these ones are. It looked kind of like uh, Helm Oregon's picture, though. Oh, a uh, character. You changed yesterday? Oh, oh, I got you. Back to the correct uh, aura. Mm -hmm. These are nice colors. I like the shade, I think. Yeah, Evap. Yeah, okay, that's Helm Oregon, I think. Hey, look, we got one from uh, up by uh, Marion Volps up there. Nice. Mm. 
Sweet as, guys. Did you ever actually doubt that I would get to Stormblood before Dawn Trail? I always believed. I don't know about you guys. Surely you believed as well, right? There's no way you actually thought that we wouldn't make it. Everyone did. Wait, you did? When you say you did and yes, you mean believe or doubt? I doubted strongly. I doubted. I never doubted. I doubted. You guys really doubted? It's kind of close. No, it's not. It's like two weeks away. Depending on how long the last two of Alex took. I guess that is true. When we were at Brute Justice, I can see why you might doubt, I suppose. Imagine if we had like a long running gamble or something. Right on the money. Yeah, I think that is that is kind of true, what Mario said. But the last tier of Alex, not gonna lie, guys. We kind of absolutely smashed it, dude. We absolutely pumped. Okay, look. I'm, I've am i been doing the VODs recently, right? And Brute Justice only took... You know what? It actually only took... Hold. Okay, but you'll be... Okay, I'll ask you a question in just a sec, okay? I say only because, like, it was shorter than I thought. Like, shorter than I remembered. I think you'll be surprised. It was... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight streams. I know that's quite a lot of raid time, but like, that's shorter than I thought. Like, I remember, I thought I remembered it taking like, like, 15 streams or something, you know? We got it done faster than I thought we would. Yeah, eight streams. It's not that bad. Yeah, two weeks of raids, but like, it's not that bad, right? Between eight and ten. Yeah. Four weeks, basically. Yeah, four weeks raiding twice a week. Like, I tried to, I tried to keep it... Um... You know, I tried to keep it fairly mixed up, I guess, with other things. You know what I mean? Like, I tried to keep it varied with the content. Like, sometimes we did a little bit of MSQ. Sometimes we did some side stuff. I think I think that was, like, a good way to do it, I suppose. It was a little bit despair. But we got through it. And then the last tier, I think we did the entire last tier in, like, two weeks. Or two and a half, maybe. Right? But we also had, like, a bunch of DDoSing going on in that. Raid streams are when I'm the most productive at writing code. Yeah, because, like, you can kind of zone out for a little bit more. I think, I, I, honestly, I expected the raid streams to go worse in terms of, like, viewership and stuff like that. Sometimes chat slows down a little bit. But as long as chat's not, like, sitting still, then I'm, I'm f kind of fine. Like, as long as I've got th things to read and things to, like, go off and, uh, like, have a conversation with. Sometimes I'm, like, I feel like I owe my concentration to the group and sometimes i'm like yeah like now if we're just like getting back to our prog point like kind of chat shit a little bit you know what i mean so i think like balancing the two is usually it's pretty fine i think and it's not like i'm just sat there like in silence like playing the game like i think we i think the raid streams had a better dynamic than i kind of i don't know not 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 than i expected i suppose just like i'm, I'm glad with the dynamic they had i guess yeah yeah, last two went real quick. So yeah, I'm, I'm glad you guys watched the Rage. Like, a lot of people obviously probably didn't watch the Rage streams or weren't as interested in them. But like, they're obviously like a temporary thing while we're on that. That's like the current like obstacle we're trying to overcome or like goal we're trying to hit or something like that, right? So I'm glad people stick around for them. I think like the way I do it is 
like rather than be like oh okay we're just gonna be like no lifing alex for like four weeks straight or something people might just be like right, i'm just gonna take a month for watching the stream whereas like if we're varying it up i think people was, can remain like invested in the stream as a whole even if raiding is not like their cup of tea you know what i mean which is nice DM your own roadmap. Want to change anything? So this is the roadmap I made like... Is it like six months ago? Right, so this is what? April, June, August, September, December, January, March, April, May, slash July. So yeah, this is April starting 3.5 onwards up to 4.0 in June. Wait. Okay. And then it thinks I'm doing... Wait! Raid in August? 4.5 in September. Well, that one's kind of copium. That one's copium, I think. To December, Shadowbringers. Raid in January. 5.5 in March. Or May. Yeah, no, March. And then April slash May, Endwalker. So, April slash May, Endwalker. Endwalker raid in July. September 2025 Dawn Trail. <laughs> what do you think? I think this would most likely be June. I don't know. Well, it could be July, actually. Wait, I was kind of... Just for us, truest MSQ timeline on the internet. <laughs> you can do this soon. This is... I was pretty accurate. I... Honestly, this is better than I thought. This is actually better than I thought... Like, th than I thought I predicted. I want to watch Ross cook the 12th of this tier since I'll find it hilarious. We'll see when Shadowbringers starts. Okay, I've predicted Shadowbringers December. This is not bad, guys. If you don't do Eureka Boja, most likely I'm going to treat Eureka Boja similar to, like, Palace. I'll probably set aside some time at some point to do them, but it's not like a I have to do this before moving on kind of thing. Same with ultimates, right? Like uh I'm treating like Palace, Eureka Boja, uh the Ultimates, like those are content which like I don't feel like I have to beat before I can move on kind of thing. It's not in my That's illegal. Wait, does it have to be done? Rip the schedule if he does Eureka. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. I'll, I'll give it a try and see if it's something I want to, like, complete. Or set, like, how long it'll take or something like that, right? Why three months between 4.5 and Shadowbringers? Um, good question. I don't know. I think that probably meant, like, up to patch 4.5. Like, this probably means, like, 4.0 to 4.5. So it probably means like 4.0 patch content starts in September and finishes in December. But, but it definitely wouldn't take that long. Yeah, or maybe it was Yukob. Yeah, I don't remember. We'd have to find the VOD. We'd have to find the culprit of the VOD. I don't know if we have a date on this screenshot, but then we could hunt down the VOD, you know? It's good group content. Yeah, yeah. I'd, oh, yeah, I definitely want to try it for sure. But it's not something I, I'm like, I need to beat or like 100% complete or something before moving on. We'll see how it goes. That is, I don't really know much about Eureka Boja, so I don't really know how to approach it. You know? Same with, like, Palace. I feel like you, I can do that at any point, really. Same with, like, Hildy, for example. Never done it. Don't know what they are. Yeah, same. Don't know. What's up, uh, Boga? September 2025. Copium? I don't think that's Copium. I don't think that's Copium, guys. So, like, we'll finish Dawn Trail, end of 2026. That We'll see. We'll see, right? We'll see. Remember, Alex was probably the savage raid that was, like, 
the clunkiest from what people told me, right? So we'll we'll have to we'll have to see how it goes. Uh, wait, I didn't get through all these screenshots here. Oops. This is giving me kind of similar vibes to uh. Uh, what's it called? You know the the Yasail music. Uh, what's it called? Like the the shrine, like the sanctuary music in Heaven's Sword. You know, with the bagpipes, like at Mogholm and stuff. Me. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Good night, Russ. And uh, chat. Good night, tongue. Sleep well. Sleep well. Early bedging. Oh shit. Couple from over two hours ago before the storm blood. Early arrivers. Oh shit. Wait, two hours ago? Jesus. Damn. The early arrivers. Early gang's been there ages, man. Here's some samurai. Look at those guys. Oh, we got a red mage to balance it out with doula. Cats just keep on winning. Plus one cat. Plus one cat. Rifles joins the mix. Voss. Flexing the mount. Oh, yeah. How'd you get that? Whoa. Whoa. Yeah. All right. There you go. The final screenshot. Binoculars. I'm late, but hello. What's up, Beam Mame? Hello, hello. Second Nine Tails in the line. Oh, yeah. Wait. You're on. Uh, you got to bring your NA character today, right, Frostbite? We're looking respectfully, guys. <laughs> right. What a stream, guys. What a stream, man. That was fun. Do, 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 do. Um. Let's do. Get the puff puff. Is it time to do a pylon? You guys can do a pylon if you want. Yeah. Is that is that a tradition? All right. Let's do the pylon. If that's what you guys meant when uh, Kev was asking, yeah. Yippee! Let me get my hood on. This is what you guys are waiting for. Yay! Build additional pylons. Yippee! Thank you for standing back beforehand, I guess. <laughs> I didn't know I didn't know you guys were waiting to do this. <clears throat> I'll always flex the mount, except for in the lineup. The pretty dog was too that was a nice dog, guys. Solitaire stands strong with the dog. Yay! My eyes! Sorry, sorry. Celebratory rave time. We can do a celebratory rave. We can. I have the perfect one for you guys.
Yippee! We made it to Stormblood! We made it before Dawn Trail, baby. Wait. Streams left. Blah, blah, blah. Who cares? We did it! Not quite in the prediction, but within the other prediction that Kaffir said. So, I mean, hey. Prove me wrong. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Ah, feels good, man. Feels good. Blah. Do, do, do. Thank you guys for always watching the streams. Thank you guys for coming and showing support in game. Thank you guys for supporting the stream financially. Thank you to all the new followers. Appreciate you guys. Feel free to follow if you're new, by the way. Thanks just for watching. Even if you've never chatted before in a stream, ever, and you never intend to, I see you, and I appreciate you. Now shut up and spam Pedro. Hi, I'm new. Nice plate. Hold. Ah, I haven't heard this one in a while. I haven't heard this one in a little bit. Classic. It's a classic tune, man. Woo! Wiggle around! Hey, what is my plate right now? Oh my god! Look down. True. Nice. That's not sus. Well, I'm just at the beach, man. Look. I'm at the beach, man. Whoa, buddy. <laughs> Sir. I'm at the beach. What? You can see the waves in the background and stuff. I'm just looking for my towel so I can cover up. Yeah. Look down. Yeah. Like, so it's not look up, you know? Nobody here saw any waves. We only make waves here. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Mm -mm. You're right. I have no room to talk. Jamantis, where are you? Mm -mm 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 -mm. Hey, look, Rosie's G-posing right now. Look how happy she is. Uh, what we're listening to for the Vod Frogs? Oh, sorry. For the Vod Frogs and for Mean Cupcake, we're listening to 1035 by Tiesto and Tate McRae. Hi, VOD frogs. Hopefully, you enjoyed this VOD. Better than when. Wait, there's another chase. There's another chase and say chase and say song. I. I might want to listen to. Hold up. Mm 
You want the classic? You guys want the classic? Future time. I can hear it. I just want to be nice for the vo- Oh, okay, okay. I thought you were sneakily asking for the song name, you know? <sighs> for you guys. Ah, shit. Would it- Wait. We're going VIP now, okay? We're going VIP. When's Freestyler? Oh. Dude, Freestyler is an absolute banger. All right, we're going VIP. Heaven Sword, no longer mid, guys. Stormblood, I have a good feeling. Stormblood's going to be better than Heaven Sword. Yeah, there I said it. But the VOD frogs were listening to Badder Than VIP Rick's remix by Chase and Stas. Okay. Is Freestyle a finish? I did not know that. Yo, Big Red. Not even the classic anymore, Stormcrow. Big Red. Thank you for the four months. 120 days of sus rust. Been lurking today. Russ's restraining order ain't meant shit to me. <laughs> hey, you can come in here anytime you want, Big Reddy, okay? You can come on over. I'd even give you huggies, all right? There ain't no restraining order. Thank you for the four months. Welcome back. Mm, 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 mm. Base so filthy, we need to shower. You like the peepo? Hell yeah. Why Choco not dancing? Mm, 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 mm. Oh, yeah, shit, right. It's at the end. At the end of that set, uh, Bumble, that you linked me. Oh, no. Sorry, that I linked, but you've seen, right? And it's like, he rewinds Badder Dan like four times. <laughs> Did you get the hair trim? This is my current hair, guys. Woo! Hell yeah, brother! <laughs> We went, we went short, we went mullet mode, dude. Oh yeah, baby. Sighty cleaned up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Looks like a trailer park boy. Only for you, Ponto. <sighs> Even the great Russ suffers the dent. Look, I fixed it now, okay, guys? There we go. Oh, my God. <laughs> Slab, please. Oh, my God. I forgot about that emote and that fucking video, bro. So good. But, yeah, that's what we're rocking right now, Big Red. I went for the summer cut. Try something new, you know? With a rocket launcher. So I guess they just recorded two versions. Right? And then they... Uh, he just kept one secret for ages, right? Or they kept one secret. It's all about the toots. True. True. I'm thinking I might dye this blonde as well. I'm not sure. I'm not 100% sure yet. Uh, what was that other really nice Chase to say a song that I heard? Like, I hadn't... Do, 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 do. Is it called, uh, Selector? Oh, there's liquor and cigarettes as well. 
That was pretty good. I can't remember which one was better out of these two. Liquor and cigarettes. Yeah, Frosted Tips rust for summer, right? It makes sense, right? Oh, yeah. This one's nice. Please. Weed and rum. I don't know if I know that one. Get ready, guys. Get ready. Switch. More pictures. Oh, shit. Here we are. Happy girl. We don't rave enough recently. Oh, yo. Look at this. This could be a desktop background. Nintendo Switch. <laughs> Why won't it open in the right browser here? Look at the ravers. How do you get that disco ball going? You're on the pick. Oh, yeah, look. Air horn in the background for good measure. Oh, nice, Cammy. Mom, I'm on TV. That's some main character screenshot. This one? <laughs> Life of the party. Oh, God. I put a VOD on the TV while cooking dinner for background noise, and then it got really quiet, and I thought it glitched, so I peeked at the TV, and I saw 75 inches of this staring at me. <laughs> Who that, though? Who that, though? I don't know. Favorite Heaven Sword screenshot. Tongue, Volps, and Feline. Looking at Zenith. Bom, 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 bom. Thanks for the screenshots, guys. This is nice. Mm -mm 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 Nice. <laughs> nice. How did you get them to pop out so much on this? Zip off, puff. I really like this, uh, the top you have, Rocky. Like, Yuki had it over there as well. Yuki's just meditating. Glow six out. 
Oh, Akito is grooving over there. It's on your Sam. Yeah. I guess it's like a quest item or something, right? <laughs> <laughs> Booba, dude. I mean, that's me. I'm pretty sure that's Sai. So angry. I'm rolling my eyes. I'm like ready to go. But look, he copied me, right? Babonkers, dude. At some point next week, we might have to do the photo album stream. We may have to. Do, 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 do. Uh, where did I put this? Ah. <sighs> Here we go. <laughs> Looking at the memories. Exactly, yeah. Yeah, the little uh, Heaven Sword retrospective of screenshots. What's up, Amber? We are uh, oh, we're just looking through some screenshots. We're doing some raving. We're checking out our new lizards. Yeah, Vod Frogs, we're listening to Miracle Makeup by Dom Dollar. What other moves have I got? I need to buy some other moves. How the friends? You're all good. Semi free. You know what I've decided, guys? I've decided this year I'm going to buy some decks. And I don't mean the dog. And I'm going to learn how to mix more stuff to do. Oh, it's going to be like a hobby thing, you know? Decks leveling. <laughs> oh, I'm going to buy some decks and I'm going to start. I'm going to start learning how to do some mixing and do some DJing. Yep, exactly. Imagine leveling decks. Scene in game. Yeah, I know. I know. I'm not going to do like, I'm not going to like join the scene. I'm not going to join like the DJing scene as like a streamer. I'm just going to learn. Like, I just, I just want to do it as a hobby, you know? I want to like do some amateur beginner DJing, you know? And maybe one day I'll put on a set for you guys. DJ stall, baby! <laughs> Yeah. You do it, Keo? Nice, nice. Yeah, I'm gonna I wanna I wanna learn how to do some DJing and stuff. And uh just in my free time as like a hobby thing. Like I play other games off stream. This would just be instead of playing some other games at some point, you know, like I just do some like DJing in my free time, chill. And when I feel like I'm confident and okay-ish enough, I might do like a special stream where we'll, I'll put on like a club night and I'll DJ for you guys. 
I think like at least for like part of a set, like at least do a set, right? For like a part of it. I think that could be like a cool thing. But only like, and there's no time thing on this. It's just something that like, if I get decks and if I learn and if I feel comfortable, there's a lot of uh, ifs and dependence things on it, right? But that could be fun. Yeah, we could do, put on a little club FC club thing. That would be cool. Like, I don't want to get into it as like a FFDJ or anything. Just could be a fun little thing to do on the side, you know? Store the drop. Yeah, yeah, I'll just uh, rewind it right before the drop every time. How long can you make us wait for the drop, dude? <laughs> just like get right up there and then... Where you right wind it back, dude. You just started DJing explains the chase and status and Dom Dollar. Yeah, nice. What what uh what decks do you got, um, Doctor on the Moon? Actually, you too, Keo. I've been told to get um Hold. DJ DDJ 400. This is the one I've been told by like multiple people to get. Oh, that's the one you have as well. Yeah. <laughs> so I might I might grab some of these at some point this year. I heard this was like a good starting one, and then you can like move up into something something bigger and better, right? But it's got basically everything you need to start out. And I, I think they're not too expensive either, right? Where to buy? Hold. Uh, I don't know if that's going to like dox me or some shit. So. Um, right. Just bring up a fucking map, bro. <laughs> Wish I was creative enough to make music. Well, there's a difference between like producing and like mixing, right? So, like, producing is, like, actually making the music. That's quite hard. But, like, mixing, I don't think it's, like, probably too complicated. You're kind of, like, mixing already made music at similar speeds to one another. And just kind of, like, mixing aspects of them together to make something that's so somewhat <laughs> unique to you, right? Which is kind of cool. So, I I'm about... I could be as... I could be creative enough to do that. But probably not to, like, produce music. Like, you know, where they have, like, the the software where they make the drum beats and then they make all the, like, chords and make the, like, themes and make the build-ups and the drops and stuff. I couldn't do that, I think. It's good to see people start hobbies. Yeah, I, I, I just want to, like... Because right now my hobbies are, like... Well, streaming is, like, a hobby that turned into a job. And then, like, gaming... It's like a hobby that I, I just play different games. I game in like a different way off stream, I suppose. So like I've got like, I, I wouldn't even say like, like gaming is my work. It's like streaming is my work. It's kind of different, but gaming is like the attitude towards that, right? DS2 will come. I really do want to... I, I've thought about it multiple times this week to turn on the stream, Mario. But then I've been like, should I be doing other productive things? And that's what stopped me. Because like when I play DS2, I play for like eight hours, you know? <laughs> Maybe over the weekend. We'll see. We'll see. Yeah, they're cozy, right? They're good. Roban's thinking... Oh, yeah, we should probably go hand into Roban, right? Alt channel link. Uh, here you go. I haven't streamed on it in ages, though. Bye, Voss. Thanks for being here, man. Appreciate the sub gifts as well earlier. Appreciate you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Night all time to leave for work. And piss chat there as well. All right, should we go say hi to Ralban real quick? Or should we leave that for next time? Is it going to do a cutscene? Because I feel like a lot of people kind of left at this point. And I feel like maybe that would be disrespectful. I don't know. can't remember. Like, I think people thought we were kind of... Yeah, wait. I'll just wait with it. I'll just wait with it. It's all good. Yeah, we'll do it at the start of next MSQ. 
Right. Um, I think uh, it's getting quite late. It's getting late for me. It's 10 p.m. I haven't eaten since breakfast. Uh, a lot of people are finishing work and going home as well. So I think I might follow suit, guys. Good stream, though. Good stream, okay? Thank you for being here. As I said, good vibes. Appreciate the new followers. Thanks for watching the MSQ. Thanks for watching everything in between the MSQ as well. I know uh, I'm trying my best to make everything I do in the game interesting. I'm hoping that it's interesting to you guys. If not all of it, at least a good portion of it. I know a lot of FF streamers or people that play who have streamed this game in the past have, uh, you know, just focused on MSQ. I'm specifically trying not to. I feel like cats that is paying off at the moment. And I'm glad that you guys are here because without you guys, I would really be nothing, you know, like uh, I would just be fucking sitting here by myself talking to myself, you know, so really uh, you guys make the stream at the end of the day, you guys make the stream, you know, I just read your comments in chat and, and say stupid stuff. That's it. That's it. It's very simple. Welcome to the last free expansion. Yeah. Thank you, guys. I appreciate you. Okay, have a good night, you lovely people. Thanks for the stream. Thank you for being here, guys. I'm going to get some stuff done at the weekend, and we'll be back on Monday. Holy lobbers. Honestly, it's you guys. I couldn't do this without you. Seriously. Yeah, that was awesome, Custard. Welcome into the stream, and welcome to the game, actually. You're kind of you're actually really new to the game, so, yeah. People leave. Why are you people leaving? What? All right, guys. Good stream, okay? Good stream, okay? Good little rave at the end as well. I'm going to give you over to a nice man who's full of content and a very good attitude, okay? His name... Oh my god, he's finishing. God damn it, dude. <sighs> he just raided someone. God damn it, dude. Okay. I'm going to give you... I was going to send you to free. Uh... All right, instead, I'm going to send you to Rook in that case, all right? She's playing Final Fantasy IX, all right? So I'm going to instead send you to Rook, all right? Rukuri, she's a, I believe she's a caster for, like, Crystal in Conflict and stuff, usually streaming FF and things. So hopefully you will enjoy her stream, all right? Um, I'll be back Monday, like I said. Thank you very much. As I said, guys, thank you for all the follows. If you're lurking, appreciate you. Feel free to follow if you're new. Join the Discord. Custard, I want to see you join that Discord, okay? All right. Yeah, get more involved, everybody. Join the Discord. Make some friends and stuff. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys Monday, all right? Go say hi to Rook. Even if you got other things to go do, just drop a little smiley face in the chat before you head off. I right? would appreciate that very, very much. Post all the pictures in the disc and make some friends. Join voice, all that good stuff. All right. Have a great week. Great weekend, everyone. Have a great rest of your day. All right. And I'll see you guys Monday. Okay. Hope you enjoyed the deepest V-neck v on the internet. All right. Because it'll be a while since you see it again. Till you see it again. All right. Guys. <laughs> Booba, <laughs> the deepest V you can get. All right, I'll see you guys Monday. All right, thank you as always. Have a great weekend, and as always, peace.